right on right on right on <clears throat> sorry i think the volume on this is going to be way too loud right now for you guys i'm is it too loud someone let me know <clears throat> oh my god dude i've come to the conclusion that i've for sure been sick the last like four days and i just didn't let myself realize it but i'm finally getting like today's the first day i didn't wake up with like a massive headache so i think that's a really good start i hope you guys are all having a really good night uh i'm feeling a lot better than i was the last few days it was like the sickness i was feeling was like coming and going so i'm excited to be here tonight this is a game i've had in my my uh in, well i guess you want to call it my wish list for a long time and i'm finally excited to play it so we're gonna play some i am fish today um i want to thank ben solo for the light goal thank you for making the light goal for me hope you guys all had a wonderful monday i actually saw a little bit of the eclipse today i didn't see much of it i didn't have glasses so i didn't like look at it but i um i watched what happened to the ground <laughs> and then i saw a lot of stuff online about it so it's really good to be here tonight so hello it's crazy because like this is one of the games i've had in my uh i've had wish listed for a long time and i was like i wanted to play this for like i've heard this is like a like a puzzle game it's like a physics-based puzzle game that can really make you frustrated because some of the levels are very hard because like you're trying to like you're in like different containers and like you're trying to hop in one body of water to another body of water so i really thought about like i don't want it to be too frustrating so we'll see how things go but hey sophia i really hope you're doing so good sophia i hope you're doing so good huh wait no way wait sophia bellamy likes this game oh no way that makes me so happy um i watched like sophia i've watched a lot of people play this game i've seen a lot of, a lot of uh um i've seen a lot of gameplay of this already but like not like too much for i'm gonna spoil it for myself but enough for i knew that i'd like it i think i just don't want to get oh man nighthawk thank you for the gifted memberships i just went live dude <laughs> thank you so much for the gifted man are we doing all right today thank you so 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 much Nighthawk, you're the best. Hello, uh, hello, Allie. Hello, um, Clunkity, Lan, Capybara, Buffwa, Concraft. Uh, hello, Ashley. Um, hello to Patch Patch Gaming. Hello to Ash. Welcome to the stream. What up, Ash? Nighthawk, welcome. Ava, hello. Aiden, hello. Eric, hello. Uh, Ben Solo, hello. All right, I'm gonna also get the membership myself today. It was crazy, man. Last night we I streamed the Pokemon TCG. We got close to 67 subscribers in one stream last night. Just from playing the TCG. I didn't realize that. I think we're only like uh, 40 subs away from 30,000 right now. So it might not happen today, but maybe it'll happen this week. We had 67 people sub yesterday from my my uh, my my vertical stream I did. I did I, there's no way that was that was the reality. Is Pokemon TCG a lot bigger than I thought it was? Is everyone out here playing it? I didn't realize that. I was like looking at analytics yesterday and we got like 67 subs just from yesterday's stream. But that like never happens for one stream. That's pretty crazy. But this is a very cute game about uh, you're a fish trying to go from one body of water using other objects that can hold water in them and, and rolling around in them and getting to another body of water. It's it looks really fun. I've wanted to play it for a long time, so I'm excited that we can I can share it with you guys tonight. Should be an adventure. Hello, Stephanie. Steph, how are you? <laughs> I hope the the new dog, go, you know, doing his business was OK. I know, dude. The Pokemon community is really crazy, Ava. Um, hello, Sarah. Welcome to the stream. What's up, Sarah? All right, I'm actually going to get the membership. Um, I heard that there's one level in this game. I don't know, Sophia. I don't know if you've seen it, but one of the levels I heard on one of the reviews I read, it was like inappropriate. And I'm like, this is a game that looks like it's made for kids. Like, how can there be a level that's inappropriate? Is that true? I can't imagine there's like a, anything inappropriate in this game, but I guess we'll see. Oh, uh, he's sleeping against Steph. That's adorable. 
Show him some love for me. Tell him he's a very good boy for me, okay? Bingo. If you guys got a gifted membership from Nighthawk, or if you guys get a gifted membership for myself, you can get access to all the member channels in my Discord. Um, you can get access to all the member VCs. You can get access to all the member stuff that I have in there that you know members can take advantage of. Um, you get access to all the YouTube emojis. Uh, I'm actually going to be adding three emojis. I changed my mind about the three I was going to add a few days ago. I didn't like them as much, but I didn't add them to the channel. But I'm going to be adding three new emojis uh, probably this week before the Avatar update comes out for uh, for Fortnite. I think tomorrow morning you can start playing. You can they they confirmed today that Zuko, Toph, and Katara are going to be purchasable characters, I believe, in the shop tomorrow. So if I read the correct thing, so I'm going to be checking that out tomorrow. I'm going to be buying Toph, and I'm for sure going to be playing some Fortnite tomorrow. If we can play as Toph, I'm going to for sure play it. I think they're going to be adding earthbending, firebending, and airbending tomorrow. So I'm in, we'll, we'll, we're going to play some more Fortnite tomorrow for sure. That's going to be very exciting. Did you, Buffwa? I'm excited to... Uh, I've been taking a little break from um, normal or bossa style. Left stick is to swim around, and then bossa style is hold the trigger and flap the right stick. I'm not trying to have this be hard. I've heard this game is hard enough. I'm going to go normal for my first playthrough. Wow, they have an iron fish mode. There's normal fish mode and there's iron fish mode. Okay, go normal. And I think this game has voice acting too, which is kind of cool. It does. Here, let me adjust the volume a little bit. Bob. Yeah. Good, thanks. Hey? Oh, sorry about that. Um, sausage roll, please. How about some of my specialty bread? Baked fresh this morning. Uh, no. Just a sausage roll, thanks. Oh, I insist. Piss on the house. Uh, I hope this game is not too hard. Okay, sure. Whatever. He said sausage roll, please. Throw on the house. Sorry, we're all out. Sausage roll, please. Oh, bloody hell. Can't eat that now. I love the English accents. Bloody hell, mate. Oh, bloody hell. Sausage roll. I still have the other loaf. I can't say sausage roll and like with a, a, you know, English accent. Bloody hell, mate. All right, so it looks like we start off at the pet shop. These are the main characters. This game reminds me of like Finding Nemo, but a more derpy version of it. That's so cute. Wait, why is the bread like just like disappearing? Wow. You all really like that bread, eh? The piranha is my favorite character. Out of all these, the piranha is my favorite so far. I like the blue fish too. They're all kind of cute. Okay. I've also heard that this game takes a little bit of getting used to, so I guess it's going to kind of show me the controls here. Oh, dude, this is so cool. So, like, RT is the move up, LT is the move down. You move the camera, and then you can swim around the fish tank. This is cool. Is this, like, part of the tutorial where it's probably just going to teach me how to play the game a little bit? This is very cute. I really can't believe, Sophia, that your, uh, your son en enjoys this game already, because this came out a long time ago on Xbox. And when I first bought my Xbox, this is one of the first games I saw in there that I was like, ooh, I should probably buy this game. That sounds like a, it'd be a good time. But then later, like, we leave the fish tank, and then we get to, like, uh, try to traverse the world in, like, uh, different, like, like jars and coffee mugs. And you get to roll around and, like, try to avoid people. It looks really, really cool. And 
And the music is actually pretty good, too. Yeah, this is like Finding Nemo 2.0. That's what it feels like, at least. Hello, Govna. <laughs> yeah, the reason I bought it today, Sophia, it was like uh, it was like six dollars on Steam. It was like six dollars on Steam, or no, it was six dollars on Xbox. And uh, I like was going through my wish list today. I'm like, are there any games that I wanted to play on on stream that I haven't played before? And then this game just like popped up for me, and I was like, this one has always looked cute, and I've always wanted to try streaming it. See, so yeah, I think this is where we all get separated. And then the main part of the game is uh, all of us, I think, coming back together and being reunited, I believe. Ah. Makes me sad. And I think, oh, wow. This is so cool. So I'm guessing the first, the, maybe the, the first level is us going to be escaping from the pet store and then trying to find our way to like, and then we like slowly like regroup with the rest of our friends. That's kind of cool, actually. I'm in, I'm in for a treat. Thank you. Okay, the first level is called the Ocean Beckons. I have no score, no high score yet. If you guys could do me any favors today, though, if you guys would ever consider dropping a like on the stream, that that's the easiest way to help my channel. Uh, we're like 40 subs away from 30,000 subs, so we're very close to hitting it. It's possible we hit it today, depending on how things go. Wow, we got separated. We're like just put in this small fishbowl now. That's so sad. Ah. He's going to realize that the bull can move. This is where he realizes it. Wow, that's so cool. So this is where we're like able to finally start like moving the bowl around. But I've also heard, so I guess we'll try this just in case. Uh, I, I don't want to. I want to try it now before I try it later. But I think we're able to like roll off the edge here, right? And then I think the I think we can. Like, let's just try this. I've heard the physics can be a little bit tricky and a little bit, like, uh, annoying in this game, so we'll see if that's true or not. I, I, I guess I wouldn't say annoying. I would just say that um, sometimes people... Oh, wow, yeah. See, like, this game has a really good physics system. You see how, like, I'm trying to, like, uh, stop my inertia and it won't let me? You get the momentum. This is so cool. Okay, I guess the maybe the bowl isn't able to be, like, can't crack, you know? But it can certainly fall on the ground. <laughs> it's just, bro, it's so cool to be rolling around. Hopefully that doesn't open and we're going to spill all the water out. That, that would be bad. Hey, Rob. Oh, it can crack, Sophia? It can crack, huh? Oh, no. So do you have to, like, fall off something that's tall enough and then maybe it's going it, to, it's capable of cracking the bowl then? This bowl can crack, huh? Okay, then I guess when you if you if you when you press Y, is there like a way to check the controls? Sophie, I need Bellamy to come over here and uh, teach me how to play. So 
So if you, does, does Bellamy do like tutoring for games like this? Is there any way I could like just like offer him like, you know, how much per hour would he could put charge me to tutor me in uh, I Am Fish? Does he have like an hourly rate? Because I'm not trying to, but I'm guessing if you crack the fishbowl, then I'm, I'm assuming that the, the level would just restart then, right? You're not going to flop around like an idiot. Oh, wow. Look at that. Okay. Oh my God. <laughs> Am I supposed to come? I think I'm supposed to come down here. This is probably what's supposed to happen. Because it almost seems like that's supposed to lead down here. And it happens in a manner where I'm not going to crack the whole bowl overall, you know? But I think we're going to be okay. I think that's going to... Oh, wow. And this will lead us to the great beyond. I think that was supposed to happen. I believe that was supposed to happen. All right. Cool. You know, Maddie, I was going to watch the solar eclipse. I don't have glasses, though, for it. So I was going to watch today, but I didn't have any glasses. So I, I just I didn't really watch the solar eclipse today. Um, I like was awake and I saw the ground change to like a darker color. You know, it was like more. It seemed like it was very overcast outside. And then I also. Um, it seemed like it was overcast for a one. So I saw that and then I saw that. Um, I watched a lot of like Twitter videos of it and stuff, which is not the same, but it still worked out. <laughs> okay, so it looks like if you hold RT, you swim towards the top of the glass and it kind of it kind of gives you more momentum. So if you want to like change the weight, the direction that you're moving, that's a good way to do that. I feel it looks like I still don't really understand. Okay, that swims up, that swims down. <laughs> Do I do I test what happens if we just fall in the cement? Let's just see what happens here. <laughs> Can you, you, oh my god, that's so cool! So you you are capable of cracking the bowl. That is so cool. That means nobody blew up a petrol station. I was just I was like, is there a way to do that? And there is. Hmm. <laughs> I like that there's a way to actually, so you're actually Kate. That's cool, Sophia. Let's try it again. We can swim down, we can swim up. So I wonder if like the harder control, uh, the, like the one, oh wow, okay. This is very tricky. I wonder if like the other uh, control, like the harder control scheme would make it a lot harder because I feel like it would. This is a really cute game. And it looks like I'm, I'm in like the San Francisco area. This is, this kind of looks like San Fran to me. I don't know about you guys. Ooh. And then it looks like it kind of depends on like where you land. So if you land on like a soft, a softer mat, it'll probably cushion your fall then, right? That's what it looked like it happened to me right there. Cause if I would have landed on like the, on like the roof, I think I would probably would have like actually, uh, that's crazy. This is a really, really cute game. Holy smoke. This is very cool. Yeah, I saw a picture today, actually, Maddie, of somebody who, uh, it was like a, a plane full of people, and they apparently were all flying to go see the eclipse, and I'm like, if you're going to take a plane to go see the eclipse, like, that's really, really dedicated, you know? So I saw that today. Like, one of the flight attendants was asking the people on the plane, like, who here is uh, flying to see the eclipse today? And, like, a bunch of them, like, raised their hands saying, you know, I'm flying to see the eclipse today. It's very cool. I thought that was really, really awesome. I mean, to be fair, I think I think I heard today it, like we're not going to have another solar eclipse like that for like 20 years. So I guess if you want to. Ooh, OK, 
this this is cool because I um I also heard there's like multiple ways to traverse the world. So there's not only one singular way to get around in this game. So if you want to if you want to find way other ways to get around, you can also do that too. So I don't think there's a, like, I think every level has like multiple different routes you can take to try to get to the end of the level, which is very awesome. I, I like that. I like how you can hear the um there's like people talking in the background too. That's awesome. I'm just a little fish. There's like there's like no way to pull a map up in this game, is there? That's like kind of like not awesome. There's like no map feature. Oh my lord. Okay, we're gonna have to evade this plan here. Yeah, so North America will be like it'll be a long time before we get another eclipse. I, didn't we have one like maybe like seven years ago though? There was like an eclipse like seven years ago, wasn't there? And I think I think I saw it here. That's kind of also why, like, I uh, I didn't really care to see today because I thought I thought we had one recently, like maybe like seven years ago. Dude, that's so. Oh my god, it's, I'm gonna die. No, I'm not. <laughs> this is so cool. I thought for sure I was gonna go down there. That's very. Th that's very. This game is very cool. The music is nice, but I know it gets a lot. I really like this game. This is a really cool physics game. Oh wow. Are we gonna die here though? There's cars. All right. Well, <laughs> so I guess at that point you have to basically play Frogger to get across the road. If your car gets hit by, if your fish gets hit by a car, then the the glass just shatters like Stone Cold Steve Austin. That this game is really cool. Very cool. That's really really cool. You'll be 55, Ellie. So wait, Ellie, you're 35 right now? I'll be 48. Hey, Doga, thank yeah, you so man. much for the super I chat, man. Nick, I appreciate it. Like I look like a fish? Oh my God, I can't. <laughs> this is so bad. Hey, Doga, thank you very much. I really appreciate you. Lots of love, man. All right, so the game plan for the for this here, we're gonna try to uh, wait out the one car that keeps running me over. We'll see if that helps. Thanks, Doga. I really appreciate you, dude. There's a lot of cars coming. How are we supposed to do this? There's no car coming that way. Stop, 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 stop. Roll, roll, roll. Oh, I'm dead. <laughs> oh we're so close that we're actually so close we're almost there we're almost there that's really fun sophia have you played this level i'm guessing you played all like almost all the levels right that's cool alley well happy early birthday i'll be 29 in uh, june this year cowabunga dude is that from Finding Nemo, Jessica? I think we're gonna make it now. Oh yeah, baby. <laughs> oh, this, this is a really cool game. Oh, hell yeah, baby. And I guess the problem is I don't even, I'm not really sure where to go from here. Holy moly. I think I'm stuck. Does it ever happen where you where you get stuck in this game and you can't move anywhere? How does this fish not have enough momentum? What if I swim towards the bottom? Will that provide me with enough momentum to get up on top of the... I think I legit need to get more momentum. I don't think I have enough right now. So what do I, what do, I do? I don't know how I'm supposed to get up here. Like, how do we keep swimming? Like, what do I, what's, what's the game plan? Oh, I can go around that. No, I can't. 
I think my fish is just actually stuck. I don't know what, what I'm supposed to do from this in this situation. Uh, I don't know what to do. Do we just like try to get a little more momentum and then just keep rolling? I think we got this actually right here. We got this right now. Ah, oh, buddy, come on. No, it can't be the road. I think we're supposed to go to the end of that pier, aren't we? Or maybe we are supposed to go on the road. Is that the is that the whole game plan? What I think I should be looking out for is like the little way the little waypoints. Yeah, I'm supposed to go in the ocean. That's that's gotta be it, right? I think I'm supposed to look out for waypoints here that like, oh, I'm gonna get run over. I don't see any waypoints. <laughs> Come on, little fishy. We're going to make it up, buddy. Me and you together, we're going to get this. Or we're not going to get this at all. Maybe we won't. Let's try to get... I'm waiting for a car to come and just absolutely annihilate me. We did it. All right, that puzzle was a little bit infuriating because they really made you get momentum. And like, if you're going to have this boardwalk right here, like, wouldn't you, this has got to be where I'm supposed to go, right? I was reading too that this game actually, oh, I can't go any further than this. Oh, is, is, is that raised up a little bit? Dude, what am I supposed to do? Is that raised up? A, like, how do, can I jump and maybe? So is that telling me that I'm not supposed to go on the pier? Is that like is that like a, like an inherent blocker that tells me I'm not supposed to go that way? So can I just drop in the water right here? Then is that is that what I'm supposed to do? I did it. That that was what I was supposed to do. You're supposed to just make it into the ocean. Cool. And then every level has like a certain amount of bread you're supposed to find. So like this this level had like, I think I found like four of the bread pieces out of the five. Okay, we did it. I was curious. That was really cool. All right, let's continue. That was very cool. So I was looking at the ocean and I'm like, that looks a little bit peculiar. We should take it home. We'll hide it in the loft so mom and dad don't find out. Wait, was that a random kid that picked me up? Was that a random kid that picked me up? I'm a little bit nervous now. Yeah, Capybara, isn't the Splatfest like next weekend too? I think we have a Splatfest like next weekend, I believe. I'm probably going to stream it for a little, like a while. I'm leaning towards uh, Team Team Bear though. Like the, okay, we're supposed, we're supposed to go that way. There's like a, a team with like a, it's like a baby bear. And that's the team that looks like the most, the most interesting for me personally. We'll go this way, or we won't. <laughs> so fall, falling off an object in in the attic here means instant death. So you can't fall off any attic objects. I don't know where to go then or what to do. Because even if I, if I fall off this way, isn't that, that's also going to be death. Hmm. Oh, there's boxes over there. 
You have to be very... Oh, look at over there, too. Was I supposed to drop him one of those bread... One of those boxes down there and get one of those breadcrumbs? Oh, I, I'm going to lose again. Damn. This game is really unforgiving. If you're not on your game, th this is a really unforgiving game. But in a good way. I like that it, it really makes you like be careful with your movement. And if you move the wrong way a little bit, you're just gonna you're just gonna be sent off the edge. I don't mind dying in this game. Cause every time you die you learn a little more about the level and it feels yeah, so we were supposed to we were supposed to go down from there and we were supposed to go this way. Such a cool idea, man. <laughs> me too uh, me too i'm with you ali fishy rolls on the edge my brain is holding like every time that i'm on the edge too i'm like it feels like i'm on like a tightrope and i'm about to like fall off the edge you know that's how it feels for me too we gotta name this guy what do you guys want to name this fish i'm thinking like andrew or I'm thinking like Patella. Or I'm thinking like uh, Salsa Verde. Or I'm thinking like uh, Anuran Hato. Isn't Anuran, uh, Anuran. I think I'm going to name him Anuran Hato. Uh, isn't that orange in uh, Spanish, I believe? We'll name him Anuran Hato. I saw this over here. It looked like I was supposed to roll this way, but I don't think I am. But why is there a light over here? Like, what? I think I'm supposed to fall into the attic here, and then this is gonna make me go into the house, right? Yes. But I, huh? But I cracked open. I don't understand. Everything about what I was doing felt so right, and then I, I fell into the, what the hell? Am I supposed to push the ladder down first? There's no, oh my God, there's no way. Dude, I know that wasn't a huge brain thing, but I just did. Oh, I might get, I might, maybe I'll get stuck here though. No, I'm not gonna get stuck here. Wow, that is so cool. That is really, really cool. That was a really cool physics moment right there. I think I'm about to fall off the edge there though. <laughs> I really appreciated that it let you make mistakes there, you know? It kind of it kind of let you it didn't really like force you to do the right thing right away <laughs> but i died there again that's unfortunate this is tricky as heck so it, it made me move the ladder first and then what's cool about this game is it, it kind of like makes you look for like checkpoints and that kind of gives you an idea of where you should probably be heading towards first. Like, you see that 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 shell right there? I, I probably wouldn't know to go that way, but the shell kind of guides you, which really is helpful. Oh, no, mother of God. <laughs> this is a really cool game. We'll bring it back. <laughs> Hey, Chris, I hope you're doing really good tonight, dude. I really hope you're doing good tonight. Hello, Nani Juice. Nani, hope you're doing wonderful today. Hello to Ava. Hello to Ash. Hello to Maddie. What's up, Maddie? Hello, Shelly. Well, Shelly, the sounds of this fishbowl breaking and glass shattering and flying everywhere hopefully will uh, ease your mind tonight. <laughs> or maybe it won't. I don't know. I feel like that's not going to be the most like restful thing to listen to is listening to me play a fish game with the bowl shattering, but you never know. I will say it's a really it's a really fun game, though. And the problem is, do you guys see how I'm rolling around in a bowl right now? Um, all the in the future, like later in the game, I, I lose the bowl and there's like different objects that have like different like, oh, my God, no way. We land on the trampoline. Oh, dude, that's so cool. No, that's not even the end of the level. 
that's not even the end of the level so i'm surprised that i never heard about like uh bellamy playing this game you know i'm surprised that i never heard about bellamy playing this what do i do from here i'm in the water and there goes my webcam can i bring that back and bring that back this game is really cool Ooh, there's a there's a sewer right here i can really appreciate the game because it make it, it lets you have that sense of exploration and it lets you have that sense of i'm not sure where to go next but it doesn't really hold your hand too much <laughs> oh my god, that is crazy. <laughs> now we're in the sewers. Hey, Draco, I cannot even tell you how much I appreciate that. I can't even tell you how much I appreciate you. Thank you for being so awesome. Thanks for being such a good friend. Thanks for being so supportive. You didn't have to do that, Draco. Thank you so much. You did not have to do that. Oh, I'm going to die. Thank you so, so, so much. If you guys want to do me a favor, can we get some, like, big hearts in chat for Draco? Would you guys mind dropping a lot of hearts in chat for Draco for me? Do I have to hop over that? Would you guys mind, like, just show her a bunch of love for me, okay? Drop, drop some hearts. Oh, you do. There's a breadcrumb right there. This is going to require me to have a special set of skills that I do not possess. And I do not understand how to get or possess. So I think what we have to do is swim down. And when we swim up, we're able to hop out of the water. Yep, that's how you do it. Dude, this is a really awesome game. That's how we're supposed to do it, though. Please show her a bunch of love, okay? And it would mean a lot to me. <laughs> this is going to take us some, probably multiple attempts to pull off, but hopefully we can do it. Hey, El... Hey, El Papa. You know, I was thinking about streaming that, uh, what's it called? The Lightyear game you were playing for a while? I was really thinking about playing that on stream today, but I, I, I got this today instead. That wasn't bad. Draco, thank you very much one more time. I really, really appreciate you. I, you, you did not have to do that. I, I hope you know that. I love having you here either way, so you don't ever have to be a member. I, I know. Just thank you. And then um, I was reading some stuff about the game, and apparently if, like, there's, like a, like, a lot of games, like, if you explore a little bit, there's more than one way to finish the level. So sometimes you can, I think maybe even I can swim up these. Like, let me just see if this is possible. Can I swim up these? You certainly cannot do that. Wow, is that like a needle? Wait, guys, we just got stabbed. Oh my God, we have hepatitis C. My, my fish just got stabbed by a needle. Oh my God, we just died. We just died of hepatitis. We just we just died from we just died from the newest the newest uh, horrible 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 uh I don't know I think my, I think my fish just got uh a tetanus shot but the tetanus shot ended up killing him th at the same time <laughs> dude there's no way you can like accidentally bump into a needle and the needle like stabs you like that there's no way right I didn't know that was possible and I, you can get you can get stuck in a cup. And you can get stuck in a cup. That is actually hilarious. And then you die. So you have to avoid all those st like stuff in the water. Like you can get you can get you can get hepatitis C. You can get stuck in a cup. That's all the stuff that can happen to you. I never knew that. Ah, uh, Sarah, you're seriously such a nice person. <laughs> Your fish has a drug problem. Hey, hey, hey! He's going to rehab. <laughs> Ash, where do you think I'm swimming to, bro? What do you think I'm swimming to? Just let 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 it take its course. We're swimming to the the rehab facility right now. He's got a he's got kind of a drug problem. He's got a needle problem. He's got a drug problem. But we're swimming to the rehab facility. That's what the game's all about. 
called Fishy Goes to Rehab. He made it over. Along the way, he's made, he's kind of, you know, he's kind of fallen victim to his, to his vices, but it happens to all of us, you know, don't judge him. So it seems like you're able to, you, you can like flop out of the water for a certain period of time. But you can't flop out of the water too long. Hey, Sarah, thank you very, very much. You're seriously such a legend. I just like the fact that you're able to... Oh, wow, look at all the needles. And you know what's a cool, what's a cool feature too, Sophia? When you're under the water, the, the sound changes. Such a subtle thing, but it adds to the immersion in a huge way. It's such a minute detail, but it really does make the game so much better. Where, where do we go from here? All right, little fishy, we're going to get you to rehab. I know you got a big problem. You got a lot of... We got to avoid all those needles. Look at the pollution that we're causing to pour these poor innocent fish in the ocean. Look at all the hepatitis C. You have all kinds of malaria. All kinds of drugs that are just floating through the system. You got the, you got the, the beer can things that hold them together. What do you call those things? Like the little little beer can strings. You got like random pieces of paper. You got blue solo cups. You got, it's just such a, it's such a sad thing to see, you know? Poor fishes. Poor fish. <laughs> needles with Nick? Please no, dude. <laughs> uh, I don't want to be known as Needles with Nick. Please no. I'm guessing we have to... Oh, I gotta, I gotta avoid this. I'm assuming, though, we have to get over that wall, right? Hold up. Did I, I gotta see if Sarah said anything in chat. I gotta see what Sarah said. I gotta tell her thank you again. I gotta find Sarah and give her a big fat hug. Thank you so, so much, Sarah. You're like... The, I really appreciate you very, very much. Can you drown? You can drown. Well, if you're out of water too long, you can drown, yeah. Just keep swimming. Just keep swimming. Just keep swimming. Just keep swimming. Bop, 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 bop. I don't know how to do this. You have to just go, you have to like just go down and then, oh, I'm stuck again. You can break out of that stuff though. So if you do get stuck by like a cup like that, you can break out of it, which is nice. Oh no. I think I'm doing it right. You're supposed to get over that wall, right? You gotta like swim over that wall and do it in such a precise way. Sophie, how did Bellamy beat this game? Your Bellamy's a, oh, we did it. Sophie, how the hell did Bellamy like beat this game? This is hard. <laughs> is Bellamy a gamer? Bellamy must be like a grade nine gamer. Like he must, he must be like a pro gamer. That looks like where I'm supposed to go, right? That seems like the end of the level area. Just keep swimming. Just keep swimming. Just avoid the obstacles. Find the end. Just keep swimming. Is this a secret area? Do I even try to go down there? Behind this, behind that little area looks kind of like a secret area. Do we try to go over there? Do I risk it for the biscuit? Oh, I should not have done that, should I have? Is this, like, not where I'm supposed to go? This has got to be a secret area, right? Oh, no, I'm, I'm for sure going to die. <laughs> no! <laughs> Come on, buddy, go! Oh, my God! Oh, I'm so dumb. I had the, I had the level beat and I had the whole level made and we just like stop. We just like ah, we ruined it. I had it made. We had the level beat, guys. Can I swim inside the pipe here? No, I can't. Dude, why did I have to like be ex explorative like that? 
it feels like every time in a game like this you're like oh i should go over here and check that out it's like it like ruins oh, it just ruins it you shouldn't do that that's not the way to go about it i really i think i really screwed myself <laughs> what do I do? <laughs> I don't know what to do here. I might have to restart. I might have to restart the level overall. We did it. Nope, I don't have to restart. Do we check that side though too? There's gonna be one of those like uh what do you call it? Like the Nah, I think we just keep let's just keep swimming. It seems like this is a drain you can swim down, right? Yep. Sophia, tell uh tell Bellamy I said he has great tasting games, okay? Because this is like already one of the coolest games I've played in a while. Like if I was a, like maybe like you know like Bellamy's age, I think I'd probably lose myself playing this game. And I would, this would be one of my like, this this feels like the the spirit successor to like Freddy Fish, you know. Doo -doo -doo -doo. It's really awesome. Thanks, Shelby. Shelby, you're the best. I appreciate you. I like almost low key want to keep going down this way, but I know the vents are going to stop me, so I think that's a bad idea. Whoa. Oh my god, there's no way. This, uh, this, this is not sanitary, man. I'm in like a, a a wet. You know how many germs and bacteria and like gross stuff is gonna be inside this thing, and we're just gonna have to roll around in it. <laughs> this is such a cool game, dude. Oh shoot! Like that guy's polishing his car. If he sees me, will he like? Will he like? Uh... Oh, and you have to cross the road without getting smashed by a car too. Let's just see what happens. Huh? Is he going to see me? Don't get spotted. Don't get spotted. Don't get spotted. Oh my God. We can't even, we can't even do anything right. Hey. Oh, he sees me. He saw me. Oh my God. No, go. So if he, if he, if they see you, then they're going to chase you. I think he walks about three miles per day that's his speed i can't get away from him bro what a complete butthole that guy's an absolute freaking my god dude he's like that guy's a dick <laughs> that's what he is he's a he's a butthole why would he come over to me and just like and just like kick me over like that He wants his bucket back, but he doesn't care. There's a fish in the bucket that's gonna die. Like, doesn't. Where am I supposed to go? Do I do I go in the do I go in the grass? Please, slow down a little. Maybe he maybe he he walks slow. He's running at me now. Oh, we're going downhill. We're actually going downhill. This is so cool. <laughs> oh no, he's chasing. Oh, he's catching up. There's rocks. <laughs> no, please. No, there's rocks. <laughs> Maybe we can, I think you have to avoid the rocks. I, I probably should be looking ahead and not, not at him. Oh, God damn. This is bad. Keep rolling, little fish. You have big dreams. What's in there? It's a fish you're going to kill. I'm not going to let you kill. Oh, we're done. We're done. He, he's going he's gonna to catch me for sure. He's right there. He doesn't, he doesn't really He doesn't really run that fast, though. So the game gives you a lot of leeway. So if you... um. My bucket. Screw your bucket. I'm going. I'm. I'm gonna ride. Oh no. 
I'm riding this thing to safety. We're going in the we're going in the pond. Please don't make me run. <laughs> See you later, loser. <laughs> we're going to the we're going to safety. <laughs> hey, Relia, you're so right. This is way more intense than it should be. Yeah, that's way that, that was way more intense than it had any any business being. We did it. So I think the game has 13 levels and that was level three. But then you can go back and replay the levels and like do them differently. And there's, there's like different paths you can take. So the game has like a, a decent amount of replayability too. And then I think after level four, we changed the, what fish we are. So all of the fish are trying to meet up at like some, like, I think in that pond or something. This level is called a bridge to freedom. It, it's a really beautiful, it, it looks like a Pixar movie almost. It's very cool. Auga. Jacob, you can buy this on Steam. Um, I think it's on, on uh, it's on Xbox for sure. I got mine on, on Xbox, and you can you can buy it on like uh, a few different platforms. On Xbox right now, it's only like six bucks too. So if you're interested, it's like very cheap on Xbox right now. It's really cool. I've, uh, I've known about it for a long time, actually. I just didn't really ever buy it. Even the music is actually pretty decent. I'd say right now, we're probably gonna be able to beat this whole game in one stream. I, I think we'll, we'll beat the whole thing tonight, probably. My poor bucket. Dude, stop com are you actually complaining about your bucket, dude? It's like fine. <laughs> why, why is he sad about it? The bucket's like tipped over, but it's not. It's in good condition still. Like, why is he sad about his bucket? Like, it's not like I broke it. I don't know what his problem is. Ooh, so there's like there's like another tunnel where we can go in the sewers. What the hell? Are you serious? But now what? Oh, the gutter is... Oh my god! I thought I didn't realize the gutter had water in it. I thought that the... I didn't realize that at all. I thought we just died, but we actually... That was what I was supposed to do. We're supposed to, like, flop into the gutter. Let's swim this way. I was like, it looks a little bit like the... Yeah, you can buy this game on pretty much any platform you want to buy it. Oh, wow. Was that supposed to happen? We have another... We found another fish friend. But is that fish friend going to try to kill us? I don't know if I trust this fish. I don't know if I trust him at all. I, th I feel like this guy's gonna like not be our friend. He's gonna be more of our enemy than anything else. Is he already dead? He's already dead, isn't he? Is that fish already? Oh, he's already dead. Is he dead? No, he's swimming. He's swimming. He's swimming. He's 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 still alive. <laughs> the fish will do anything to get their fix. Probably true, Ash. I can't tell if he's alive or not. There's not a whole lot of life in those eyes he's got there, you know? There's not a whole lot of life in those eyes. Yeah. I was like, he's looking relatively dead to me. He's not really even swimming that much. He's just kind of like hanging out, you know? That's so cool. This is a very cool game so far. Yo, Tasha, what's happening tonight? Hey, Tasha, did you hear that there's the, the new update for Fortnite comes out tomorrow? Well, I think it comes out tonight, actually, later, but... 
I heard that we're going to be getting some cool stuff in Fortnite tomorrow. Like the bending elements. Uh, Toph is going to be in the store tomorrow from what I heard today. So you can buy Toph or Zuko or Katara tomorrow. I'm buying Toph right away. She's my girl, dude. Toph is by far the coolest character from that whole universe. And I'm sorry if you disagree with me. And that's, va that's totally valid. But like, you're wrong. Like, Toph is the best Avatar character of all time. She's honestly the coolest. I'm just going to buy Toph and I'm only going to play with her for like the next like three years. And I'm only going to pick up Earthbending when I'm playing Fortnite. So e either I win with Earthbending or I lose. <laughs> I'm very excited for the update, though. Hey, pal, we're trying to swim to safety. You want to help me swim a little bit? He's definitely dead, isn't he? He's dead. That, that fish is for sure dead. He's not even helping me swim at all. He, yeah, he's... Oh, he's for... Oh, no! <laughs> But I think the servers go down for Fortnite. They go down, I believe, um, in like four hours from now. This is like a little bit tricky. We're going to play this extra careful. <laughs> well, now he's dead. <laughs> That's true, actually. He wasn't dead before. I for, I'm i going to finish him. Oh, no. That's a hard area. Because the momentum wants to carry you off the edge. You have to really, like, push against the, the bowl to stop it. That's tough. I'm going to name myself Anuran Hado. And the dead fish is going to be... I'm going to call him Skillet. Come on, Skillet. Let's go, buddy. This should be a movie, The Adventures of Anurad Hado and Skillet. Guys, we also smashed 50 likes today, so thank you for 50 likes on the stream. If anybody uh, wants to join my Discord, if you guys... Oh, there's like a little mat down there, you see that? So if I fall down there, we'll, we'll survive. Is that a trampoline? Is that a trampoline, do you think? Or is it just like... A... Yeah, it is. It's a trampoline. Nice. But there's cars coming. Oh, well, there's one car coming. <gasps> no, there's another car coming. Oh my god, I'm, can I go underneath it? Can we go underneath it? Um, if you guys dropped a like on the stream, I very much appreciate that. Yeah, we're dead now. <laughs> it's it's really crazy because uh, before I usually fall asleep every day, I turn, um, there's like a, a couple, or like, I think it's like a couple, but it's usually the guy that uh, runs the channel. He has like a, a channel where he streams himself going to Disneyland or like, you know, any park that's around Disneyland. So I usually throw that up on my TV before I fall asleep because he's very soothing. He walks around the park. It's the, it's the best thing to fall asleep to. And one person that's a member on my channel posted their membership renewal in that channel stream today. I had just about flipped out when I saw that. I was like, there's no way that they're, they're a member for that channel and my channel. I, wa I watch that channel almost every day. Like that's, my, like that's like my falling asleep channel. That's a cool bus. I had to look at that renewal like four times. I'm like, there's no way that's them. But it was. So I was like, this person has like good taste in like Disney channels. Look how much speed we're getting. Oh, we have to go that way, don't we? We're going to be going downhill. I have to see, I think a secret, uh, we could have probably kept going up that way. And I think that probably would have let us like find a new area to explore, you know? Because we had a lot of momentum, and I, I slowed it down for us. I slowed it down for us. I should I, Maybe I should restart. That's a hippie van. We can make it up here, I feel like. No, we can't. Man, me and Charles are not doing so hot together. How do I not die here? Like, seriously. Oh, my God. Are you flipping my pancakes right now? This is actually so cool, but I think we're going to die. You must have to get... Like, you probably just got to redo this part until you get lucky. We're going to get hit by a car for sure, right? 
How the hell did we not? <laughs> How in the hell? Oh no, we did. We 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 died. No, we didn't. Oh my god, he was not dead the whole time. You know that fish that was with us? No, I think he. No, he's not dead. He's alive. Dude, I thought that fish was dead the whole the whole time we were swimming in that bowl. I thought that I was swimming with a dead fish, but he was alive the whole freaking time. I mean, he's barely alive. It looks like he's like been neglected by his family for at least like, you know, two years. And like they just kind of like fed him when they remembered to. There is no like regular feeding schedule. So he's malnourished and his brain probably shrunk by a lot. And he just found a way to like probably just drink a lot more water than usual to survive. He probably found a way to like maybe like uh, come to the very top of the, the jar and like just go and like just kind of suck some of the molecules out of the air to survive. But he's he's not doing so hot. He's like half dead, you know. Yeah, this is a really awesome game. Wow. So if you go over the those uh sprinklers, they actually wow, the sun's blinding. Can you go in can you can we go in this thing? No way. We can actually Is it gonna shoot me out? Wait, there's no way. Like this it'll eventually shoot up, right? And then I'll be I'll be shot out, right? I'm just gonna wait for it. Will this eventually shoot me out? Maybe not. Maybe it won't. I thought for sure I'd get lucky and it would like shoot me out and I'd, it'd be cool. I want, I want to just like swim around for a sec to just explore a little bit. Yeah, he's a little bit derpy, late art. He's a little bit derpy. He hasn't totally been uh, taken care of the way that a lot of fish should be taken care of. <laughs> but, late art, it's really good to see you today. So, thanks for being here. That's cool, Ava. See, I feel like the people that watch streams, there's a lot of people that watch streams, but there's a lot of crossover too, from what I've realized. So a lot of people that I know that watch like certain channels, I'll, I'll see them. I'll see them in other places, and I'm like, I can't believe I'm seeing you here, but I guess I, it makes sense, I guess. Oh, this is like a puzzle. So we must have to figure out which one to go in. There's like three different ones, huh? Is he dead finally? <laughs> I feel like if I hit him a little bit too hard, he would probably just die, you know? So I'm, oh, I'm assuming that, um, so you can, you probably just got to figure out which one to go into. There it is. We got so lucky figuring that out. Was it the right one though? Oh, there's a, there's a, you guys see the bottle right there? We have to go inside there or else we're going to probably going to die. But I heard um, people that I, I I read a lot of reviews for this game before playing it. People said this is one of the hardest things to roll around in because like trying to turn it is really hard sometimes. But I think I'll be fine, dude. We're we're still alive, guys. We made it, just barely, but we made it. Hey, Dilly, it's good to see you, man. Dilly, it's good to see you, man. Oh my God, we're gonna hit the wall. And I'm also assuming that this this uh, this bottle probably opens up rather easily too. So I'm not trying to have that happen. Oh my god, we're so. Oh my god, poor fish. I salute you, sir. <laughs> He's still rolling. <laughs> yeah, of course, I actually screw skillet. You're just gonna leave skillet behind? Screw skillet. I don't want to. I don't even want to talk to skillet anymore. Yeah, screw, screw that guy. I don't want to talk to Skillet anymore. Screw that guy. Yeah, this takes a lot of uh, really careful uh, maneuvering. Of course, I'm going to leave Skillet behind. I'm going to leave Skillet in the dust. This is tough. Sarah. <laughs> Sarah said rip. <laughs> Thanks, Sarah. 
Yeah, Nani, but he smelled. He smelled like he smelled like a like a family fish smells. You know what I mean? I smell like ocean breeze. That fish smelled like dirty bathroom. You know what I mean? He, he had the dirty bathroom smell. So maybe I'll come pick him back up when he stays, spends some time like outside the bathroom and he smells better. But he smells like a dirty bathroom. Skillet does. Skillet smells freaking awful, dude. He smells so bad. I wouldn't. I wouldn't touch Skillet again with a thirty foot pole. All right. <laughs> Did you guys see it? We were, we were like slowly. This is a really hard container to roll around in. That's this is a fun game though. He smells like absolute butt, like absolute dirty tushy. Imagine like a gorilla's butt that hasn't been cleaned in like three years. That's how that's how skillet smelled. I don't care about him. Holy cow, this is so hard. <laughs> We're going to get this fish home, though. I really like this game. This has been like one of my um, favorite things I've played in a while. It's very unique. And I like the idea that I'm like just trying to like reach a singular goal. I, I miss games where it was like just so simple. Like you pick it up, you play it, you beat it, and then you can always replay it later. But like I miss games where like uh, there's like a finale to it. And this this game's definitely going to have some kind of finale to it, which makes me happy. You know, it's also very beautiful. A lot of the games I've been playing recently are games you can keep playing, you know, forever. And it's nice to change it up a little bit. Jessica, you. <laughs> Jessica, you. That's gross. You. You're gross, Jessica. You're disgusting. You. Gross. Hey, Sophia, I think you said you're going to be lurking while you do homework, so thank you. <laughs> Thanks for hanging out and being distracted for a while. I appreciate it. I'm sure it was very distracting. Like, <laughs> I know how it feels to get distracted by games like that. Okay. We're going to swim down this way. Oh, my God. And now the fish is going to... I don't know what to do. <laughs> do we keep swimming this way? I don't know what to do. Poor guy. I think we should just... Con uh, th That seems like it's going to be a pretty big drop-off down there. I don't know. <laughs> I kind of want to see how what happens if I... I feel bad, though. Because I'm using poor uh, Honoran. I, I named the fish Honoran Hado, so I'm, I'm using poor Honoran Hado as a science experiment if I make him fall down here, you know? Do I do it, though? Do I, do I, do I just send it? I'm pretty sure I can't even roll off the edge because there's, like, a little lift there. So I guess it's, like, kind of guiding me towards... Wow. Thank you guys for the raid. I looked away for one second. You guys are crazy. Uh, hello, Julie. Hello, Cherry Sorbet. Hello, Paige. Hello, 12 Forbidden. Hello, hello, Mad Max. Hello, Yo, Beck. It's really good to see you. Are you excited for the Fortnite update? I don't know if we're going to be getting anything that's crazy for Lego Fortnite, but I'm I'm stoked to see if we get some good news for it. Uh, Mimi Crossing. Hello, Ali Wan. I like the name. Uh, Sugar Cookie. Hello, Harley. Hello, um, Anita. Hello, Ryan. Hello, Brick Boss. I love your name so much. Okay, what in the heck? First of all, what does Elder Plush mean? What does Elder Plush mean? Um, if you guys are just joining the stream, this is a game that uh, released on Xbox and Steam a long time ago, but it's like a physics-based puzzle game where like, we're a fish that's in different containers and we're trying to guide this fish back to his friends. So this game is basically like Finding Nemo and every container that we end up being in has like different physics and different ways that it spins around. And it's very easy for the fish to kind of fall off the edge and then the thing breaks open. But like we're like in the city, we're like going in different places and um, we're trying to like reunite the fish with his friends. It's a very cute game. There's, it's got voice acting. It's got, um, 
Oh, wow. I can kind of show you guys what happens if uh, we're very uncareful. Let me show you guys this really fast. It's a really cute game. It's on sale right now on Xbox for like, like six bucks too. So if you're not careful, you can sometimes like fall off the edge and you will crack open and then you just roll to your death. <laughs> so basically you're trying to get, you keep the fish alive and we've already got to roll around in like a, like a mop bucket and like we were like swimming in a gutter and then like big fountains and everything. It's just a really good game. So we're on level three and there's like 13 levels total. Yeah, that's what the game is like. It's 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 basically like Finding Nemo, but you're like rolling around in like different objects. It's a little bit tricky sometimes because I feel like, uh, oh my God, like the momentum of the game. Like if you go too quick and you're not careful, you can't stop your momentum. Like the physics in this game is really good. And uh, we were just in a fishbowl with a, with a fish that I thought was dead. But once, once I got us to the fountain we were supposed to go to, he like came back alive and he was swimming around and I'm like, I thought you were dead the whole time. But uh, if you guys would like to go sub 2K, it would mean a lot to me if you would. If you guys want to drop a like on the stream, that'd mean a lot to me if you would. Wait, what do you mean, Julie? Let's play K1? Wait, how, how did she win? Were you guys were playing Palea? I'm so sad. I was playing Palea every day for like... I don't know. I was playing Pilia every day for like maybe like a month and a half. I stopped playing though. I wish I would have kept playing. I'll have to do a Pilia stream. I think I owe Rebecca one anyways. Um, I should do a Pilia stream in the future. I really should. If you if you guys don't know Kay though, please show her some love. Is uh, is it do you guys know is it too late to get that one frog plush in Pilia right now? I, I like frogs a lot. I'm like a big frog fan. Is it too late to get the frog plush? Because that'll get me to start playing again, I feel like. Oh my god, please, 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 please. I'm like a big frog aficionado. It's not too late. Na hey, Nancy's here. Oh my god, Nancy's here today. Nancy, what's happening? <laughs> right, I gotta log in soon. I'll log in today then. Maybe if we uh, if we get far in this game tonight, I'll, I'll load up Paleo for a little while. You guys can see my house that I haven't touched since like 1935. I think my house is really cute though for like how little I play the game. Oh wow, you have to go that way, don't you? <coughs> and uh, so like there's a lot of different containers these fish can be in and there's four fish total. There's a piranha, there's like a, um, a puffer fish, and there's like a weird looking fish. I can't really tell you what it's called, but this is the last level I believe is the goldfish. And then we, we, we're, we'll be a different fish next level. And I'm also playing this in easy mode. So there's a hard level, there's a hard mode too, but I'm not, I'm not trying to see how hard the hard mode is. This level, this is already hard enough. Are you actually kidding me? Dude, there's no way I'm gonna. Is it making, is there music playing? Is that? Am I making, I'm gonna fall off the edge here for sure. Like, there's no way I don't fall off the edge here, right? <laughs> this is really cool. I'm so, I'm so nervous. <laughs> Please don't break. All right, dude, guys, we're doing it. Look at how cute he is. We're doing it. Thanks again for the raid though, Kay, you're the best. Uh, Nancy, you're already my grandma in my heart, though, you know? You're my YouTube grandma. You're going to be a grandma soon. That's got to be really exciting. I I doubt you guys are, like, maybe some of you guys are wrestling fans. I don't know if you guys are wrestling fans, but I don't know if you guys, anybody, did anybody watch WrestleMania this weekend? If you're new here? Oh, no. Oh, no. There goes the fish. Poor guy. <laughs> so sad so sad do I have a pet frog no I don't 
I like to play a lot of games that have frogs in them, though. Have you guys seen that one that one game called like Detective Frog? There's like a Detective Frog game that I want to play. I play a lot of like a uh, like chill games, and I like a lot of competitive games too. I'm like a I don't know I'm like I'm like an all over the place gamer. I play a lot of chill, cozy games, and I play a lot of games that are like not so cozy, but. Please turn. <laughs> and it's kind of hard because sometimes if you're like uh, crossing a road and there's there's cars coming, the, the tires on the cars will also break open your container. So you can't actually, you got to avoid all the, the cars too. So it's kind of like Frogger in a way. Hey, Harley, you should ask your husband what his favorite wrestler is. Maybe he's not around right now, but like if I ever see you again, ask him what his favorite match was last night and who his favorite current wrestler is on the roster. Because I'm a really big wrestling fan myself. I'm going to be starting a wrestling YouTube channel here, like probably like in a few weeks. So I'm a little bit nervous about that, but. I think we have this perfectly where we're going to go straight. We're like not we're like not going sideways anymore. Are you actually flip? Oh my god! I think the goal. I think the goal there is you. You can't go too fast. If you go too fast, you're gonna you're gonna crash. You're gonna break, burn out. It would mean a lot to me. It would mean a lot to me if you would, please. You will. Can you ask him what his favorite match was and ask him what his what his, who his favorite wrestler is? I'm not even kidding. That'd mean a lot to me if you would. I, I really like hearing about people's like uh, wrestling takes. I was popping off. I was watching in a di my Discord server with some of my friends, and I was literally popping off. I was screaming. I was yelling. I was having a really good time watching. So I'm like really serious about it. Please ask him for me. I would love to know. I'll tell him my favorite too. It's you know what's really nice of you, Harley. You're not a wrestling fan, but I'm sure it means a lot to your husband that you watch with him. It probably means a lot to him, you know, because I know. Um, I know that like it's probably to, to you it's probably so weird. I'm like you're like why is he watching this crap? These men are wearing tights and they're pretending to fight each other and they're they're pretending to have finisher moves. <laughs> it's so it's so crazy how it's entertaining, but like it really is if you've been, if you've been watching your whole life. I don't know. I can't explain why it's so entertaining to me, but I like to. It's just I don't know. It's so weird. <laughs> you're like why is my husband interested in this stuff? This is so weird. These guys are wearing tights and they have pyro for their entrances and they they're like. Like, why is it in oh no please please fishy <gasps> we're, we're still alive there's still life left in this fish is it really page i want to play um i was looking at the frog detective game on steam the other day i have game pass too so i do have game pass myself Okay, now the question is, are we supposed to go that way, or am I supposed to go this way? Yeah, because, like, for me personally, I used to watch, my brother was a wrestling fan, but I was, like, maybe, like, 15, 16, or maybe I was, like, 14, 13. He used to watch it and enjoy it, and, like, I don't say, I'm not proud of it. I used to, like, kind of, I used to kind of make fun of him a little bit because he was a wrestling fan. I thought it was stupid. I thought it was so silly. I was like, these guys are acting like they're fighting. They're pretending they're wearing wrestling trunks. They're basically wearing underwear in the ring and they're like pretending to have finisher moves and they're trying to, and then I started watching more and I was like, I got really into it. So I, I feel I feel like I understand when people watch it and they don't enjoy it. I can see both sides of it, you know? Cause I used to watch it as like, a, not a fan of it. I used to watch it as like, a, I kind of used to watch it as like, a, you know, like I used to think it was stupid. So I'd watch it, make fun of it. But now I watched and I actually enjoy it. I think it made me grow as a person. I'm like, maybe I should give things more of a chance before I, you know, hate on them, you know? That that, that kind of taught me the lesson, like, don't judge a book, a book by its cover, because just because it looks stupid, it, it, in, in, in theory, it's really stupid to watch grown men wear wrestling trunks and pretend to fight each other, but it really is. <laughs> it sounds so stupid. It sounds so stupid. But it's really good. It is really good.
Oh, that's really nice, Harley. He tolerates all my book rants, so the least I can do is watch a little wrestling with him. That's exactly, that's so nice of you. I'm really glad that you do that for him. Do I play Disney Dream My Valley? I, I played for a while, and I, I don't play anymore, really. But uh, I, I, I used to do like a Mickey Mouse voice when I would play. I played for a while, like maybe like two weeks. <laughs> Not a long time, but. I do play Animal Crossing. I like Animal Crossing a lot. I just don't know what it was about Disney, like Dream My Valley that I couldn't like, like keep. Oh no, please, 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 please. We were right there, please. Oh, poor fishy. Oh my God, poor fishy. Uh, I don't know what it was about like Dream My Valley that like didn't, it didn't like keep me hooked. And I just, oh my God. And we, at least we're back here. That's not, we're not, we're not that far away. Poor fishy, poor guy. What's my Mickey Mouse? Ooh, Julia. You're going to bring that from the pits of the pits of the past. My Mickey Mouse voice. <laughs> I I enjoyed Disney Dream My Valley. I actually had some fun streams playing it. I don't know if I should bring back the, the Mickey Mouse voice. It's kind of like a... Oh, shoot. We're like big... Oh, there we go. Oh boy, that was really bad. If I do it a little bit more, I think I can bring it back. Have you guys ever been to Disneyland to the, uh, it's the, the Mickey Mouse ride there. Like the, uh, I talk about it here way too much. It's the, um, the runaway ra railway with Mickey and Minnie. The Mickey and Minnie's runaway railway. I rode that like maybe like four months ago. And it's my favorite ride at Disney now. No, I wrote, I wrote it back in December, so it was like five months ago almost. Oh boy. I can sing the whole song too from the ride. I have it all memorized in my brain. The Nothing Can Stop Us Now song. And that, that song applies to this game too. Nothing can stop us now. I'll show you how. We're gonna make it happen. I don't know why I can't maneuver this. Let's take a ride. All right, now we just have to pretty much make a straight shot. The, the, the problem is here, I think you can't let the, you can't let the bottle get too, uh, like one way or the other way. Is this where I'm even supposed to go? Or was that just me finding like a, a that was just me achievement hunting, wasn't it? That was just me achievement hunting. It's yo, Chris. That ride's really good. The um, dude. The it's like my new favorite ride at Disneyland. The uh, Mickey and Minnie's Runaway Railway. Nothing can stop us now. I'll show you how. We're gonna make it happen. Oh my God, we're falling off the edge. We're gonna fall off the ledge to our death. And the glass shatters now. The fish is flopping. The fish is flopping around. Poor guy. Let's take a fall. Julie, you're so nice. Oh boy. Thank you for subscribing, Julie. I really appreciate it. Thanks for coming on, on board. Welcome to the Beacon Express. Next stop, Fishland. Thank you so, so much, Julie. You seem really nice. You seem really nice. I really, really appreciate you. Oh boy, Julie, subscribing to the channel. I love it so much. I can't believe Julie's subscribing. Makes me so happy. Oh boy, I can barely contain myself. You seem really nice, Julie. I'm really grateful to have you here. I don't know. I'm the channel is really close to 30,000 subscribers. I think we're still like maybe 40 away total. So I, I doubt it'll happen today. Maybe the raid helped. I don't know. We're really close to 30,000 subs overall, guys. We're like on the precipice of it. Oh, I went the wrong way. Oh my God. Okay, so. Uh, I didn't really know this, but it seems like if you, well, how do I get back there then? There must be a different way around. So I, I must be able to like actually get to the place I'm going, going this way. Oh boy. We got to take this glass jar. We got to roll around in it. We got to go get some breadcrumbs. 
it really means a lot to me julie if you if you i usually stream here almost every day uh oh wow do you think it's possible for this thing to stand up on its like like a jar would the more that i'm like rolling this around the more i think we can actually have it stand up you must have to do it like the right way though i don't know the bottom's kind of round no it's not very rounded never mind oh boy sharon i really missed having you here too the clubhouse really misses you sharon you make the best coffee Make the best coffee in the morning. Best coffee creamer. I hope you've been. I hope, I hope you've been good, Sharon. <laughs> LOL. <laughs> I hope you've been really good, Sharon. I'm. I'm. I love seeing you here. It means a lot to me. You know, I'm like a really big Marvel fan. So if they ever, if they ever brought like Marvel characters to the to, and I know some of you guys might be against that, and that's fine. Like I, I just think for me, like I, if they, if they brought like Captain America, to Dreamlight Valley, that would instantaneously make me come back to the game and that might be a, a weird thing to say oh no please <laughs> dude how do we how do we actually not go down there that's actually crazy now i'm assuming from this area we can probably drop the oh we gotta be careful here i'm like a really big marvel fan or star wars too i like star wars a lot too is that not where i was supposed to go I can't even like comprehend how that was not the, the place I was supposed to go. Is there a way that I can drop off the edge or something on the, I don't think so though. <laughs> We're gonna go this way one more time and just see what happens. This glass jar is really, 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 really fragile. Okay, you don't have to be sorry. Okay, you know how many times I raid somebody and I lurk for like 25 minutes while I get myself together and I like use the bathroom? You don't ever, ever got to be sorry about that. And there's times where I raid somebody and like I have every intention to like stop back into their stream. But like I use the bathroom and then I, I spend time with my dog for a sec because I know she misses me when I stream. And then I'm like uh, catching up on a message or two. And then I'll like forget about it entirely. And then I'll be like, what was I supposed to do again? I'm like, oh, yeah, we, I raided somebody. And then I go to their stream and they, they just ended. And I'm like, oh, I feel like a piece of crap now. It's I, I completely understand. Plus, like, when you're streaming all night, like, for a while, you don't want to, like... It, you just need a little break, you know? Okay, this is a really, really cute game. I, uh... I don't think I'm supposed to roll off the edge there, right? And I can't roll over there. Where am I supposed to go from here? Oh, we can... There's a way... Okay, I, I see it now. I see it now. I gotta be careful. I'm gonna roll off the edge again. Please, little buddy, don't roll off the edge. Please, buddy. Yeah, I've heard that Paleo's got some pretty cool new updates. That's what I've been hearing through the grapevine. I haven't touched the game since, like, I don't even know, November. <laughs> maybe October, that was the last time. I think it was, like, maybe early November was the last time I played it. Holy cow, this fish is, like, this fish has big dreams, and I'm trying to help him out and fulfill them, but it's just so hard. He just wants to keep dying on me. This thing, this fish has big dreams, and, like, He's not really helped me very much. Hey, Harley, you have a really good night. It was nice to, it was really nice to have, have you here and chat with you. So what did they add recently? There's, there's a big frog plush. I know that I was hearing there's a gigantic frog plush. I like frogs. So that, that's, that's tempting. Have they added like a lot of new animals yet to the game? Because, like, for, like, for, like, my, like, crafting game, and, like, I've been playing a lot of LEGO Fortnite still. And that's been really, like, kind of, like, and they're going to be add adding Avatar, the, the last airbender tomorrow. So, like, I'm going to be playing the crap out of that. But, uh, I kind of feel like, oh, my God, please. I just feel like uh, a lot of times when I play games, I, I get so burnt out on them after I play for a while. And getting me to come back... Are you flipping my pancakes? What happened? What is happening? Huh? I I definitely die here, right? I did it. 
Wait, I, that was how the that was how the level was supposed to end. That's, that we we won. I thought we were. I thought we died. I thought we just died. We won. That's unbelievable. That is unbelievable. That was so cool. All right, guys. I'm. How did that? Like, I, I was. I was sitting here thinking. I was like, yeah. Okay. Maybe there, there was like. A, I was supposed to like wait a second. Maybe there was like a platform I was supposed to go on. But you were actually supposed to like just like drop down from that place and like just wait for it to crash on you, and then you land on the roof and then you just fall in the ocean. That was cool. So I'm guessing what we have to do, every single fish that got taken from the fish tank, we have to help them get back to the ocean, and then that's how we win. That's what I'm thinking. Ah. Those are his friends. No, they're, he's 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 imagining that. He's imagining that. They're, they're not they're not actually there. Oh, I feel so bad for him. Huh? Did, did, did that dude just fall in the water? <laughs> Aww. So I'm assuming that, uh, yeah. So those are all the levels for that fish. And now I think we're able to go to the next fish. Yep. So we, we unlocked the, so now we, we finished that fish's, we, we finished that fish's story and there's three other fish that all have their own unique levels. And we have to try to get them back in the ocean too. So all the fish have to go to the same ocean. That's how we're trying to get them back to the water. It's a very cool game. It's a very cool game. It's sad because the fish keeps like imagining his friends are with him and then they're just not with him. So he, he it, it's really sad. We're trying to help him out. So when the game started, all the fish were in the same, they were all in the same like fish tank in this like business and they all got separated. And this is one of the fish that also got separated that I, I really like. He's really cute. See, they're all like really good friends and they're all supposed to be together, but they all got. Aw, oh, man. He sees, he, that he sees the orange fish. He saw him fly up. See, like every, like there's like a bunch of like unique bowls you can roll around in. So like you, you basically just hop from water, like, uh, container of water to container of water and then if you fall off the edge obviously you're gonna like obviously this is probably gonna break it for us <laughs> this is such a good game it's unreal this is such a good game and then you're able to flop around for a certain period of time and then hopefully you can find more water but if you don't then you obviously die Yeah, I heard that uh, Jack Skellington, uh, he's now in Dreamlight Valley. I heard about that, actually. Guys, I'm going to take a quick pee. So I'll be gone for a brief minute, and then I'm going to come back. I don't know if we're going to be able to finish this game today, but it seems like a really short game. We're already, like, that was uh, three or four levels down out of 13, so we might not finish it tonight, but I'll be, I'll be streaming for a decent amount longer. So while I'm gone for a minute, if you guys would like to go show some love to K, would you guys please consider going over and showing some love to K? Uh, if you want to drop a like on the stream, join my Discord, follow my socials. Those are all things you can do. Uh, I'm going to be right back. I'm going to pee quick. I'm going to say hi to my dog, and then I'm going to get some more coffee, and then I'll be right back. So I love you all very much for hanging out tonight. It's a really, it's a really cute game. Okay, you have a like I can't even thank you enough for the for the raid. Please have like the best night, okay? It it means a lot that you you you, you chose the raid today. So I really appreciate you. Please go show us some love to Cave when when I'm gone, okay guys? Go show her some love. Go check her channel out and uh, drop her a sub too, okay? I'll be right back. And remember, fish are friends, not food. Unless you're playing Unless you're playing Dave the Diver, then they're for sure food.
All right, guys. We are back in the seat. We're back in the house. I, uh, before I forget to do this, I'm going to update this really fast. I'm just a big old fish. I'm just a big old fish, and I'm always going to be a big old fish. I was born a fish. I'm always going to be a fish. Thank you, guys. Thank you, Alex, for the welcome back. Thank you, Allie, for the welcome back. All right. Allie, what are your top three fruits of all time? First of all, what fruit did you have tonight? What are your top three fruits of all time? I'll, uh, I'll tell you mine after I hear yours. If you're going to have like an S tier for fruit, what fruit do you put in the S tier? Overall. You guys are the best. I really appreciate you. Julie, everybody tells me that, that I have a great radio voice. Everyone that's new here always tells me. See, I'm gonna, uh, I have plans to eventually make, a make, uh, a, a channel where I'm like reading kids books. I have like all my assets for that channel already made. So I'm trying to do like a, a kids reading channel while I read kids books. And then I want to make a wrestling channel. Everyone tells me I have a great radio voice. So I want to actually try to put that to use and like try new things with it, you know? I don't want to waste that if people feel that way. And I wasn't sure if that was true or people being nice, but I've heard that from a few people. So maybe I should like actually try to take advantage of that voice and see where it can take me, you know? Everyone tells me that. I really appreciate it. Yeah, I've thought about it, Draco. I used to have a podcast. I would consider making a new podcast. It just got to be the right time and the right place, and I got to have... It's got to be the right, the right topic, the right time, the right place, the right scenario, the right... It's got to be right, you know. But I have considered making a, uh, a wrestling podcast. I've considered making a podcast for a lot of things, but I don't know. Podcasts are really hit or miss, and even if you have a great voice and everything, you got to have the right topic, you have the right people, the right co-host. If you're going to have a co-host. I could have a, a podcast by myself and not have a co-host, but I thought about it before, yeah. It would just have to be something that I'm passionate about. Yeah, I used to have a, uh, I used to have a podcast a long time ago. It was with my friend Nick. And we, we named it Two Nicks and a Pod. And I enjoyed that podcast. But my friend Nick moved. We, had, we were just talking about, like, current events, and we would talk about, like, just life in general. And I was, like, 23 at the time, so I didn't really know what we were doing. We just decided to make a podcast together for fun. But we we had a lot of fun episodes, and we, we definitely tried it out. It was just more or less, a, like, a fun project we did together, but... It wasn't... I didn't take it seriously, and then we only had, like, four episodes, and he had a, he moved to a different state. But I could always try to do my own podcast too, you know. Thanks. I really appreciate that, Kate. Voiceover work would do good for you. Yeah, I can, Julie. I can do Mario. I can do a lot of impressions, actually. It's a me, Mario. I can do I can do like I think people that have been in my streams for a while can tell you that I I, I can try to like do different voices. Hey, Ben, I really appreciate it, man. Thanks for the super chat, you legend. Um, can we give a moment of silence for the Wii U 3DS era? Because online servers are down permanently. Sad day for the Wii U 3DS. I know, it sucks, dude. Draco, what's going on? I could be better, Kate, but feeling a little bit better while watching the stream. What's going on, Draco? You're not doing so hot today? Draco, if you would have told me that, I would have brought you my banana. I could have shared it with you. I would have shared my blueberries with you. I'm sorry you're not feeling so good today. Makes me sad. Can we, Can we get some hearts and chat for Draco? For Wii U, 3DS we get a lot of hearts and chat for Draco tonight. Sad day because online Show her some love for me. I'm going to give her cheers Sad to Draco for, for being awesome. U, 3DS era loudly crying. But yeah, I'd like to uh, try my hand at making some other channels. 
Um, and then given those all I have for a while and seeing how that plays out. Two more till 30. I really do enjoy doing YouTube and I know there's a lot more potential for me. I just got to find what that potential is. And this channel is, I'm always going to be here. This channel is never going anywhere. I'm always going to be streaming here. This is always going to be like my main channel, no matter what happens. Because I've met a lot of friends here and people have been here for me for through thick and thin with this channel. And I'm never going to let that escape me. People here have been supporting me and been here with me through thick and through thin and through the hard times and the good times and never going to let that ever, never going to forget that, you know? So I'm never, I'm never leaving this channel. This channel will always, always be here. Always. I just hope you're okay, Draco. I'm sending you a bunch of love. I'm sending you a bunch of love. I hope everything gets better. I'm here for you. Holy crap. Savage King has been a member. Is that actually working? Hold up. Was that a real membership renewal? It was. Because I felt stupid last night because uh, my alert box was, it was replaying old super chats from like a year ago. And I kept saying thank you when they were coming in, but they weren't real super chats. And I felt like an idiot because I was seeing it on my end. So my, my alert box sometimes will freak out on me and it, it won't it won't actually play things how it should. So I and then it didn't oh, I felt I felt so stupid last night. <laughs> Cause I, I saw someone I haven't seen here in a while and they, they super chatted. I'm like, I haven't seen this person on my stream in a long time. Like I'm like, what what's happening? So I was I was sitting here saying thank you for like probably five minutes for these like fake they weren't fake, but they were like it was my alert box telling me that super chats are coming through. But there was actually no super chats coming through because it was just glitching. It was like replaying old super chats for, for like no reason. <laughs> and I was like, I was like, this is really weird. I'm like, I was like, I don't know what's happening right now. But then I realized what was happening because they, they used to happen a long time ago, actually. And then it, I think I thought it fixed itself, but it didn't fully fix itself. It was still having problems. Yeah, we do. We do, Draco. I I swear to God, I love having you here so much. I would I would not trade you hanging out on my streams for anything. I really do, really like uh, appreciate it and enjoy it. I would enjoy streaming a lot less without you. So, I pr I really do appreciate you. I really do appreciate you. Okay. Look at that painting right there. Oh, guys, uh, I so I uh, I just saw that uh, that Kay posted on her uh, her her uh, community tab post. So she got the the rare Cernuk plush today, didn't she? It was like a it was like a new Cernuk plush. So I, I want that Cernuk plush really bad. I might log into I might log into Palea and try to get that later. I didn't know about that at all. But when I was uh, making food, I like opened up YouTube and I saw she posted her, her community tab post that there was like a Cernok plush or something. I didn't know about that. Where am I supposed to go? <laughs> what would you do if you saw your fish doing this? I'd probably enroll him in like elementary school or something. Like middle school. <laughs> I try to get him a job, you know what I mean? If, if you can roll around the house, you can for sure have a job. That's what I would do. I said, hey, Pufferfish, if you're able to, like, ro roll around my house, you can pay taxes. I enjoy your channel. I watch I'm just kidding. Your streams as part of my evening routine before heading to bed. Do 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 do. Are we able to? Nice. That was what I was supposed to do. That's so cool. <laughs> I love it. Oh, we're gonna die. Oh my god. How did that go so poorly? Come on, buddy. Hop to safety. Just keep jumping. Just keep jumping to safety. Unfortunate. Hi. It's been a while. Hope you're good. Smiley. I thought we for sure had it right there, but we just kind of slipped a little bit. Amber, I appreciate that so much. I enjoy your channel. I watch your streams as part of my evening routine before heading to bed. Uh, you're so sweet, Amber. Thank you very much. 
I know there's a lot of people that probably use my streams for like, you know, lurking noise in the background before they go to bed at night. And that's awesome. Yo, Emma, what's happening? I've been good, Emma. I've been mostly good. I was uh, pretty sick this weekend, so I wasn't feeling very good all weekend, but I'm feeling better now. Guys, can we get some hearts in chat for Emma? Can we get some hearts in chat for uh, for Amber for being... Do I not go that way? Oh, you can you can go you can actually choose to go this way instead if you want to. But what's the point? Am I've been mostly good. I was feeling really bad this weekend. Like I was feeling pretty sick this weekend, but I'm I'm starting to feel a lot better now. I still streamed a little bit this weekend too. I just wasn't feeling so hot. I didn't stream on Saturday because I was feeling really bad Saturday. But I'm starting to feel a lot better. I kind of want to see what happens if I go back up there because that must be like another way to like go about beating the level and this has been a really cozy chill game I've been playing tonight so I'm enjoying this game a lot thank you so much Emma and thank you so much Amber for being members I'm really grateful for both you guys um, we're playing a game right now about these trying to guide these fish back to where they belong the ocean Mm. I usually stream uh, Monday through Saturday around like 11 p.m. Eastern time is when I would say I'd usually stream. It can be a little bit earlier, like a little bit later, depending the, you know on the time and stuff. But I'd say it's usually around like 11 or like maybe 11:30 p.m. Eastern time is like my usual time I go live. Is there like a certain door I'm supposed to escape out of? Yeah, it's nice, Amber, because sometimes as a, as a streamer, like I, you can get kind of caught up in like analytics, but as long as I know that like my streams help you fall asleep every night and I'm part of your, your like nightly routine, that's all I really need to hear to like really make streaming worth it, worth it for me personally. So I'm really grateful that you enjoy my streams that much to enjoy being here as much as you are. Because you can fall asleep to anything, and I'm glad that you use my streams for any purpose. So just know that it means a lot to me to have your support and to have your time. Because I like to watch streams too before I go to bed. Because like I usually fall asleep by myself, you know, and it's hard to sleep alone. I have a dog that lives with me, but like... It's hard to fall asleep when you're alone. So like when I have a stream on, I feel like a lot less alone, you know? I have somebody else that's like actively... How did that door just open? That door was not open the whole time. Am I crazy? There's no freaking way the door was open the whole time. Oh, you could you could push it open. I was going to say, I'm like, there's no there's no shot that door was open the whole time. I, 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 I know for a fact it wasn't. At least I thought it wasn't. Do, 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 do. For such a I was gonna. I, I was like, I just tried to escape to that door, you know. Oh my God! Wait, press LB or RB. <gasps> this is the best game I've ever played. This is the best game of all time. This is the best game of all time. I already want a sequel. <laughs> I've only played this game for... Oh my god, I want a sequel. Is there a DLC for this game I can buy? Because I'm going to buy the DLC too. This is such a good game already. This is such a good game already. I'm, I'll buy the DLC. I'll buy whatever they sell. So good. I love that you can like puffer up and do a puffer fish like that. And you can survive. Yo, Chris, thank you so much, man. How do I do that? Thanks for such a wonderful community, Nick. I've had a fantastic time in this lovely family. Vegan fam is the best fam. I agree, man. I'm, I'm very lucky that uh, I'm able to stream a diverse amount of stuff here and that people still care to hang out here, you know? I know I don't always stream things that everyone's interested in, but I, overall, I just have a really great community and it makes me very happy. And it starts with people like yourself. So 
I'm grateful that you even mod for me whenever you have time, Chris. Or and you pretty much do it every night for like hours. So <laughs> thank you, man. <laughs> and you're dude, you've been a member for like a year and three months, which is also crazy. So I appreciate it very, very much. This guy's a cutie pie. So what I think what I'm supposed to do is I'm supposed to like ride the current and then we're supposed to hop out of the water here, right? Yeah, just like that. <laughs> it's so cool. I love this little guy, man. He's so cute. And we're very close to hitting 100 likes, too. So thank you. Oh, wow. I got to puffer up. Wow. This game is very good. Very, 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 very good. For sure, Sky. Like, if you're a streamer and you want to find someone that's, um, like, you can have great mods, but, like, there's people in a streams that try, like, that are very, like, very, 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 uh, irreplaceable. Like, people that really do their best to make everyone feel welcome, everyone feel accepted, and, like, people like Chris do a great job at that, you know? And, like, not every mod's like that either. So, like, you can have great mods, you know, so someone that's a great mod can 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 be a great mod for a variety of reasons, but that's that's just like one of the reasons that makes like someone a great mod, you know? You can be a great mod and like, you know, you don't have to be exactly like Chris is, but Chris is a really awesome person, not just a great mod, you know? I've seen Chris in so many streams and he always does a great job making everyone feel very welcome and no matter what, you know, is going on. So that's definitely a very positive trait that Chris has. I think he makes people just feel very welcome just, you know, by hanging out, so. That's why you give people like that the wrench if they want. If they'll take it, you know. If someone like that wants the wrench, they definitely should have the wrench. In my opinion, from from what I've seen as a, as a content creator. Because, you know, you don't, you, there's not a lot of people like that out there. They try their best just to make everybody feel good and at least have a good time and welcome people like that, you know. The very genuine and, and, and there's very few genuine nice people. I mean, everyone here is nice, but like, you know, people that like go the extra mile to like really show that much kindness to everybody. It's very cool to see that stuff, in my opinion. So you got to appreciate those people when you can. This stream's looking a bit fishy. I think so too, Gloster, but in a very good way. <laughs> Dude, like, look at his like his ability to turn into a puffer fish at will is just so hilarious. I like genuinely cannot get over how funny it is. There's a waterfall coming up. Hey Draco, tomorrow night we're gonna play some Lego Fortnite. So whatever's whatever's bumming you out tomorrow, we'll play some Lego Fortnite. We'll have a good time tomorrow. Do you think they're going to have a, a Lego Fortnite skin for Toph and Zuko and Katara as well? Or do you think it's just going to be Aang that gets one? Because if I can't play as my girl Toph in Lego Fortnite, I don't want to play. Oh, you can't be... So even if you're in the puff, the puffer fish mode, you can't stay out of the water for a certain period of time. I just like how cute this guy is. He's so cute. <laughs> Hopefully one day if I ever die, when I, well, I will die one day. Hopefully I get reincarnated as a puffer fish. That'd be the dream. I'm a big old puffer. Big old puffer. Wow. Do you guys see the, sc the screen was kind of going dark there for a second. It was kind of showing me that uh, you don't have a lot of time to be out of the water, even if you're in the puffer fish mode. You got to be careful. Well, you know what I mean, actually. Like, he turns into the puffy form, you know? <laughs> you know what I mean? He's always a puffer fish, but he turns into, like, the... He turns... He goes full puff, you know what I mean? That is true. That's a very valid point. But he goes full puff. He goes bloat, and then he goes anti-bloat. You know what I mean? 
He turns puffy. I'm guessing on the way down. Oh, the, you guys see there's like there's like little ponds on the way down. So I'm guessing I'm so oh this I'm supposed to go to that one on the left. I'm gonna die again probably. Oh no. I'm I'm for sure dead. So on the way down there, I, th I think I'm supposed to like probably hit the little ponds that are placed along. I understand more than I did before. Bum, 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 bum. Hey, Jenny, thanks for lurking. I, you, I really appreciate you. I wonder if I can go like keep going down that way, though. Because we're going to try something here, okay? We're going to go in the water here for a second. And then I'm going to swim out of the water again. This might be a, a little Easter egg that they, they don't want you to know about. And then you got to discover by yourself. If I was a, a game developer, I would try something like this. This would be like something I would... Uh, maybe not. I think I'm going to die again. Yeah, it's looking really grim for me. I guess that wasn't... That wasn't something I could could have done. It just looked so like so possible, you know, to go in the water to like heal up, and then you can like escape the water again. To I, I was gonna bet money you could do that. Bum 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 bum. Am I gonna die already? No way. <gasps> the screen went black on me, but we still came back. So like just because the screen goes all the way black, it, 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 you can like kind of feel the fish blacking out. But if it, as long as you land in the water again, you still be fine. Fascinating. There, you, there, we can we can I'm gonna swim this way. And we we have to go down. Okay, so it's making me go downstream. There's like a little bit of a current. It looks like current events. Yeah, I haven't logged on to the, Le the Lego Fortnite world, Draco, in like a hot minute. So I'm, ex I'm excited to play a little more Lego Fortnite. I just, uh, I just got a little bit like, I played a little bit too much. But we'll play more tomorrow. Hi, my name is, my name is, uh, what's a good name for a, for a puffer fish? Hi, my name is, uh. I'm trying to think. What's a good name for a puffer fish? I gotta name this guy. What's a good name for a puffer fish? Do you guys know? What's a good puffer? F oh, I just missed that puddle entirely. That's so bad. That's so awful. Spike. I, I like Spike. What about like? Uh, what about like? Um. I like, I mean, Spike's a really, like, it's a very, very solid name, you know? I don't mind Gary. What about, like, uh, what about Prick? Prick? What about, uh, not Prick. He's too cute to be called Prick. What about, uh, Mona Lisa? What about, uh, Spike Dudley? If there's any wrestling fans here, hopefully you guys get that reference. Spike Dudley. Cool. So my time was a little bit slow. It says that you, you're a little bit slow. Got to go faster. Score. We got three stars out of five. We have six respawns. That wasn't very, that wasn't too bad. Yo, Chris, you have a great night. Thank you for always being so nice to everybody here. Thank you for 15 months of being a member. I appreciate the heck out of you, dude. I know it's like pretty, it's got, it got pretty late pretty quick. So I think that we're already at level. Wait, what? Oh, there's, there's, yeah, there's five stars per level. So there, there's, How is there 70 stars if there's five stars per level and there's only three? Oh, there's, there's 13 levels. That's that's what it is. And you probably get a... So that would be... That'd be that would be five times 13. Which is, is that 69? I think five times 13 is 69, right? Or is that 65? Yeah, five times 13 would be 65. 
So where the where the other five stars come in? Is there a hidden fourteenth level? There's got to be a hidden fourteenth level, right? I'm trying to think. It doesn't make sense. That's a cute name, Rami, or Romney, Blob, Jerome, Puff Daddy. Okay, I'll name him Puff Daddy. <laughs> he should have a cigar in his mouth. Imagine that. So the the puff has like two meanings. So he's he's taking a puff of the cigar, and he's uh, he's kind of a puffer fish. I'm gonna name him Puff Daddy. Hi guys, my name's Puff Daddy. I love taking puffs on cigars, and I love trying to roll my way to the ocean. <laughs> my name's Puff Daddy. I love taking those cigar puffs. That's what we're doing. Ellie, no worries. I like I like Puff Daddy. That's got to be his name. That's really creative. Hey guys, my name's Puff Daddy. Right now I'm kind of stuck in the I'm stuck in the marshy swamp, but when I get to the ocean, I'm going to that cigar store down the road. Yeah, the one that's next to the 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 the, the jewelry store. I'm gonna get a big old Cuban cigar when I get to the ocean. They don't call me Puff Daddy for nothing. They don't call me Puff Daddy for nothing. Oh, so why 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 restarts the level? So why restarts the level? That's what I gotta remember. I'm gonna call him Puff Daddy. I'm gonna call him Dinner. I'm gonna call him Amoxicillin. I'm not sure if we're gonna be able to roll him back in the water. Now we're fine. My, my name is Puff Daddy. Oh my god, I love taking those puffs on those fat cigars. Oh yeah. Ha <laughs> ha! Crikey, mate. We're in the Crikey, mate, we're in the, we're in the bayou. This game is so cute. Hey, Lizzie, what's happening? <laughs> hey, Lizzie, it's really, really good to see you. It's really, really, oh, wow, I can't get over those, can I? Crikey, mate, we're in the tundra. There's some. I wonder if there's like any like fish that are like predatory here. I can't get around that way. Is there a way to get around like down here maybe? Yeah, me too, Ashley. I've taken amoxicillin a few times in my life, actually. Have you guys heard that like bacteria now are becoming pretty uh, resistant to a lot of antibacteria stuff? It's like gonna be a big problem in the future. Like there's a lot of like anti antibacteria drugs that are like uh, bacteria are like now resistant to. That's gonna be a huge problem overall for like the next uh, you know 50 years or whatever. It's gonna require a lot of uh, a lot of breakthroughs in science to find a way to fix that. Because if we don't have like those like antibacteria drugs, it's gonna be horrible for us. It kind of worries me like long term. I don't know how we're going to get around that. Hi, my name is Franklin. I'm a little puffer fish. I'm in a little swamp area trying to get back to the my home and my friends. Hopefully I can see him again someday. Do, do, do. <laughs> Emma, I'm really glad you missed my voices. I appreciate that very much. I'm glad they're not getting very stale for you. How is one? Oh, I already. I, I, guess, I guess I got high enough to grab that, which doesn't make any sense. How did I get high enough to grab? Ooh, I'm going to get popped. I came so close to getting popped by that vine. I'm going to die here, I think. Yeah, I'm, I'm about to die, actually. Wow. You have to be so careful when you're in the water and you come out of the water to not like, you don't have a lot of time. 
You don't have a lot of time. Garsh. Garsh, Ben Solo. Garsh. I can't really do a good... All I can say with Goofy is Garsh. And I gotta, like, do it enough to actually remember how to do it well. Garsh. <laughs> I can't do the Goofy voice extremely well. Garsh, Ben Solo. It's good to see you. <laughs> That'll do. <laughs> I can do a better Goofy. I just feel like today, I don't know why I'm not able to. Oh, boy, Ben. I Boy, do I love seeing you here, buddy. Oh, Ben, I love seeing you in my stream. You're such a nice guy. Always being so, so supportive and kind. Making those light goals. Oh, Ben. Every time I go live, I just wonder what the, what number the light goal is going to be today. The suspense is killing me, Ben. Hmm. Oh boy, get my stream on, get my thumbnail made, smile on my camera, post my post my stream. I'm just waiting for Ben to show up and make me a light goal. I can't wait to see what the light goal number is going to be. It always ah, oh. oh, we died. Is that instant death or is it not? No. So you can roll through the vines. It just, I think it pops you. So just because you go in the vines, I think, let me just test, I'm going to test this theory out a little bit. I think the vines just make it so you get popped, right? So it makes it so you can't roll anymore. With It doesn't instant kill you. I like that feature. It's not like an instant, instant death or anything, which is, that's really, really helpful. <laughs> this looks like a secret cave to me if I've ever seen one before. Wow, it was a little, a little secret cave. Is there a way out? That's so cute, man. That, this is such a cute game. Ooh, I'm like, I'm like flowing. Oh no. Is that where I was supposed to go? What is happening? Is that where I was supposed to go? I guess it is. How did I just randomly find that place? That's so crazy. I don't understand. Hmm, hmm, hmm. <laughs> See what I'm what I'm curious about here is I wonder if uh, if I puffer up like this, I wonder if I'm able to like uh, climb different like logs. I, I, I okay. Here's my here's my thought process. Right, if we swim up to a log like this and I jump out of the water, no, it's that, that's not how it works. God, I thought maybe like my my spikes would like pierce the wood and I can climb that, but it's not um I don't know what to do here. Do I have to like roll down I think I'm stuck over here, aren't I? I don't see a way to get around this log. Oh, what if I come under here and then I puffer up? No, that was a really dumb idea. That was a dumb guess. What am I supposed to do? This is where the puzzles get a little bit tricky, I feel like. Dum, 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 da, dum. Yeah, they do float, but I don't know how to get the water level up. That's the biggest problem. They, there's probably a way to get the 
them to float i just don't know how to get them to float you know can i can i swim back into this thing or is it is that like not gonna let me do that I can't jump my way out of that. There's no way. I can't jump over that log. There's, I'm not going to... I can't clear that log. See, that's, that's what I was wondering, Amy. I thought maybe I had to go back to maybe trigger something that would, like, raise the water level or something. Like, you know, there's a pipe right there. Like, what if there was a way to, like, make more water come out of that pipe and then flood this place? And maybe I, maybe I just missed it or something. And maybe that would make the... Or is there a way that I can roll up can I roll up the hill here? No, I certainly cannot do that. Can I climb? Oh wait, I can. I, I think I can climb over here. Can I? Oh my god! There's no freaking way. Oh my god! I think that is what, what I'm supposed to do, though. I almost feel like that can't be what I'm supposed to do, but like if, if kind of, it kind of feels like I'm able to almost get a, get around that right there. Is that like the official thing I'm supposed to do to get out of this place? Do I just like uh, like go hop over this thing and then I can become? Uh, do I just roll up it or something? <laughs> I was close to getting over it. I just can't get out of the. I can't stay out of the water for too long, or else. Okay, how do I do that before? I must have to come go into the water a little bit and then swim up. I think I figured that out. We were very close to getting over that log. Hey Draco, it was funny. I don't think I told you, but when me and Dillian people, we were, we were watching WrestleMania the other night, one of the matches had a bunch of people in it and we were laughing because we were like assigning people that were part of my channel as being the wrestlers. Like that guy is Steph, that guy is Ben Solo. And then Dilly said someone was you, and we started laughing so hard. And then Dilly was like, yeah, that, that's little Draco right there. And we, we both started laughing so hard. <laughs> it was so funny. It was like, that's little Draco. I'm like, oh my god. I don't think that's actually, that, that's, that's the official way to get over there. It seems like you have to get really lucky to, to make that happen, you know? It was so funny. We were, it was one of the wrestlers. I'm like, yeah, that's definitely a little Draco. That one, that one's Steph. That one is, it was really good. See, is this like the official puzzle? Like, is this, I feel like I'm doing it, you know? Like, I'm, I'm like, I'm like hopping and then I'm like, that, that's only gonna get me so far, right? Like, I'm making progress to get up there, but how do I like continue that progress? You know what I mean? Like, when Dilly said that's little Draco, I was dying. I, I, I feel like I'm cooking here a little bit. Like, you, I think the thing is you have to jump and then turn into a puffer fish, but then I can't like clear it. So I don't know that maybe that's not what I'm supposed to do here. Is there like a is there like a, another way around? Like, do I got to do I, do I got to explore? Maybe there's like is there like a pipe down here I can look. at? Maybe find like a broken pipe or something. I'm gonna figure this out and I'm not gonna get any help. We're gonna we're gonna figure this whole thing out. Can I swim back down in this? No, I can't swim back down that way. That's blocked off. I feel like for sure there's gotta be like some kind of mechanic that I, I missed out on that I don't I don't know how to do. Oh, look at that brick right here. You see this you, you guys see that brick right here? Maybe we have to swim next to this brick and then we have to puff out or something. Nick, I met and got a photo that brick looks, it looks like it's going to break. Face. Doesn't that brick look kind of sus a little bit? Like it's about to break. I don't know, man. Javi, I really appreciate that. I met and got a photo with Jody. That's very cool. Thanks for the five dollars, Javi. I appreciate that. That can't be it. Oh, I'm still alive, at least. 
I gotta think about other ways to pass this. Yeah, we always say that Damien Priest is Vanessa, so it was just hilarious. <laughs> yeah. It was so funny. It was so funny. Draco, I was laughing so hard. You have no idea. Abby, thank you very, very much. Thanks for the super chat. Do I have to just roll up this hill? Is that part of it? I'm like actually stuck here. Yeah, we were just we were just talking about like, and it was funny because like we'd say like, hey, I'm that person. And that person would get like hit by a ladder. And I'm like, oh, sucks to be that person. <laughs> and like we would say like, ooh, that, that one's Huggy. And then Huggy would get sniped by a ladder. Ooh, Huggy just went down. Huggy's, me and Dilly make watching. I feel, I feel like me and Dilly are two of the most fun people. Not to like toot my own horn. I'm a lot more fun to watch when I'm with Dilly for sure. But like if me and Dilly are together, I feel like we're two of the most fun people to watch wrestling with. <laughs> we definitely have a good time when we're watching. Oh, wow. Look at this. Press, look at that. Are you... Are you serious? The whole time I had to go find like something down, I had to like swim down far enough to trigger that ability. Oh my God. At least I figured it out. At least I figured it, well, I kind of figured it out. That is so cool. I'm still failing though. That's like a hidden power up. Yeah, I forgot who Steph was too. Steph was someone. I can't remember who Steph was. I think we said Steph was... I gotta remember. I can't remember. For some reason, Dilly, the only person I ever remember who we... I always remember Vanessa as Damien Priest. But everybody else, I always forget who they are. But Vanessa being Damien Priest is always one I remember. I can't figure this out. We just wait till... Holy cow, we, we got through. We got through. All right, that was the right way too. It's just so funny. That's like the only one I ever remember. Whew, we got by. I was really stuck on that for a minute. Hey, Hobby, thank you very much. I'll check for you. That's so cool, Hobby. That's very cool. Nick Check Gen Media. That's a very cool picture. Okay, I'm stuck here now. I'm assuming we have to probably swim down and then jump over these prickly things. I want to do that though. I'm going to. Oh no, that's the. That's not the. That's not the play. Do we have to jump on top of the log there? What do I do? I'm stuck on the. What do I do? Can I jump out of the water and then roll along the cliff right here? Is that a solution? Maybe. Bro, young minded. I'm doing I'm having the best night, dude. I'm really, really, really having a good night. See, I, I, th I think the log is like maybe it's the log. It, it seems like the, it's the log, but it's really it's really high up there, right? Like, how am I supposed to, like, actually get enough height to clear that log when I, I had trouble with the previous log? Oh, I, I, it is. the Maybe, maybe yeah, it probably is. I think it, I think it is the log. This fish has hops. So what if I go down? It, maybe the farther I go down, the more I, I spring up. Is that how it goes, maybe? No, it's not. <laughs> it's definitely not. <laughs> that is for sure not the, what I'm supposed to do. There we go. You guys are right. It is the log. I'm going to die here in a sec. If I don't get more water, my fish is going dark. Please...
If you would have given me like another like three seconds to make it to the water, I know I would have. If you could just held held on to a lack of water for like three more seconds, we would have been fine. I would have been big chilling with a little more time. All right, we're, wait, what? How am I? How am I? How do you go faster? I'm still dying. I'm still dying. Uh, yeah, we, we, let me just restart. See, I think one of the one of the best features in this game is the fact that if you if you want to restart, you press Y and you're you're back to the last checkpoint. That really really makes it less tedious to have to like uh, wait for things to respawn and stuff. I like it so much. But how do I like actually get speed? Do I just like do I just have to hold it down and like just pray that we can I jump? I don't understand. I don't know why I'm not able to like stay out of the water a little bit longer to, to beat this area. Maybe I just have to run. Like, is there a way to like, can I hold the button down? We did it. Oh my God. They made that so hard. They made that so hard. Why was that so freaking hard? Oh my gosh, that was a really, see, I feel like people that are a little more like casual and they don't like such challenges in, at gaming, this would be hard for some people, you know, like if, if you gave this game some, to someone that wasn't like an actual gamer, they would have a hard time with some of these puzzles. You have to be very quick about some things. It's a really cute game though. There's just some moments where I'm like, how the hell is, are people supposed to do that? And I think as a game as a game developer, one of the hardest things is probably trying to find a balance between letting people that don't play video games be able to beat levels, or I guess people that don't play them often, to still have a good time playing and not have be have it be too hard, while also trying to make it challenging for, for people that you know play video games a lot. That's gotta be a really really hard thing to to balance as a as a developer, you know. Because I, I would struggle with that if I was a developer, because. I like having a challenge when I play games, but like if I if it was like my mom or my my grandma playing, they would never do be able to do this stuff at all. So that for me is for sure something I always think about when I game. <laughs> yeah, I did, Tyler. I, I played Hogwarts Legacy for like the first couple months when it when it came out. I played a lot of Hogwarts Legacy when it came out. Uh, I'm Hufflepuff, by the way. I used to think I wasn't Hufflepuff until everyone in my chat conv convinced me that I was Hufflepuff. And then I just chose Hufflepuff for my playthrough and I, I don't regret it. Bro, this fish is going through it. This fish is going through World War II right now, trying to make it back to his family. I'm going to miss that uh, checkpoint, aren't I? Dude, I thought for sure we were going to miss that. The screen was fading. Things were going dark. I thought we were going to miss that for sure. That was really close. Yeah, I'm, I'm Hufflepuff for sure. For life. I'm like in my head, like, I want to be I want to be a Gryffindor, but I think I am a Hufflepuff. I'll be a Hufflepuff for my whole life. Huffle puffer fish. That's hilarious. You know, you know what, Snowstorm? I'm gonna name him Hufflepuff. You just gave me the, the best name for this fish. We're gonna call him Hufflepuff. That's a great name, Snowstorm. That's his brand new name. Okay, so we, we made it back to the jar. <laughs> That's a really good name for this fish. That's a really, really, really good name for this fish.
Is that a bird call? Chirp, 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 chirp. I hear birds. We'll be birds. Floating free. Gotta make your own key. Standing in the corner. Studying the lights. Dreaming of escape. Keep me up at night. I think that we're stuck here. And we can't move on. This little fish is struggling. And I'm singing this song. Got this woman. You and me. Guilty of nothing. But geography. Come on and raise it. Come on and raise the noise. Come on, it's not over. Oh wow, there's a lot of birds coming. They're dripping their butts off here. Stop the ride. Come on, rage. With me. We don't need words. Thank you guys for 102 likes, by the way. That's really awesome. I appreciate all the likes today very much. Everyone that liked the stream, you guys are my heroes. Oh, the bird. If the bird sees us, do they come and try to... Oh, so that we have to try to... Oh my god, the bird does come and try to scoop us up, don't they? So we have to we have to avoid the birds in this level too? No way. I was wondering what that bird call was for. I didn't understand that at all. Rob, what do I do? Am I supposed to just like hide from the bird? So... When he swoops down, does he try to come swoop me up? Is that the whole point? I'm assuming he probably comes and tries to, tries to swoop me up and tries to eat me, right? That sounds like the, the most likely scenario. I like how, I'm like stuck back here right now, though. I'm kind of not liking this. Stop the ride. No, I'm not stuck. I can just keep moving through here. I'm I'm definitely assuming we go through but that's that's the gate we go through right there, right? Yeah, I'm guessing that bird's gonna come sweep us but how can he get us through the like if we're in a glass bottle, how can he like attack us? Am I doing good? I feel like I'm doing pretty good. Oh no. For the love of God, please keep going. Go, 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 go. Oh he can break the bottle! Oh my god, that is so annoying. He cracked it. Dude, that's so annoying. That is so freaking annoying. He just cracked. So if, if he breaks it, then we then we lose. No way. No way. He almost hit us again. No, please miss me. Please miss me. Please miss me. Please miss me. Dude, if we, I'm not. He can crack the bottle. That's so annoying. I'm just going to hide here for a sec. I'm going to I'm going to I'm going to get I'm going to get some composure. I really hate that bird. Me too, Sky. Mine? Mine? Wait. Can I? You can. Act oh my God. You can puff up inside the bottle. Does that help me? Does that help? Oh, you can't. You can't even move. When you puff up, it, it, at least it doesn't break the bottle. I was wondering if I'd actually shatter the bottle if I did that, but it, that, that's not how it works. Mine, mine, mine. I have a feeling they're gonna come try to. Uh, let's just let's just reassess, reassess. If he comes and breaks my glass, I'm gonna shoot. I'm gonna freaking shoot that bird. I'm gonna go bird hunt. It's bird hunting season, my friends. So, are they targeting me, or are they, are they just flying randomly? Like, am I? Do I have to get lucky and avoid them, or are they like? Are they consciously tar- Oh, yeah, they're- That one came way too close for comfort. I can't even move. This is such a hard puzzle. I, I'm, I, I'm like stuck. Like, I can't even- Oh my god, that bird is a piece of- sh I can't even- I can't say that word here. That bird's a piece of sh- Did you ever meet Timbers? 
Please don't target me, bird. I'm gonna hide under this table. <laughs> this is a, a very cool level. This is a really cool. This game is so well made. I'm like, this is a, this is for sure a hidden gem of a game. Dude, frick off, man. Are you actually that bird? That bird's gonna break this bottle. Frick off, you stupid bird. Oh, that, those birds are pieces of dung. I can't do. I can't move. I'm like, I'm stuck, guys. I'm actually super stuck here. Now we lost. I hate that bird. I hate that bird so much. <laughs> he needs to get lost. He needs to go fly a kite. Oh, that bird's a piece of sh Not my friend. Wait, did we hit? Is, is this a checkpoint? Wait, did we did we get a check? Wait, I don't. How, how am I here still? I don't know how I'm here still. That bird's a piece of sh shoe polish. Piece of shoe. That bird's a, a piece of gum on the bottom. Of oh, I just hit the wall. <laughs> no, it's it, this is a very chill game. I feel like it's just a, it's just a. There's some levels that are for sure hard. It looks like a very nice casual game, but it's not really a casual game. It's definitely got more to it, you know. It's more intense than a casual game, but it's it's still very. It's just really fun. I, I like it. Oh, so that that log wasn't uh, wasn't like a physical object. It was. Wait, am I going backwards now? Wait, guys, I'm going backwards, aren't I? No, I'm not. Yes, yes, I am. Am, am I going? Am I going the wrong way? I don't even know if I'm going the wrong way anymore. I don't think I am. Crack the bottle. Watch the puffer fish flop around. Act like a supermodel. You just hit the lotto. Uh oh, uh oh. Puffer fish in my Tahoe. Got him riding shotgun. Puffle puffs, my best friend. My bottle's picking up dust. I'm all. We're rolling till the break of dawn, and we're hitting the gate again. Steven Seagal. Oh, Steven Seagal. That's a good one. Steven Seagal, Steven Seagal. That's, this is so hard to maneuver. This poor fish. <laughs> I think I'm going the wrong way, though, guys. Like, actually. No, I'm not. No, I'm not. No, I'm not. That's a, that's a, that's a checkpoint right here. Please. Those fish just, those seagulls straight up suck. Hey, Cyan Bird, what's going on, friend? Good to see you, Cyan. Oh, we're, we're cooking. Oh! Oh, I, I can still flop. I can still flop. I can, oh, please. We made it. We made it. We made it. Dude, usually when uh when like my the bottle breaks like, like that, I, I keep forgetting that I can there's still potential for me to keep going. I just don't know what to do from here now. I made it this far, but how do I not die now? You know what we have to do, guys? What I think I have to do? We have to somehow swim. No, I have to. There's got to be a way for me to. To. Oh, you know what we can do? We can. We can jump out of here into the other one. I think. I don't know though. I'm nervous. I'm very nervous. Hey, Cyan. Thank you for being a member for over a year. <laughs> no, I. I love birds. I just don't like when they make birds annoying in video games. You know. <laughs> birds are awesome. But when, when they make them an annoying in video games, like intentionally, it just it grinds my gears, you know. I, I think I'm supposed to push this somehow, but how do I push it? That that probably is what I'm supposed to do, but how do I push it? Push. Oh, <gasps> yeah, there there is wheels on this, right? Oh my god. How is a fish gonna generate enough force to move a cart like that? How is a little fish going to generate enough force to move a whole cart like that? <laughs> Dude, that is so cool. Good job, Hufflepuff. You're such a good little fish. Good job. You're going to have a bunch of food in the ocean when we get you there. 
we're we're heading there right now next stop the pacific ocean oh shoot this is also physics based so this 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 car can actually what we're do I am I supposed to just go in the water? There's like water down there. I mean, you would think though I'm supposed to go like on this bridge here. There's why why would there be a bridge here if I wasn't supposed to use it, right? This is the yeah, this is for sure what I'm supposed to do. And then there's like a checkpoint this way, so we're going to take the cart this way. This is the, oh no oh my god oh my god i'm gonna die yeah i think i died i think I, I think i for sure die here unless there's water below there is cement <sighs> cheers to hufflepuff he died way too soon he didn't last that long cheers to you my friend i'm gonna really miss that fish <laughs> I'm gonna miss him. Oh wow! No, this is where I, I just was. There's a window right there. I wasn't realizing that. So I'm assuming if like uh, if like let's say like you don't figure out the puzzle, it kind of points you in the direction if you die. Oh wow! Can we get this closer to the window at least? Yeah, we can. You've got to be flipping. And we're back in the bowl. And we're back in the bowl. You've got to be flipping. Oh, we missed the... <laughs> oh, my God. Oh, my God. We were so clear right there. We were cooking. We were like actually cooking for a hot minute. I think what I'm supposed to do is like not drop down right away. So I think what we're supposed to do is balance on these top beams. And then eventually we, we make our way down there. But I'll, I'll die if I just straight up fall down there, you know. Please. Oh my god. For the love of god. For the love of... All right. I spent a. Can we still roll somewhere? Or can we not die? Nah. That's the curtain call for poor fishy. Hey, Jay. It is so nice to see you today. I really hope you're having a good one, Jay. It is really good to see you. I know, poor fish. I hope you're doing really good, Jay. And there's birds on this level, so the birds can probably swoop in and attack us too. You see those birds that are like swooping in on me? You gotta look out for those birds too. I'm gonna risk it for the biscuit and grab the biscuit. Oh my god, I didn't make I got it barely. Okay. Jay, it's it's like so freaking good to see you. I hope you're doing wonderful, ma'am. Is everything good, Jay? I'm sending you a bunch of bunch of loving vibes tonight. Uh, I'm going to have to somehow... Are you flipping my pancakes? They must have put that board there because they're trying to psych you out. So if a board's a different color, then that means that you're probably going to fall through the map. So that board is actually, that, that that's not like a real board. That's like a, a fake board. Hmm. So those boards, does does every board that, that, that that's, that, that, that's, uh, that's colored that way fall through? Will this one fall through? Yeah, it will, won't it? God damn. That's so frustrating. All right, we know that now. <laughs> if a board's like a dark color like that, we can't go on it. At least we're well aware of that now. 
<laughs> I love the puffer fish so much. He's so cool. I'm not sure if it benefits you. Uh, oh, wow. Uh, I'm going the wrong way. Oh, for the love of God. Or fit. Can I just roll to the water? Is that possible right now? I'm alive. No, I'm not. I'm still dead. I'm for sure not alive anymore. Good morning to you. You have to roll. And you have to make a really quick turn. So you can't have like any momentum. We just got to roll onto this platform. We have to roll ever so slightly and gently to this platform. And then we have to take a right right here. And we have to... Oh, please. Please, 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 please. Oh, my gosh. We were right there. Can I roll towards the water at least? Is there like any water we can roll towards? I don't think so. I think we're just going to be screwed. Unfortunate, man. That's just really rough. <laughs> yeah, they make they make like the at least when you die in this game, they make it really uh really comedic. So it's supposed to be kind of like a silly physics game where like you're supposed to like you know die a lot of times. You're not really supposed to make it through like every time, you know. You're supposed to you're supposed to fail a lot, I feel like at least. But uh it's fun when you almost make it to water and then you barely make it, and then the screen goes all black. And then it kind of turns all the way back to like color again. Please. That's so hard. <laughs> it's so hard. It's so, it's so cruel and it's so hard. And I, I just want to give this fish a big hug. He's going through it today. Poor guy. He's struggling. And I think that there's probably a different way you can take here. We should try this way. I think we were probably uh, maybe going the harder way. So what if I just take the take this way instead? This is probably going to be the way to go. No, there's actually no... There, oh my god, this is not the way to go. Actually, maybe it is. Because I think we can like, drop right down on, the, on those metal bars right there. See them down there? Everyone. There's a there's like a little metal bar strip right here. And I think we can just drop right on that. But are we gonna break the, the fishbowl? No. Well I probably could have done that. That probably was a, a way to do it. Robert, thank you so much, dude, for being a member for 17 months. Robert, that is so nice of you. I really, really appreciate it, man. Good morning, Robert. Dude, that's a really long time to be a member. I hope you know I really appreciate that, man. 17 months is like a stupid long time in a good way. That's a lot of months, Robert. You're 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 very kind, sir. Robert, you've been here since I had the Minecraft realm a long time ago. Remember that? You were part of the Minecraft realm. Oh my god, that bird is a freaking dick. That bird is a big fat dick. That thing is, oh my god, he's a freaking piece. Oh my god. He's so annoying. <laughs> I'm so sorry. He's such a jerk, dude. That bird is such a jerk. Did you see him? I was just about to drop. I was on the precipice of dropping. What does he do? He just comes out of nowhere and knocks me. What does he do? What does he do? That is so frustrating. I know. He literally waited for me to like be in the spot to drop. He's like, yeah, I think I'm going to swoop in right now. He said, Nick, Nick is looking to fall on that platform. I think it'd be really funny if I just like swoop out of nowhere and we just like barely nudge him out of place. And then he falls almost close to it. That's it. That was his thought process. Yeah, that bird, that bird's a piece of work. Is 
If I go this way, I think the bird won't see me. So I'm going to, I'm going to, okay, this is going a lot better than it was last time. <laughs> Thanks, Tessa. <laughs> I, w I wouldn't say, I wouldn't say that unless it like really, I really meant it. You know what I mean? Like that would, I'm, I would save that for a, for a proper moment. And that, that was the best moment right there. Dude, I like literally had the I had the game in my hand right there. I had everything I ever needed to win. And then uh I just got sloppy when I was getting on the rail. Like I uh that's so frustrating. <laughs> I finally balanced myself. It's good to see you by the way, Tessa. It's really good to see you by the way. I hope you're doing great. My ne my next line of merch is going to say that bird's a big fat and then, you know, that's my next merch line right there. It's gonna be the bird from this game and <laughs> you're ready for the future merch drop that bird's a big fat beep <sighs> he kind of was though that in that in that moment he was oh he's right there actually he almost he almost just swooped down on me again that bird's that bird is actually a jerk that bird is actually the biggest jerk of, in the whole world we'll get it this time hopefully there we go Oh my gosh. Poor fish. Look at this fish. He's just going through it. Just. Well, we, we made it to the next area. We made it here. That was a checkpoint too, so that actually counts. <laughs> hey, Draco, I appreciate it. I'm not hesitating to buy that merch. That bird's a big fat dick. That's, that's my next piece. Of, oh, I'm, I'm going to stop saying that. That's my next that's my, That merch is about to sell like oodles. I'm going to sell so much of that merch. I'm already out of coffee. I got to get some more coffee in a sec, guys. That bird is a big fat beep. I'll like probably blur the text out just in case people don't want to have that word on the shirt, but imagine like I feel like people would buy that shirt. <laughs> hey moms, what's happening? Moms, how you doing? We got moms gone gaming in the house. <laughs> you guys are motivated. I'm gonna hit up. Uh, Hit up one of my artists that I know from like from Etsy that I've commissioned. I know a couple on Discord too. I said, You guys don't have any commissions right now, do you? I want to make some merch for my YouTube channel. Some big fat, big fat bird beep merch. That bird's a big fat beep. Wait, what? M Wait, mom, what, what is your sister's last name? Your sister's last name is what? <laughs> oh, is her last name Dick? <laughs> that bird, it. Your, 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 your sister's last name is the same thing that that bird is. Mom, that is pretty crazy. I don't know how to feel about that. That is pretty cool, though. I think I what I had a friend in, in high school. He had a very questionable last name that I've brought up here before that you guys probably heard before. Oh, no. Oh, no. This is so hard. One of my friends back in high school, he had a, a very inappropriate sounding last name. And he, like... Sometimes he could, but sometimes he'd order pizza and he would order the pizza. He'd tell them what they wanted. And then he'd, he'd say, so what's the, what's the name on that? And he would give him his last name and they would just hang up on him. It was that bad. Like it, it, one time he was ordering pizza for, for like me and like four of my friends. I was in the room with him and we were getting Papa John's pizza. He puts the order in. They asked for his last name. And then he says, yep, that's, that order is for this. And they just hung up on him. He's, I just hear him go, God damn it, not again. 
<laughs> Dude, this is so hard. This level is so hard, the balance. It was so, so funny. It was so funny. Holy cow, moms. Okay, we gotta be very, please, please stop, please stop. Oh my gosh, I've killed this fish. This poor thing. This poor fish is just going through it today because of me. But no, I, I had a friend in, in high school. His last, his last name was Sack Rider. That was the last name he had. And all the places that he tried to call would hang up on him because they thought he was like trolling. It's just a, it's just a horrible. Like, it was. I, I, I've known him my whole life, so for me, it wasn't that inappropriate. But like, when people hear about that last name, it's just a, it's a crazy last name to have. Rebecca, this is a game about balancing fish. I think that's true, Allie. Plus, that would be not the most appropriate shirt to have. <laughs> I wouldn't make that for merch on my, for my channel, but I would think about it. This is a really hard spot. This this is a, like, I'm struggling on this game. I didn't think I would struggle that hard, but I really am struggling on this game. I'm, like, surprised how hard it actually is. It just takes one, like, miscalculation to, like, completely throw the fish off balance. I think what I should do is take a right here, right? It's a fun game, though, Rebecca. I don't think you've, like, even, like, uh, you gotta see, like, more of it. Like, there's, like, a whole city you can go into, and there's, like, four different fish. And I'm trying to reunite them with, uh, there's different fish bowls you can get. Oh no, this is so bad. This is just one of the levels that's uh that's in the game. It's really good though. This game is like fully voice acted, so it's really good. I was doing this is like level six, I think, and I was doing great up until this level, but this this one's been really hard, like surprisingly hard. The rest of the game has been pretty simple. I mean, for like, it's not simple, but it hasn't been this hard. I haven't really struggled on a level this hard, this this much. It's very fun though. Like all the fish have abilities they can do, and you're trying to like get them from one body of water to another. And there's like different bowls they can they can be in, and the physics is very well done. That one goes back to where I just came from, right? That way goes. That one goes back to like the start, so I'm not going that way. I can go this way though. And maybe take a left here. Yes. This is the farthest I've ever got yet. I gotta be very careful at this point. I'm not gonna let this slip through my fingers. We're making progress, guys. It feels good. And I'm guessing I'm supposed to go up that door right there. That's probably... This dock looks like it's gonna... Is it gonna fall through with me, though? No, this dock is pretty sturdy, apparently. That's the checkpoint. We have reached the checkpoint. Now, if I see one damn bird in this outdoor area, if I see a single... Am I supposed to roll? Am I supposed to roll? Oh, I'm supposed to roll, I think, aren't I? That was supposed to happen, but I, I wasn't ready for it. I'll restart. I'll restart. Am I supposed to roll? Is that what, is that what's supposed to happen? Is there a way that I, I can make it down there and not have my thing break on me? Or do I just roll? I'm guessing I just do this and I start rolling, right? I'm stuck. I'm assuming you just do this. We just, we, we break the bowl here. And we just keep rolling, right? I just don't know if there's going to be a body of water up here. Because I'm going to die. Because the fish can't be out of the water for a certain period of time or else they die. There's water right Oh, man. Yeah. Yeah, there's four different, there's four different fish that I'm playing as. Um, so like each fish has like maybe four levels you can play. 
Okay, I gotta restart this. How do I, what do I do? That has to be how I'm supposed to do it. But if the, if the fish is out of water for even a little bit, it'll, uh, it really has a hard time. It struggles a lot. It'll die. There's gotta be water over here or something that I didn't see or something. I don't know. I'm confused. There's water right here, I think. Yes. So we have to make it to, to water sources. We can't stay out of the water for too long. I named this fish a Hufflepuff. If you guys just joined the stream, this guy's name is Hufflepuff. He's very cute. So we must have to jump out of the water here and then start. Oh, I just restarted by accident. When you press Y, you restart. I didn't mean to do that. I did not mean to do that. I just restarted the whole level. That's so, that's so unfortunate. It's okay. I, at least I know how to do it now. Yeah, there's like levels in cities. So we're in like the forest area right now, but there's a lot of different levels you can play it. Rebecca, we got raided today by someone that was playing uh, Palea. And there's like a new plush in the game apparently that I want to get. It's like a deer plush that she got. Please, please keep, just keep rolling. We're almost there, we're almost there. And then if you, uh, if you're out of water for too long, you'll, uh, you just die. So you got to make sure you're not out of the water for too long. I'm not sure if I'm going to make it. I'll be fine. Yeah. I think uh, if you, like, uh, what you have to do, Rebecca, is, like, I think if you hunt a certain kind of, like, new Cernok deer, there's, like, a one in, like, a thousand chance that it drops, like, a really rare uh, plush or something. I don't know how it works, but I think you can, like, you can, like, do a hunt for the plush or something. So I kind of want to do that in a future stream. I can try, I can kind of show you, like, what my, my place looks like. It's a really cute plush. That I wasn't even really, like, worried about getting, but now I kind of want it. No, I think we're going to die. Holy cow, we, we actually we actually made it. <laughs> that was really forgiving. I, I didn't think I'd actually make it out of there alive. Okay, we're rolling. The music just changed. That sounds like victory music to me. I don't know about you guys. That sounds like... Is there a waterfall here? That, that sounds like victory music. I don't know about you guys. That sounds like we're actually going towards, we're going towards water. We're going towards like the mainland. I think we made it out of the, I think we just made it out. We just made it out. <laughs> now let's go. This has to lead, this has to be the end. This is probably the end of the level right here, right? I'm just gonna assume. That was so awesome. This is probably the end of the level right here. I don't know. There's a checkpoint right here, though. <laughs> I love this little... This is this is probably my, my favorite fish in the game so far. I like his abilities a lot. He's very cool. Woohoo! <laughs> we are swimming to safety! Oh, there's a guy over here. There's a man over here. Rebecca, I heard tomorrow they're going to be adding Zuko, Toph, and Katara to uh, Fortnite. Wait, 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 wait. I'm not supposed to get caught by this guy, right? Why do I feel like I'm supposed to get caught by this guy right now? A bite. Is he gonna? Is this is this how it ends? Am I supposed to? Am I supposed to fight? He's trying to catch me. Oh, we're supposed to snap his line, or maybe maybe I'm not supposed to. I don't know if I'm supposed to actually... Is that what I'm supposed to do, or am I, do I just keep swimming? Because part of me feels like he's going to, like, probably take me home, and it, it'll be closer to where... 
the ocean is. That, that's got to be how I do it, right? I just let him catch me. And then maybe he, he keeps me as one of, one of his pets or something. I don't know. I feel like I feel like I'm supposed to let him catch me. That feels like the, the likely solution to this. Because I don't even really know how else I'm going to get out of here. Am I supposed to like put up a fight? Yeah, well, I think Rebecca, I think the, the Aang battle pass starts on Friday, but I think there's going to be some things that start tomorrow. So I think they're going to have the people in the shop tomorrow. I think Katara's in the shop tomorrow. And I think they're going to be having a lot of the updates happen tomorrow. But the Aang battle pass is the one thing that's going to be for later that week, I think. But I think that a lot of the stuff will be playable tomorrow, unless I'm wrong. Yeah, too easy to catch. I want to fight her. You're supposed to fight a little bit. So you're supposed to fight him a little bit, and you're not supposed to... Okay, that makes a lot of sense. He just, he just called me too easy. He threw me back. He said, no, nah, you're too easy. I want someone that has a little bit of uh, personality. You're supposed to... Okay, you're supposed to fight him a little bit. We got a bite! Oh, you see, you see how that it turns like red when it's about to break. Now, steady now. Come on, almost there. Come on, almost there. Well, actually, you're a bit of there a it fighter is. for such a small fish. A fancy one too. I reckon you'll be worth a few quid. Let's put you in here. That was the end of the level. For you. Dude, that's such a cool level. You did it. That was a cool level. I feel like I'm doing bad, though, because I'm getting, like, two stars on all my levels I'm doing. All right, guys, I'm going to use the bathroom, guys, really fast, right? Let me use the bathroom quick, and I'll be right back, everybody. I love you all for hanging out tonight. I appreciate all of you guys for hanging out tonight. Um, I'm going to go ahead really fast before I do go. I'm going to gift one more membership today to somebody. And then I'm going to be right back. That was cool. There's a there's a level where you're at you're in a nightclub. So I don't know exactly when it happens, but like you're in the middle of a city in a nightclub, and like you're in like a little like I don't even, I don't know exactly what you're in. Like you're like you're like you're like in a little container like in the nightclub. So I want to get to that level later on. That's what I'm I'm looking forward to because it looks so goofy and so silly but kind of cool. So I'll be right back, everybody. I love you guys very much. Thank you all for hanging out with me tonight. Thank you all for being here today. Thanks for all the likes on the stream. I really appreciate it.
I really do not know what's going on.
until um glorious what is happening i need to fix this before we are officially back hello my friends hello my friends i need to continue this i need to select i need to continue sorry for the delay everybody hello my friends you know they say ali if you believe in the chair enough and you can suspend a little bit of your belief about the physical world and you kind of like don't look at it straight on but you kind of look at it from like your peripheral but the chair does move sometimes like watch i couldn't really kick it <laughs> there's not a lot of room back here to like actually move it around unless i'm sitting in it but i have heard that before you have to really suspend your belief, though. I did my best. <laughs> I do believe. Draco, I always make you jump. I don't know why I always do that to you. Am I that scary? I was trying my best. You could, like, see my whole desk shake when I was trying to shake my chair. So I didn't, I didn't do a great job at it. Guys, this is the nightclub. We found the nightclub level. Club Bernardshire. This is like a rave, like a nightclub rave. What the hell is happening? Fish at a nightclub. Wait, did, so I wonder if we got uh, if we got caught by the fisherman and then maybe he sold us to the nightclub. Is that what happened? I guess logically that makes sense, right? So he, oh my God, you can escape the, well, how, I don't want to escape unless I'm like, I know where I'm going. Where am I supposed to go? I'm going to die. I'm in the club, in a fish tank with my shades on, headed up with my J's on. <laughs> I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding, Draco. I'm just giving you a hard time. Dude, I haven't been to like a rave or like a party, like a like a nightclub in like forever. The last time I went to a nightclub was like for like I was a I was a youngster, man. I was like 23, I think, the last time I went to like a nightclub. I'm like 28 right now. Where am I supposed to go? There's gotta be like a something that I can hop into, right? Ooh, the music's kinda nice. This music's kind of hitting. I'm like wondering if I can like hop into one of their drinks. That would make a lot of sense though, would it? That guy's straight up getting it. That that's me in the club right there. That's exactly what I look like when I'm in the, when I'm dancing in the club. Having some drinks, having some brewskis. Jay is on my feet. Jay is on my feet. Jay is on my feet. So get like me. Elliot, I graduated high school in 2013. I, I went to Pontiac in Detroit like a few times when I was like 19, 20 with my friends. One day I told my mom I was one of my friends' house to stay the night. And then me and my friends drove down to one of my friends' house that lived, that lived near Pontiac. It was, it was like, uh, I guess like a little kind of far away from Pontiac, but... We went to like the, one of the, the clubs down there and we stayed the night at my friend's house. And I drove back the next morning and like my mom never found out about it. So if my mom's watching the stream back, which she sometimes does to be nice. I'm sorry, mom. I, I did go to a club down there that night. <laughs> I did not go to the, my friend's house like I told you I, that I was I was doing. I just didn't want you to be disappointed in me. But I, it was honestly not even that good of a time, actually. It was okay. It was. Yes, it was, Allie. Yes, it was. Yes, it was. I went to the... There was like a... a part, there was like a... There was a club in uh, Mount Pleasant, too. It was... Uh, what was what's the one in Mount Pleasant called? I always forget. I went to one in Mount Pleasant a lot, too, when I was a kid. There's one in Mount Pleasant, and there's one... Yeah, that, that, that's where I went, yeah. Because everyone said that one was huge. Oh, uh, if... if 
So if you did you did you ever go to the the haunted house too in Pontiac? Uh, the asylum. What's what's the, what's the asylum called, Allie? The one. It's like one of the scariest haunted houses in all of the America. It's uh, I I just I don't like scary stuff, so I would never go to it. But oh, there's another fish tank over there. You guys see it? There's another fish tank over there. Am I am I supposed to fish tank hop? Is that what I do? Wait, is this glitched right now? What's happening? I can't hop out of here anymore. Oh, I do have to. I got to turn into the puffer fish, don't I? I don't know why I can't get out of there. It's not working like it was before. I don't know what's happening. There it is. Oh, is that, what the hell? It's, I'm gonna I'm gonna restart the level. I'm re, I'm restarting this level. I don't care. Dude, I I know I think I'm just I'm I think I'm coming out the wrong way. I got it's gotta be where that vent is, right? I think I just like popped out where that vent is last time. There it is. There it is. Oh, there's a mop bucket right there. I see it. I see it now. I see it now. Go roll. Roll fish. Your life depends on it. Your life depends on it. Go, go, go. We made it. We made it. <laughs> yes, that's that's what I'm talking. Yes. It was the it was uh it was the insane asylum. Yeah. Okay, if that uh if that guy sees me driving this around, he's gonna I'm taking his mop bucket away from him. That's exactly what I was supposed to do though. I'm supposed to Oh my god. Dude, I'm not trying to make fun of this guy, but dude, he That guy had to just come throw his weight around like a like a bozo and it cost me my life. Is the outcome throw my throw my weight around a little bit and a little cost nick of the game. That sounds like a good, a good time. Wow. That was unfortunate. Look at how lifeless those fish are in the tank. That guy is so lifeless. He's got nothing going on between that. Those his neurons are not even working at all. They all right, let's go back. Bum, ba -dum, bum, bum. <laughs> Wait, you're the girl sitting at the booth? You mean like at like at the bar, Draco? I don't know. I'm not. I would dance sometimes when I went to clubs, but like my friends would have to like drag me to the dance floor, and then I would dance a lot. But like getting me to dance is like a task. I'm not like I'm not a person that like wants to dance. Like you know what I mean? I, when I start doing it, I don't mind it, but it's hard to get me to start dancing. Oh, he's dying. That fish is for sure dying. He's on the... Unless he's, like, eating. I don't know. Dum, da, dum, dum, dum. Did you really, Allie? When ghost hunting in the Missouri State Penitentiary in October. It was interesting. Wow. Wow. There's a scary story from like a haunted place in Michigan that I've been to personally, Ellie, that I do. I had so many crazy experiences and like ripple effects later in my life from that, that I'd never, I like, I refuse to talk about it. Like, I'm so scared by my experiences that like, I, to this day, like, I don't talk about it. Like, I, I, I just hope that it's all behind me now. And I don't talk about it. I, I res I've gained a new respect for all that stuff. I don't talk about it anymore. Like... I used to like not I was not sure if I believed in it, but now I have a respect for it that I don't ever trifle with that stuff. I respect it. I try to stay away from it. Try to live my life and be respectful of everything. You know what I mean? I, it just scares me, man. I don't want to be like, oh, uh, it was uh, there's stories I have from my from my childhood when I was like 16, 17, 18 that I, I can't even talk about it. It's so scary. Oh wow, we we can okay. So it it, it looks like uh, oh no, guys. Are you telling me I'm supposed to like actually roll that down the steps without? You gotta be flipping my pancakes. Is there a different? Is there like a different water source I can find? I'm supposed to wheel that down the steps without dying, without tipping the the mop bucket over. That's ridiculous. Yeah, for sure. I've learned that too, late art. I've learned that too. I've very much learned that. I was uh, I was a stupid kid. And I messed around with some stuff that I had no business messing around with, right? 
And I like to think that a lot of it's behind me now, but I, I, I agree. I couldn't agree more with you. I, I think that... Uh, I don't want to talk about my experience too much because it does still terrify me, but like the stuff that I experienced, I think whatever was trying to get me to... I think they just wanted me to, to, to get a newfound respect for what I was trying to deal with, and they kind of... I'm good now, I think. You know, I think I have like... I, I haven't ever tried to like mess with that ever since but back back then it was it was very scary very very scary for me it freaked me the hell out back then so I, I got a newfound respect for it I think I made amends I apologized to whatever I, I offended or whatever I did you know and I think I'm I think uh things are good now but I would not recommend messing with that stuff even if you don't believe in it which I understand because I didn't for a long time myself but I do now <laughs> That's all I'm going to say about that. Hey, PETA, thank you so, so much for 11 months. I agree, Draco. The more you talk about it, the more... Yeah, that's that's why I don't talk about it anymore. I, I think the, 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 the if you just don't talk about it and let it be what it is, it, it doesn't really... You know, it, it can... I think you just have to, like, not pay attention to it and just hope that... You just leave it alone. Like, I think it wants to be left alone. You leave it alone, it'll leave you alone. That's why I don't bring it up anymore. Or try to... And I think the more I try to talk about it to try to seem like, uh, you know, try to seem like I have a story to try to seem cool, the le I, I think it... Oh, no. I, I just have a, a new respect for that stuff that I never had before that I really do respect it, you know? It was Harambe. Vita, thank you very much for 11 months. I know I, I gifted you the membership, but... Mm-hmm. <laughs> No, like, when I was, like, uh, growing up, though, at parties, I was never the guy that was, like, a party animal. I was never the guy that was, like, the, like, like, the guy that, like, uh, tried to be, like, the life of the party. Sometimes I was, actually. Like, some, on some, I think I, like, I don't know. I was the guy that, like, showed up at the party, and this is exactly how every party went. I would show up, I would have all the energy in the world for, like, an hour. I'd be all over, I'd be talking to everybody, having a great time, and then, like, after about the first hour, I would like die down and just, I would just chill and just talk to individual people. And that's pretty much how I, I live my life at, at like clubs. And I'm losing water from this. How the hell am I supposed to make it down there? I don't know. I my I have a very strong social battery, but when I burn through it, my battery, it, it just goes away. So if, if I see you in public, I'll probably talk to you a lot right away. And then my, my social battery does not last very long. It, it depletes very quick. And then I'm like, okay, I've I've talked. I feel happy. I talked my talk and now I want to just vibe and chill. Oh my God, you idiots. You piece of freaking. You cannot tell me you did that. You didn't do that on purpose. Come here. We're going to fight about it. We're fighting about it right now. Come here. Come here. I'm going to pop your shoe. I'm going to pop that chick's shoe. Hmm. For sure, Emma. Like, I was always the guy that showed up to the party. I would be the life of the party for two hours. I would talk to everybody. I'd like, everyone's like, oh my God, Nick's here. It's going to get really fun. And it'd be really fun for about two hours. I'd be like the life of the party. I'd be like taking shots. I'd be drinking with my friends. And then my social battery dies out. And I'm like the most chill, calm, drunk there is. I'm just having like individual, like deep conversations with people. And then I would, you'd find me in the corner like three in the morning, just having a conversation with like two people about whatever, you know, <laughs> everyone's like, yo, Nick, what happened? You were so, you were so hyped when you got here. I'm like, yeah, man, my social battery burns out real quick. It doesn't last very long, you know, but I would be very hyped when I first showed up. I'd be saying hello to everybody. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Just go fast. Hey, Fen, happy birthday. Fen, happy birthday. I'm going to sing you happy birthday. Just go fast, you said? I don't think going fast is the answer, though. No, it's definitely not the answer. <laughs> I think the answer here... Here's the answer, right? We got to go sideways, I believe. Hey, Fen, happy birthday. I think the answer here is we just we go down one step at a time I think oh my god
<laughs> I don't know if there's like a the, the like a best way to do this. And I'm not even totally sure if I have to go down there. Is there like a oh my god, please don't kick me. Oh there's a, there's a ramp. Is that a ramp? Maybe that's a ramp. Maybe there's like a no, it's probably just another set of stairs, isn't it? What the heck? What do I do? Ever, oh, I gotta get away from all these people dancing, dude. Like, they're, I'm getting, I'm, I'm getting claustrophobic. If one of these guys knocks me over. It's gonna be the end for them. See, that's where I came down from. Is there a different way? Is there an elevator, maybe? Is there a way that I can flop out of here and flop into a different bucket, for chance? Is there a bucket down there I can flop into? I don't think so. I think I just have to get lucky and find this, like, figure out a way to get this down the stairs, you know? Mm -hmm. Ashley, you have a really good night, okay? You have a really good night. I appreciate you. Lots of love, Ashley. There might be a way that I can flop down to like the bottom part. We gotta restart this. Were you Ellie? That's so cool. I, uh, someone from my channel too, I met a, there's a different girl. Oh my Lord. And she actually graduated from the same time that I did. And there was one weekend that we knew we were both in Mount Pleasant together. So, like, there's a chance we actually were at the same place at the same time. I remember, like, she came to my channel through a raid. And then we started talking about, like, Michigan and places in Michigan. She's like, there's no way from Michigan. And she was actually, like, she was, like, and there was, like, a, a concert in Mount Pleasant. And we were both at it the same weekend. And, like, we probably were both there. We probably would have the same, the same parties after, too. YouTube is a very funny place because I've met a lot of people through my channel that I've, like, probably potentially met in person throughout my life. This is such a hard level. What do I do? Yeah, I was a very energetic partier too, but I was also a very responsible partier, you know? I tried to party and have fun when I was a kid without ever being like a jerk to people. So like, I never tried to get in fights. I never tried to like, I was always just nice to everybody and just having a good time, you know? I was always, I always tried to be respectful. Even if I was drinking, I like, like being respectful to me was always important to make sure I never like did things that were like you know bad or you know awful it's just hard when you're I, i've seen i just saw so many bad like so many disgusting things uh during that time of my life there's just so many things that, like when you're like 18 19 20 21 at parties it opens your eyes to ugh, bro these people just actually suck <laughs> it, uh, i don't know why i laugh that way sometimes i hate that laugh i do <laughs> that's not like i'm a joker bro but yeah, sometimes, <laughs> sometimes I feel like um, I just saw a lot of disgusting people and things when I was younger. Wow, we flipped over again, but there's no water in here anymore, is there? There's a little bit of water in here still. Hold up, hold up, guys. We, we're cooking. Guys, we're, I guess we're actually still cooking, I think. Oh, uh, is, there, is there any water in here left? There's like a little bit left, right? Is it still counting? I'm not dying. Wait, is there enough water that I'm... How am I surviving? There's, like, no water left. Guys, we survived. That was the first time I ever survived the flight of stairs like that before. But we're actually cooking. Let's go. We're cooking. Let's go. Uh, now we gotta... Swim to the back. 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 There's not enough water in here to, to breathe, but I'm, like... I'm, like... I'm just getting lucky. I'm getting first... Like, just straight up lucky here, for sure. There's one more flight of stairs left. We're doing it. Oh, yeah, like one of my friends was the kind of guy that he always wanted to like start fights and everything. Like he was always like a fight starter and I was always like def diffusing the fights he started. Like, like he was just the person when he when he drank, he couldn't not try to get in fights. But like I was always the person I was always a happy drunk. He was always like a really aggressive drunk. So I couldn't I, I eventually I, I had to stop partying with him. Like my whole my whole night was like just like diffusing uh, fights he would get into. And I'm like, dude, I'm not going to go to a party just to like try to diffuse fights that you get us into, you know? I'm, I'm leaving. I'm trying to have a good time, too. I'm not just, I'm not trying to be like your personal fight diffuser. So eventually I just stopped. I stopped inviting him and I stopped going to parties with him because I was like, I'm not doing this anymore, man. This is so stupid. 
And it was always like like just like nice people who try to fight. And I'm like, dude, like they're just they're just having fun. Like they're not trying to talk crap about you. They're not trying to talk. They're not they're not talking about you at all. Like why do you why are you trying to make them like part of like the problem here? I was always a really peaceful guy. I was never like an aggressive person ever. Ooh, I think I figured out this. The, I figured out the system. This is the well. I'm still losing a lot of water, right? Though that's the problem. I'm losing a lot of water. No, 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 no. We have to keep going. Please keep going. Please keep going. Please keep going. I feel like I'm Albert Einstein right now. I figured out like this. I figured out the theory of relativity right now with this water bucket. I think as long as it stays upright, it doesn't matter how much water comes out of it. As long as it stays floating, like uh, uh, the wheels up, I think it still counts that you are breathing water. <laughs> no, I'm I'm not Emma. So a fisherman caught us and he sold us to the club in one of the fish tanks they have here. So I'm trying to escape to go back to my friends. I, I got caught by a fisherman so I could actually try to get closer to the uh get closer to the ocean. So now I'm trying to escape. Hey Emma, fish can go to the club and have a good time and rave too. Just because he's a fish doesn't mean he can't go rave. I mean don't be mean to fish. He's just trying to he's just having he's just he's just, he's having an innocent good oh we just flop we flop that over. Can I can I can I salvage this at all? Get back in the tank, buddy. Can I survive in here, or am I, am I still gonna die? I think I can still survive in here as long as. Oh no, I can't. No, this is over. This is this. We're, we're definitely screwed here. There's gotta be a way to actually make this thing get back up, right? I think we. I think we. We just lose. Hmm. Hmm. And I was always the guy, like, when I was at, like, if I was, like, clubbing and Coldplay would come on, I would, I was always the guy at a party. I would, like, almost start crying. I'm like, bro, this song is so beautiful. <laughs> I was like, Nick, stop crying, dude. It's just a Coldplay song. I'd always get so emotional when, like, songs I, like, would play if I was drunk. I'm like, oh, man, guys, I'm going to start crying. This song is so nice. Friends with Nick, don't cry. Why are you crying? Oh my gosh. I was reading reviews for this game and the reviews all said that like this is a really great game, but sometimes the puzzles and the physics levels can be really tough. I know what they mean 100% now. Like whoa, 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 whoa. Look at the ceiling. Am I not supposed to I think I'm missing something here. Is there a venom supposed to go in? Oh, guys, I think I'm I think I'm going the wrong way. The stairs might not be the solution here. I think this is the solution over here. The whole, guys, I was doing the wrong thing the whole time. I was doing the wrong thing the whole time. This is where I'm supposed to go. The stairs were not even the solution the whole time. Oh my God, I feel so stupid. This is where I was supposed to go the whole time. I saw on the ceiling that there was like a vent that I was supposed to, to go into. That was I, the stairs were not, was not even the solution the whole time at all. Yeah, the stairs were definitely a trick. They're trying to trick you. I'm supposed to get into the. Oh, I'm supposed. To, sorry, I'm in the cup now. <laughs> I'm in a cup. I'm literally in a cup. <gasps> oh my god, can't spill. What happens if I spill? Let's just try to spill me over. So let's see what happens. <laughs> okay, I don't want to spill. Yeah, they were. Uh, the stairs were a complete trick. They were a fun trick though. That was a really cool trick, I will say. This is this is such a cool. Yep, and that, that's exactly what I thought there would be—a way to go to the ceiling. Is there gonna be a water source? How, how is there? Where's the water at? No way! Another fish tank. There's another fish tank. So the the vent dropped into here. Where do I go? Where do I go from this point? Boop, 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 boop. There's a shelf right there. See the shelf? 
I almost feel like the stairs could have been a different way to win, though. Oh, look at that. This, maybe you have to somehow get in those fish tanks. I'm just going to roll and see what I can find until I die. Let's just see if I can if I can make it up there with with my ability. Yeah, that's that's got to be the solution. The puffer fish that could. Oh my gosh, we're doing it. Well, how do I get to the how do I go over here? How do I get up there? Huh? Oh, there's, that, that's a bouncy cushion. That's a bouncy cushion. So I think what I do is I have to get on that cushion. Yo, Ben changed his name to King Kong. I love it, Ben. That's beautiful, dude. That's very symbolic. Oh, you got to be flipping my pancakes. That is so cool. And then I think we can take this. Oh, I messed it up a little bit, didn't I? Yeah. And that is the most fitting name for yourself, my dude. Ben Solo, a.k.a. King Kong. That's a very fitting name for yourself, my friend. Oh, yeah, Draco. That, that was me in the club. Hit the sprinkler. <laughs> I would, my, my two favorite moves in the club were the sprinkler. And I would hit the lawnmower. My friend's like, Nick, what the hell are you doing? I want, the, I need the lawnmower in Fortnite for one of the emotes. You gotta try to like, you gotta try to start the lawnmower. <laughs> that was always the move I did, but when I didn't know like, how, like what to do for my dance, I'm like, I'll just, I'll just try to rev the lawnmower up. You gotta hit the sprinkler. You gotta hit the lawnmower. Do do do. <laughs> oh no yeah dude you saw Deacon of Nick in the club on the weekend doing the lawnmower you knew it was, you knew it was gonna be a good weekend that was the first sign I'm in the club hitting the lawnmower <laughs> how do you pick apples <laughs> is that how you is that how you pick apples? <laughs> oh, it's beautiful, Rebecca. I'm not, I'm not sure I'm qualified to pick apples. I'll be in the club hit, picking apples all weekend long. Oh my gosh. You must have to really just hit this perfectly. No way. Holy cow, this guy is actually the GOAT. This is actually, this is a really great game. Dude, they did that intentionally. They knew you get so hyped from finally getting in the bowl. They know they knew for sure you're gonna do that. Like there's no way they didn't do that on purpose. Those devs knew what they were doing there. I'm telling you what. I'm like positive they knew what they were doing there. That's beautiful. That's so funny. I'm supposed to probably come this way. Okay. So you can on the carpeting you don't break, which is that's good. Do 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 do. That <laughs> rip. <laughs> this is such a fun, fun game. Hey, Nani, you have a really, really good night, okay? I really appreciate you. Ooh, you guys see his crack, though? My ball is cracked. Do you see that? See, I wonder if me falling off the table, how I did crack it like that. I was supposed to go from the chair, I think, to the ground holy cow this is crazy I'm 
How do I move that thing around? How do I like it? I'm stuck up here now. And Ani, you're like so lovely to have in chat every night. I hope you know how much I appreciate you. I love having you here very much. So I'll see you back tomorrow night, hopefully, okay? What the hell? What, what was the point of that? Let's redo this. Okay. I get a chance to be up here again. I think if I let myself fall on the ground here, I think uh, my bowl will crack a little bit. I can't let it crack at all. There we go. Oh, no. Bump, bump, bump. That was so sad. Oh my god, I thought we had it. All right, we gotta circle around this way, and then we have to get, we gotta find a way to get on this chair right here, right? I guess we, okay, we didn't crack it all this time, though. We're still uncracked. Yo, Lizzie, thank you so much for the gifted membership. Lizzie, thank you so much. You're such a you're 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 the you're, you're an angel, Lizzie. You're the best. Thank you very much. So much love to you, Lizzie. If I was a puffer fish, after that gifted membership, I would look just like this. <laughs> Thank you very much. You're really sweet, Lizzie. That's how I feel when Lizzie gifts a membership. <laughs> Lizzie, I'm really grateful for you. I'm blessed to have you here. Thanks from the bottom of my heart. That's how I feel. This is, you know, okay, this is how I feel on a Saturday night before I go to the club. And this is how I feel on a Sunday morning after I'm hungover. <laughs> Thanks so much, Lizzie. I, I really appreciate it. I think I'm supposed to take this one. This one looks like the most likely. Can you imagine being at a club, seeing a fish on the ceiling in a fishbowl? Oh, wow, this is looking bad. Am I going to fall off this? Nope, that's check that's checkpoint right there. We hit it. <laughs> Mumsy. Hufflepuff is unscathed, uncracked. Oh, no, he's not. <laughs> oh, my God. Why does it always go wrong when I'm talking like. I'm like trying to. Uh, trying to gloat a little bit, trying to like. Trying to like say how good I'm doing and then it always. We got a checkpoint, though. The checkpoint is going to help a lot. So some of these metal bars automatically pop my bowl. I got to keep in mind which ones do that. And I'm going to avoid those like the plague. Am I supposed to drop on something? Oh my God, I'm going to drop again. Well, while we're out here, you might as well dance a little bit. Boop, 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 do the puffer fish. Oop, boop, 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 do the puffer fish. I'm out there doing the puffer fish on the dance floor. Okay. So we, we gotta we gotta stay in the areas that have uh that are like have like the paths for like the little vents area. There's gotta be somewhere I can drop though that there's gonna be water. Like there's somewhere down. Oh my god, I keep falling off of here. I gotta look around to see if there's any water somewhere. Or is there a, a way off here somehow? There's got to be some kind of cushioned area. Uh, oh, look at this. That's sketchy as hell. Oh, I see. I see it over here. I see. I see right where I go. I see it. The music is kind of dope, man. I want to go to. I want to go clubbing right now. Yeah, this this where I'm supposed to get off right here.
Man, this fish is a pro. Which way do I go? Do I go now? I'm like stuck here. What the heck? I'm like actually stuck. Do I go, do I go this way? Oh my god, I'm on the neon sign. I'm on the neon sign right now. Is that where I go? Did that, did that take me? Oh my god, I think I found the right way to go. There's a, there's a, there's the checkpoint right there. Wow, we're making we're making it through this pretty well. We land on the ground. Can I can I at least flop over here and, and make the checkpoint? I'm gonna die though. I can make the checkpoint, but what is? There's no water here. Okay, I must have. I must have. I was supposed to find a mop bucket somewhere. I don't know where the hell that was, that, that mop bucket was supposed to be. Was it behind here, probably? Either way, I may. Uh, yeah, there's there probably a mop bucket right here. That's exactly where it was. I just went the wrong way, I think. Do you guys? Now we can go clubbing. Wait for me, guys. I'm coming to the dance floor. Don't don't dance without me. Making my way to the dance floor. Do not start the the, sh the party without me. Woo! Let's go. Somebody pour some alcohol in this thing. I want to get drunk. Somebody pour some alcohol in this mop bucket. I'm trying to get wasted. Woo! I'm trying to get drunk. Oh yeah, this is so much fun. <laughs> this is so cool. <laughs> Somebody pour me some alcohol. I'm trying to get wasted in this mop bucket, bro. Oh my god, stop. I'm getting kicked over. Woo! Somebody pour some Somebody pour some tequila in this thing. I need some Jack. I need some Jack. Somebody pour some You guys got a fireball on you? Where's the fireball? You got fireball on you? Somebody pour some fireball in here. I'm trying to get wasted. I'm trying to party. I'm trying to get drunk. Woohoo! Wait, it's like going without me. <laughs> give the fish some hard water. <laughs> Dude, somebody give me some alcohol. I need to get some el- Ooh. All right. We, are we supposed, are, am I supposed to go this way? I think it was, I think that was actually part of the thing. I'm supposed to go. How can I tell if it's a guy or a girl puffer fish? Oh my God, you piece. I'm in his stomach. Great. Oh my god, this is so gross. He's gonna poop me out. Toilets. Oh my god, this is so gross. Toilets. Dude, don't swim that way, buddy. You don't want to swim that way. That leads that leads to a hole you don't want to come out of. No, 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 no. You wanna swim up. You gotta you gotta swim up, swim up. You want you wanna you want you want him to throw toilets. What if I turn into the big puffer fish? Does that make him nauseous? Wait, I think I can control him now, can I? I'm controlling him. Oh, I'm actually controlling the person. I'm, I'm, I can control the guy. Guys, I'm going. Guys, we're going. To the, dude, he thinks we're going to the bathroom. We're going to the dance floor. Come on, buddy. We're going. Let's, let's go dancing. No, go this way. Go this way. We're going to the dance floor. We're gonna, we're going. We're going clubbing, buddy. Now we're not going to the bathroom. We're going to the dance floor. Let's go. Let's, let's get it. Let's get drunk. Let's get drunk. Oh yeah. Let's get freaking wasted, buddy. Let's get. Oh, you got the moves. Start doing the lawnmower. Oh my god, this is awesome. Yeah, bathroom? Hell no. Oh, I think he's I think we're gonna start puking. Toilets. Need to find, <laughs> Need to find toilet? No, you don't. You gotta find the dance floor, buddy. Toilets. Need to find toilets? No no, start partying. Dude, come on, you got this. Make push move your move in. Everyone's Black Friday shopping out here. Everyone and their mom's on this dance floor, including you, buddy. Get on the dance floor. Oh my god, this guy's a where are the <laughs> toilets? Is he gonna throw up? He's just saying toilets. Need to find toilets. I can't believe. I cannot believe this guy is actually 
No, we're we're gonna go party. Let's go. We're gonna go. We're gonna go party. Let's go this way. All right. Let's. Can we actually make it to the bathroom? I don't know. How did? That's what I want to know too, Draco. How did he drink a whole puffer fish? He's walking backwards. <laughs> Dude, this guy had a great night. You can just tell he's having a great time. This guy. This guy is really. Sorry. Bro, get, boom, get move. Scoot your way through. You got it. Oh my god, you got this, buddy. You can for sure make it through here. Just go, go, keep going this way. Are you telling me you can't make it through there, my man? Here, let's restart this. There must be like a certain path I gotta take. Because people are in the way or something. What a shot. I think something else. I know, Draco. He's gonna throw up all over somebody. I kinda want him to throw up though, you know? Dude, this guy is stumbling. This is me in the club at two in the morning, trying to find my way to the bathroom too. I've been in this guy's same shoes. I know exactly how it feels to be this guy. Am I supposed to like make my way through here and find an opening to get to the bathroom? Is that what is that the is that the goal here? We're supposed to like find a. It must be like a little maze, right? Excuse me. Excuse me. Where He's... are the toilets? <laughs> I'm guessing we have to find the path to the bathroom. There's got to be like one certain Sorry. path we take. Looking for toilets. It's disgusting hearing him like like about to throw up though. You know, it's pretty gross. Come on, Greg. I think he sprints if I... Oh, Greg, we gotta go this way, buddy. Oh, my God. <laughs> Maybe I could have went right to the bathroom. I don't know. I think I'm supposed to take... I think I think this is the right way, though. I think I'm supposed to go through the... Yeah. This is like an opening here, see? I gotta find my way through all the all the people that are in my, my path. Yo, Greg, Where let's do it. <laughs> toilets. Of course, everyone and their mom's doing the chicken dance in front of me. Everyone to Black Friday shopping doing the, doing the chicken dance. He's going to throw up. I don't want to see him throw up. That's disgusting. But we'll get you there, Greg. We'll get toilets. you there, buddy. Come on. We're going to. Yeah, we got to go left. Don't throw up. Don't throw up. I don't, I don't want to see you puke. I'm feeling pretty sick today myself. I don't. I don't need to watch you puke, buddy. Where are the toilets? This guy is so wasted. Does any toilet work? No, no, Greg, you're you're, you're so close, buddy. Where you're... Are the oh, oh, he's taking a pee, bro. Come on. Oh my God, don't pee in the. Dude, I'm trying to throw up. Oh man, it's taking a pee. Is there someone in there too? There we go. Of course, someone's taking a pee. Have to do. I'm not looking at him. Oh. Oh, that was so nasty. Does it matter which one he flushes that uh, flushes us out of? Oh wow, we we had a wait. We had to find. Okay, we're not even in the water. Yeah, there we go. Now now we're in the water. That was really cool. Toilet! Need to find toilet! That was so gross. <laughs> Dude, you know, the secret of the boys' bathroom is instead of the men using the urinals, they just take all the stalls up and they pee in there instead. And then, yeah. Use the urinal, bro. The urinal's there for a reason. Don't take out the, don't take out the stall when guys are going to need that for other stuff. That's the secret of the men's bathroom right there. Now I feel like I'm stuck here. Because I, I would imagine I'm supposed to go up to that. Th oh, I think I can actually use my ability, can I? I came so close. That's exactly what I'm supposed to do, but I, how do I do it?
yeah if you guys were if you if you guys were a girl i should have told you to please stop watching the stream because i was in the boys bathroom that was kind of a private place you guys should have been watching that's the boys bathroom guys come on have some decency This is like literally playing a Pixar movie. That's how it feels. This feels just like a Pixar movie. Guys, don't look in the boys' bathroom. If you guys are a girl, come on. Have some decency. Have some respect for us boys. We just beat the level. That is true too. You know, I've actually never seen a any guys doing a handstand at the the urinal though i've never actually witnessed that in my life so is that a thing in the uk jordan i've been fortunate and i never had to see that i did one time walk into a bathroom and a guy was taking uh he was using the wrong he was using the, oh my God, they're reunited. Oh my God, it's so cute. I really like this game. So now we're sending our friends a signal that we're in the ocean, the other two. So they're going to be able to see that we're by the ocean. That's adorable. Can you guys see how, like, I'm doing pretty bad in the on the levels, though. I'm only getting, like, two stars or three stars per level, when, like, five stars is the, is the, the best you can get. And I've only found, like, maybe, like, a small fraction of the overall, the breadcrumbs you can find. I'm not doing very good. With all, like, the hidden stuff, but... I won't judge myself on that today. It's fine. Yeah, he was taking a urinal number two. <laughs> I walked into the... It was, like, at a... It's, like, really... It, I'm, yeah. It, it was disgusting. And he's like, bro... He's like, bro, I'm sorry. He's like... My friend dared me to do this. He's like, I don't want to be... He's like, so, sorry you walked in on this. I'm like, bro, I'm, I'm leaving. I was like, you can just... It's like... I, I don't care if you guys dare to do that. That's just so disgusting. You can, I'm not, I'm not interested in that, man. You can have fun. <laughs> it was very not classy. Very not classy at all. So the object of this game, we're trying to reunite four fish friends together. So they all got separated and we're trying to get them all back together in the ocean again. That's how the game plays out. Draco, the piranha is my favorite. This piranha is my, num my absolute favorite. I love him. This should be cool. See, he's, ima he's imagining his friends being with him again, so... So the game is basically halfway over right now. We're about halfway done. Because this guy probably has like three or four levels and the last fish has like three or four levels. So I've gotten two of the fish to like their, their friends already, which is pretty good. And it's cool because there's there's so many like very various, various... Oh, God. Wait, I'm in the sink though, right? Press RB or LB to use a special ability. Oh, he can like chomp. Wait, what? Oh, he can, like, grab stuff and... What do I do with that, though? Oh, <gasps> you can pull it down. No way. So you can, like, grab things and pull it down into the water with you. Okay, the piranha is very cool. I know. His teeth are awesome, right, Draco? I love them. But da 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 do you guys ever have like um 
dreams that like you're in like deep water and you see like a bunch of pranas that are like swimming at you i've had those dreams before and it terrifies me i had some dreams last night that were so horrible and so scary that i like one of them was so messed up i can't even talk about it and i wish i could i had such a messed up dream last night i didn't want to talk about it here but it was really bad like yes last night it was like just horrifying i don't even know what sparked that dream but it just it was crazy So we flooded the kitchen, which is cool. Ooh. Is that cabinet where I'm supposed to go? Why does that cabinet look like I can open it with my teeth? Dude, because I can. Oh my god, his special... Wait, his, his ability is really cool. You can open stuff with your mouth. Okay, I, I found the hidden thing in there. Dum dum. Dum dum. So can I open like the oven too? That's probably too high for me to open that. Can I open this? Cause there's like a... Dude, you gotta be flipping my pancakes. This is probably my favorite fish so far. And it's my, my third one, so I don't know. We can probably break the pipe off, can't we? Oh my God. Then the water will raise higher. So we're basically trying to completely flood this whole kitchen is what we're doing. This is a great game, dude. Whoever, like, the, the company that made this deserves a lot of praise. Then I'm guessing we have to do it till we can get the door open, right? Or maybe I got, maybe I jump out the window. Can I, can I? Yeah, I can't quite hit, reach the door yet. I can get the door, right? No, I can't. But then how do I, um, what, what do I do next? The oven? Maybe this. I can totally reach that drawer, right? Maybe I can't reach that drawer. It's, oh no, I, I, I can't. Oh, I, you, you can pull that out. I didn't realize that. You can pull that out. Yeah, you can. So I pull that out and then I have to swim inside there probably, right? I shut it on myself. That's the dishwasher. That's what it is. So I'm basically pulling this off the dishwasher now. I'm trying to, I'm trying to flood the whole room. Is what, that's what I'm trying to do here. That is so cool. So we can now reach the countertops of most of the room. I can reach the door handle now, but maybe I just go out the window. Is that the, is that the solution here? No, the window's not open. Okay, there's light coming from this window that looks like pretty, that looks kind of like I'm supposed to go outside of it, right? No, maybe I'm not supposed to do that. I don't know. Is one of these windows even open? I'm trying all the windows. Can I get the phone? What do I do next? The purse? The purse looked very likely. It was like sticking out like that. So far, I've, I've been looking for things that have like a like red on them. Oh, the hammer! Wait, can I can I use the hammer to break? Dude, there's no way. Can I break the window? Wait, what the heck? Why do I have a hammer? Wait, what am I supposed to do with this? Do I break the window? Wait, what? What am I supposed to do with this hammer? Do I, do I break this window? Oh yeah, this is by far the coolest of all the fish so far. This is by far the coolest one. No way. We grab the hammer and we break the window. No way. That's so cool. And now we're going to get run over by one of these cars probably. Oh my god. Can we go underneath it? 
Oh, I thought we were going to get lucky. I thought we'd get lucky there, but I did not get lucky at all. Help! I don't know where to go from here. Stop. Now make that mother freaking Rebecca time. Oh, well, oh, well, go hammer time. Go tap house. Go stupid. Wobble dee wobble dee wo wobble wobble. I'm in this bottle and I'm wobble wobble in. I'm stacking my paper. That looks like a piranha. <laughs> oh my God, we gotta get out of the way of this car. We'll be okay. Wobbly wobbly wa piranha piranha. I'm gonna go under. Oh, we're gonna get crushed again. Damn. What do I do? You go to the ocean? Thanks, man. Wobbly wobbly wa wobble wobble. I see Jordan in my stream. He looks like a. He looks like the Bible. I don't know what that even. What does that even mean? <laughs> oh my God! He's on the. He, oh my God! Can we get lucky? God damn it. I got wrecked by all the family. They're all on vacation. We have to roll down this this hill without dying. How am I going to do this? <laughs> They're from the Amazon. I'm going to name him Prime because he's from the Amazon. This guy's name is Prime, like Amazon Prime. Two day shipping or less. You know, Amazon has like same day shipping now. I don't know how the hell they're doing that. Sometimes you can order stuff and have it at your house the same day. Like, how is that even possible? Like, I'm all about like, uh, like having things be efficient. But man, that sounds like that's, that's just like revolutionary, you know? Oh my gosh. So I wonder if there's a way you can go underneath the car. I haven't figured out if like, if you, if there's a way to even do that, but it's so hard. This is a really hard level. There's probably a way that we can get around these cars, but you just gotta get lucky, man. Can we stay in the sidewalk the whole time? Oh my Lord. Is there another way around by not going on the Go this way, go this way, keep going. Good job, buddy. Good job. There's a bus coming. Go. Oh my god, what do I do? What do I do? Bum bum. I'm a piranha. They're from the wait. Wait, Draco, is that from Finding Nemo? Is that line that's from a movie, isn't it? What movie is that from? The more I'm thinking about that, that's a line from a movie, right? Is, is it did the girls the girl said that it was the dentist's daughter right that said that in in finding nemo right she was remember she was getting her teeth done is that is that what she said i'm a piranha they're from the amazon that was the little twerp from find finding nemo wasn't it that was the little freaking twerp girl oh please come on oh we avoided that car huge huge we just got to stay along this Please just don't. Please, 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 please. We're doing great. We're doing really good. Holy cow. We made it. I shouldn't say that because there's a car right there that might kill me. I'm a piranha. They're from the Amazon. I think she did say that, right? Was that her, though? Was that her? Or was that an actual Am like Prana that said that? I think that was actually the girl from... There's people down there having lunch. Oh my god, that was so bad. They should make a Finding Nemo 3. Finding... They already did Finding Dory. Finding Marlin. They gotta do a third Finding Nemo, right? They should at least, in my opinion. I liked Finding Dory. 
I think it's a, like I know like uh it's kind of nice they they left it alone, but I, a Wally two would have been really nice too. I like Wally a lot. There's a lot of hustle and bustle going on down there. At least we got a checkpoint. It was her. It was her Draco. I didn't know that. Interesting. That was her. I like Darla. I remember. Um, I think it was. I think f when I first saw Finding Nemo. I got to check when that came out, actually. What year did Finding Nemo come out? It was 2003. I want to say in like fourth or fifth grade, we had like a, a can drive. And I think if you, if you donated like a certain amount of cans, so I think what it was, I'm trying to think. There was like a can drive and like the, the, the prize was we all got to go to the gym and watch Finding Nemo. We had a bunch of snacks and a bunch of soda. We had like a big can drive. And if we raised over a certain amount of cans as a school, I think we all got to watch Finding Nemo and we all got like soda and popcorn. That's the first time I ever, I ever watched that movie too. And I remember it was really good. I loved it. And we had one of those for Inspector Gadget too. We watched Inspector Gadget that way. And we also watched, uh, we watched Shrek that way too as well. Shrek, Inspector Gadget, Finding Nemo. Those are the three movies we watched. Yeah, Finding Nemo came out when I was eight years old. It came out in 2003. I was eight years old when that came out, believe it or not. Wait, can I, can we take, can we take this way? Can we, can we go on this thing and take this? There's no way. Huh? There's no way that actually worked. Like, right? Like, <laughs> like there's no way that actually worked out for us. That's so cool. We found the secret way to go. Bum, bum. We found the secret way. Secret life of pets. I really liked Inspector Gadget. Um, I don't remember Fen. Which one was it? I don't remember which one it was. It was like one of the older ones though, obviously. Whichever one came out. Oh, Ben, you got the update for Fortnite? I might try it out after I stream today, Ben. I might I might do like a little Discord Fortnite stream today. I might do that today. Maybe I'll check the new update out in Discord and we'll uh, maybe play a little bit after I stream. I'm going to log on and at least see, what, see what's updated and whatnot. Damn. Did I, have you noticed anything that's new in the game? Is there anything that's like really sticking out to you right now? That's that's brand new. Um, it was like the was there a live action one, Fen? I think it was live action, the one that we watched in the gym. I think it was live action. I can't hit that. I think it was not animated. Poor fishy. But if I just go straight, there we go. Oh, wow. You can, it can actually fail. Dude, I thought that, I thought once you like got in there, it was, it was like, it was like just programmed to stay on there. I didn't think you could actually fall off that thing. You can actually fall off that thing. I didn't know that's possible. That, that, that makes it so much harder. You can fall off of it. Maybe I'll stay on now. Oh my god, you can I didn't even know that was possible to fall off once you're on it like that. But look what you learned. Through life, through trial and error, you learn. I think I'm gonna take this way. Through all the trials and tribulations! This is a this is a high quality game. Um, I think so. The Matthew Broderick one. 
I want to look at, I'm going to see exactly what it was. Inspector gadgets. Remember it was kind of cheesy a little bit. Oh yeah, it was the Matthew, it was the Matthew Broderick one. And then we also watched the, um, what's it called? Oh, it's a classic. Oh my God. No one tell me the name of it. No one tell me the name of it. Uh... Oh, it's going to kill me, dude. It's a classic movie about, I can't, if I describe it, you guys are going to tell me the name. I wanted to call it McFlurmpole, but that's for sure not the name of it. Uh, Flubber. Flubber. Not, not McFlurmpole. McFlubberhole. That's what it is. Yeah, it was it was Flubber. We watched Flubber, I think, back, back then, too. That was a great movie. Flubber is one of the best movies, dude. I don't care what you say. Flubber is one of the best live action movies I saw when I was a kid. I love Flubber. Going down. It took me a minute to think of the name too. <laughs> it's fun, Kieran. This is a really good game. We haven't lunch. Oh, we're falling. <laughs> Let me go this way. I'm a piranha. Tiramisu. Let me see something quick. Guys, is that the is that the battle pass? Oh my god, they have a boomy battle pass. Ba oh my god. Oh my god, Aang looks so good in Lego version. Oh my god. They have a, oh no, not, sorry, I, I said Boomy, I meant, oh my god, I called them Boomy. Oh my god. <laughs> it's not a Boomy backpack. Wait, did I say Boomy by mistake? That is not at all what I meant. Um, they have a Momo backpack. Ooh. Oh, they have one, they, one of his, uh, they have, they have like his, like, uh, his, like a little ball thing for an emote too. I'm going to have to get that, that mini battle pass. Me too, Draco. Ben, uh, I need him in my life. I need Aang already in my life. I'm going to play a lot of Aang in Fortnite. I'm for sure going to play a lot of Aang. Is that all that they shared? Oh my god, dude. Toph is the best. Dude, Zuko is cool. Aang is cool. Katara is cool. Toph is the best. She is the best. I'm only playing Toph. Like, if I can only buy Toph, I'm only going to buy Toph. I'll buy her separately if I can. I don't really want Zuko. I don't really want Katara. I want Toph so bad. I will main the hell out of Toph. They have earthbending and chests. New avatar uh, characters. New Lego characters. Tomato head. They have a new tomato head, Draco. Your man got a makeover. He looks a little bit different. He's got purple now on, on, on him. They have like a new orange guy too. There's an orange tomato guy. Yeah, they have, they have new... Uh, did they put out like patch notes for Lego Fortnite today? Are the new villagers they put out? Prove it? Here, I'll, I'll show you. Look, uh, look, he's like right next to Aang almost. He, he's, he's literally, he's literally right next to Aang in this picture. That's a new one, right? He's right next to Aang. Aang is, um, see? 
<laughs> I wasn't kidding. They, oh, they have Toph. Oh, guys, it's over. It's over. Toph, they have Toph and Lego. It, dude, it's so over. It is so over. Toph is in Lego. They have a Lego Toph. Oh, dude, I'm, I'm only going to use Toph from now on. Like, I, I'm not even kidding. I'm not using anybody else in Lego for at least two weeks. And then they, they have Toph in, like, the Battle Royale mode, too. I wasn't kidding, Draco. There's a tomato guy. A new tomato guy. These are all new Lego characters. Look at that guy. That one's cool. These are oh, look at the look at the the blue apple guy. There's a blue apple in the top top and like up here. There's like a there's like a Viking. That Viking's dope. Oh, there's Zuko. They have a Lego Zuko. They have there's Lego there's like they have two versions of Aang. There's like a pumpkin girl. There's a there's some weird looking character. Oh, they have like the one little chunky boy. The little chunky whatever his name is. They have a Lego version for them. Where's Katara at? There's a blue Poseidon. There's like a weird fish guy in the top. They have some sick new Lego characters. What the hell? <laughs> I wasn't kidding, Draco. Prove it. <laughs> I think you thought I was kidding. I was not kidding at all. They have uh, a skeleton with, like, blue fire for hair. I like a lot of these new characters they added. These are all really cool. Look at that. That guy, that tomato's just screaming, Hey, Draco, can't wait to see you log on Lego Fortnite next. I'll be, I'll be in your village. I'll be waiting for you at home. When you log on, Draco, I'll be right there waiting for you. I'm, me, and my, me and my mustache are excited to see you again. Can't wait to see you log on, Draco. I can, like, I can like, like literally hear him saying that right now to me. Hey, Draco, waiting for you to log on. Can't wait. Do, 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 do. Dude, this is so awesome. So this is what Aang looks like. Um... This is like the avatar version of Aang. Wait, did it not, did it, is it not showing up? What the heck? Why is it not showing up? Is it like a different file? Is my streamlabs glitching hard? There it is. There's the avatar Aang. And then this is regular Aang. <laughs> This one's a lot cooler, in my opinion. I like the... This one looks a lot more, like... I'll use this one a lot more than the other one, probably. But they're both cool. They're both pretty cool. I'm sorry, like... Look at Toph, though. I don't know why I like Toph so much. I think she's such a little... She's so cool. I like Aang so much, but Toph is my favorite. I'm for sure going to use Toph the whole time I'm playing. But I'll, I'll get Aang too. If I get Aang and Toph, I'll be happy. I don't need Zuko. I don't need Katara. I just need Toph and I need Aang. Those are my favorite too. Mm -hmm. He looks really dope. Yeah, they, they have a Lego style for both of them. So regular Aang and like the Avatar Aang, they're, they're, there's two different Lego styles for them too, which is really awesome. You can you can see it here actually, uh, Snowstorm. If you if you see the the, the list right here, there's a uh, there's there's Aang right here on the left left right here. That's one version of Aang, and the other version's over here, right there. So they both got a uh, form and Lego. That was a good idea too. So tomorrow we're gonna check the update out for sure. I'll be streaming it tomorrow. Holy cow, this level's hard. Uh, this is gonna be a great week for gaming. I can't wait for tomorrow. We'll stream some. Uh, I'm gonna try Lego tomorrow. See what's all new. 
Ben, have you lo have you tried to log on the, the new world yet? Have you logged on to the, the old world? Like my first server? I wonder if they fixed it so we can log on to the... I should... Well, I don't think you can actually log on right now, can you? They haven't... It's probably still under maintenance. I'm stupid. But, uh... I'll try it tonight after I end my stream later. I'll try it. I'm guessing you probably can't log in right now. It's probably the case. Please. This is so hard. This level is really difficult. Hella difficult. Let's line it up real perfect. Okay, this is looking great. I'm becoming so much better. Okay, that was that was that was almost perfect. I'm a piranha. Chomp chomp chomp. Someone's gonna clip that for sure. That's gonna be a clip moment. Oh, they brought the birds back. I hate the birds so much. They're really frustrating. I'm a piranha. I'm assuming you have to go this way. Yeah, we do. Oh my God. Actually, he, okay, he did crack my bottle, but it, oh no, 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 please, please, please. He cracked my bottle. Oh, he's gonna come back again, isn't he? But we, he barely missed us. Those birds are so annoying. They're so frustrating to, to, to deal with. Oh my God, what a freaking, I wanna say it again, but I'm, I'm about to. I'm about to call in the word again. <laughs> the, the, the worst part is those, the, they can fly through objects, like, like solid objects. These birds are the worst. Oh, he's coming right for me, I think. I was stuck for a minute. Oh, you piece of freaking. That bird's a dung beetle. That, that bird's a piece of poop. Okay, we have to roll down. There should be like a, some kind of, ooh, is that a, is, no, that's, there's no way I'm gonna survive this, right? Oh, I, I, that's really difficult. Oh, it is, Kayla. This, yeah, this, this game is for sure the definition of rage-inducing. I've failed a lot today. It's fun, though. If you want to take it very seriously, um, it's not that bad. You just got to take it and, and, like, not take it super seriously, and it's very fun. It's supposed to be, it's for sure supposed to be rage-inducing. Like, they want, they want you to get, like, frustrated, you know? You haven't, Draco? I want to do like a Discord watch party for Avatar now. I think you'd like it. Like based on what I've like talked to you about in my streams and stuff, I think you'd like Avatar a lot. It's a really, it's it's got like a lot of comedy to it. It's got a lot of character growth, a lot of good character arcs. The finale is kind of insane. I think you really like Avatar. Yeah, Zuko is very cool. Zuko, I don't want to like spoil the character for you, but his character growth throughout the series, Zuko might have the best character arc in all of Avatar, in my opinion. Even though a lot of other, in terms of character growth, I think you got to give it to Zuko, right? Would you guys agree with me? If you guys are Avatar fans, Zuko has the best character growth, right? Out of all the characters in the show. He's not the best character, probably, in my opinion, but in terms of, like, character growth, he's got to be the best. He's got to have the most growth, right? There's no way he doesn't. I'm trying, I'm trying to think of a character that has more character development than him. Oh, my God. We're going to make it through that. Oh, my Oh, my God. Please. Oh, holy cow. We actually did not die there. But where do I go from here? That's why I do like Zuko. Like, I, I, he's not my favorite character by any means, but I think in terms of, like, the way he was portrayed at the start versus the end is really awesome. 
He does he does have a, a very, very good arc. They're having a picnic over there. I think I'm going the right way. Dude, if that bird comes in. A... He was supposed to do that. He was supposed to do that. I think at least. I'm in the bathtub now. That would that scared the poop out of me. Do do. Yeah, I think he does. Yeah, I think that he has the best character growth. Zuko does. I think he goes. I think he definitely he definitely changes the most throughout the show, right? I just didn't know if there's like a different character that you guys thought had better growth, which is very you know, it's all opinion based. I didn't even know I was supposed to do that. That was really lucky. How do I grab onto that? Am I supposed to like turn the nozzle to turn the... Okay, that's how we do it. Nice. And I'm guessing we gotta do it for both of them, though. Huge. And we fill the bathtub up. Oh, and then we're supposed to, like, maybe jump to the sink. Can I make that jump, though? Oh, no, we don't have to jump. Okay. I think, again, we're supposed to flood this place like we did the other place. So what do I... Okay, we we probably go for this. The radiator, whatever this is. Yeah, the piranha is very cool. Then you think Sokka had the better character growth? So Man, that's embarrassing. There's no way he did. No, I'm kidding. He had, he had a very good growth, too. I agree. I don't think there's really like there's a lot of characters that had great growth so like whoever you think had the best growth but there's no like wrong answer you know but i definitely think zuko's was my favorite arc i like osaka went from being a piece of piece of you know he was kind of a piece of crap towards at least women in the show which i think it was nice to see him out, uh, outgrow that please stop clogging the toilet oh is that what i'm supposed to do oh no are we do we swim in the toilet Dude, no way we do this, right? Is that is that part of this is that part of the solution? Or do we do we have to put stuff inside the toilet and then and then clog it? I'm like stuck in here now. What do I do? I'm like actually stuck in the toilet right now. There we go. I'm guessing I, I got to find some. Oh, we, we got to grab the toilet paper. They made it red on purpose. So we, we bring the toilet paper into the toilet, right? You got to be flipping my pancakes. That's exactly what we do. I'm guessing we have to grab all the toilet paper, grab it. And we got to put it inside the toilet. This naughty fish. This piranha is kind of naughty. <laughs> this piranha is kind of naughty. And then eventually I'm we're going to be able to grab. We're, we can flush the toilet, right? Do we put all the. Maybe we, maybe we don't got to put all the rolls in there. But I'm going to do it anyways. Because I'm a naughty. I'm a naughty piranha. I'm a naughty boy. Maybe, maybe I do have... Maybe I'm supposed to do that. But what... I, I, can I even reach the...
Come on, get out of there, please. How do I do it? Oh my god. There's gotta be like one more thing I can do to is there a way I can I can not the sink. Am I able to like jump up and maybe There's gotta be a way I can grab that, right? There's no way I can't grab that from this. Maybe the, maybe there's not a way. Maybe maybe I can't. How would I do that? Do I have to jump on the table first? I don't know, guys. Am I missing something? I almost feel like I'm I'm supposed to like jump up and grab that next, right? But I, I, I have to do it like can I jump from the toilet? It's not even that high it's not even any higher than that though, right? I don't know what I'm supposed to do here. That's that's very confusing. Property damage. I'm taking the poo. I'm taking the big poo. Hey Ardo, what's up, dude? What's happening, Ardo? Wait, 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 wait. Do I see something in the reflection back here? No, I don't. Is that a plug? That's like a, a bottle. There's got to be a way to actually raise the water level a little bit higher than this. Then I can grab the, the, the... I don't know what to do. I'm lost right now. We're taking a big fat Purana. <laughs> Is there more on this side of the cabinet? Oh, there's a seagull right there. You guys see him? Is there a way that I can signal that seagull that I'm over here? Or maybe I'm supposed to actually uh, under the sink. I don't think so. I checked over here before. Unless I'm wrong. I thought there was something under the sink, but I don't I don't think there is. In the sink. In the sink. Well, how can I jump into the sink from here? There's no way. I don't think I can. Can I? Can I jump from the bathtub to the sink? I don't think so. Maybe I can, actually. I don't know. I probably can. I probably can. I think I just got to do this really perfectly. I think it's possible. I think it actually is possible to do that. Yeah, the showers probably last though, right? Oh, I messed that up. It's, it kind of feels possible that I can jump from the bath. I just got to be smart about it and actually start from... No! No! What the hell, man? What are you talking about? What if I just do that? What if I do it with the... Let's just try this next. Oh, I think I can grab that, actually. Maybe I can grab that. Am I just doing this really wrong? Oh, hell yeah, we can grab that. There we go. There we go. We did it. We figured it out. We figured it out. Let's go! <laughs> I just had to come from the bottom more. Now we do the sink next, or is it shower next? No, nah, we do sink next for sure. I think we're gonna do uh, sink next. Can I even make it up there? There's no way I can't make it in there. Do I go back from the tub side first? I'm like right there. Yeah, it's weird they made the toilet paper red. They made the toilet paper red for, uh... Because they wanted to show me that I could actually interact with it, you know? Which is pr probably smart on their part. How do we get in there?
Do I flush the toilet again? Dude, I think I, I think I can make it in there. I just got to jump better, I think. I'm just not jumping that well. Oh, yeah, there's a way I can get in there for sure. Oh, yeah. I think you just have to be really careful how you time this. There we go. We did it. They make it really hard. You got to be really, really accurate with this. All right, sink is next. And then finally, we have the shower. This is such a cool level. People that own this property are going to be so peed off. They're going to be so peed off. Oh, wow. You got to be careful here, too. You can hit the shower door pretty easily. Wait, 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 wait. I got to... Oh, wait, wait. I, do I have to open the shower door still? You got to open the shower door? How can I open that door when there's so much water here? There's no way. I wouldn't be strong enough to do that, right? I missed. <laughs> hey, Chrissy. It's good to see you. What's up, Chrissy? This should be the last thing we have to do. Oh, I know, Ben. Dude, the water damage in this... Dude, Ben, the water damage here is going to be ridiculous. The water damage is going to be so insane. And the last thing we do is we probably attack the pigeon, right? Yes! <laughs> Let's go! Oh my god, that's awesome. That was my that was my idea. I was like, we probably... That's probably the end of the level, right? It's crazy because... um, Like... I'm only getting two or three stars per level. You can get five stars. If you do the level quickly and you find all the hidden things that I'm not finding, you can you can get five stars per level, but I'm not really worried about that today. So there's three crackers I missed, which is kind of a lot. I just want to beat the game one time. That's all, that's all I'm here for. That was a cool level. That was really cool. Guys, um, I'm going to use the bathroom really quick, and then I'll be right back. And we're going to... I don't think I'm going to finish the game today, but we're going to at least finish the Piranha story today, okay? Uh, I want to thank all of you guys for being here for the stream tonight. I want to thank everyone that hung out tonight, everyone that raided me today, everybody that supported my stream in any possible way you did tonight. I seriously appreciate it very much. Thanks for all the support. Thanks for all the love. I just hurt my wrist. Ow. <laughs> I don't even want to... think. I just chopped my hand. I'm getting old, guys. I just hurt my wrist by chopping my hand. I'm laying down the facts. Thank you all for being here. Thank you all for being part of my streams and my community. I love you all very much. Wait, what? Fortnite removed the rarities on skin, so now we're not going to know how much stuff should be worth or priced. They, re they removed the rarity? I'm like all skins. That doesn't make any sense why they would do that. Why would they do that? Anyways, I'll be back. Give me, give me a minute, guys. I'm gonna, I'm gonna get some quick. I'm gonna get a quick bite of. Uh, I'm gonna get a quick bite of salsa, and then I'm going to get a water, and then I'm gonna be right back. Much love, everybody. Hey, Mumsy. Much love to you too. Thank you very much. Don't clog the toilet. I'm going to go stuff red toilet paper in my toilet and then I'm going to flood my bathroom and I'm going to wait till a seag seagull perches himself on my window and I'm going to jump out of the water like a piranha. I'm going to go <laughs> onto the seagull. I'm going to fly away forever. You guys are never going to see Beacon and Nick ever again. I'll be out of your lives for good.
in any weather i'm never better hello everybody never catch me in the next man sweater if they hate let them hate give me one sec everybody hold up give me one hot diggity second is anybody still awake out there is anybody still awake out there are people still got a pulse everyone's still vibing out there are we still rocking are we still rolling are we still uh how are we feeling everybody how are we feeling <laughs> i can't believe i was gone for a minute i was like i bet you there's there's gonna be probably a couple of you guys that fell asleep but ali is still awake which is so cool and draco is still awake which is so cool and so is snowstorm and so is mumsy Mumsy's like, Nick, I'm barely hanging on. She's like, I'm like on the verge of falling asleep any minute. You're lucky you lucky you came back when you did, because I'm about to pass out. <laughs> I'm glad you're here, Mumsy, still. <laughs> did you really? Bro, I scare the hell out of you guys, don't I? I gotta start coming back and like. Alright, guys. For those of you that are watching my stream right now, I'm sitting back in my chair. I'm like a, you guys are like a prey animals. I'm like a predator. Hey, I'm just letting you guys know. I'm not trying to attack you. I'm just back in my stream. Letting you guys know I'm still here. It's the name of the game. I'm not trying to harm you. Wow, that whole the whole thing was only level one. With the piranha, that was all level one. We just did, I think. Yeah, this is level two. That felt like we did like like that felt like a lot more a dangerous crossing. We're in the woods right now. And then this one starts on a farm, I think. The country life. That one goes to the farm and then the, it's going to be a city eventually. This one goes from this city to like a super creepy woods and then we're probably going to make it back to the. This is a very awesome game. Wait, did it not, Draco? Here, if I turn my if I turn my gain up, I'm gonna crank my gain up. You can hear everything in my room right now, probably. Hey, welcome to the Beacon of Nick. My mic gain is really high right now, so you you could probably hear a skittle at this event across the road. I dropped the skittle on the cement on the other side of my street. But if my gain was all the way cranked up, you guys could hear it super easily. Wouldn't even be hard to hear that. Here, a skittle hit the cement. <laughs> it's crazy. When I crank my gain up, you can hear everything in my whole... I probably sound very loud, too. I'm probably super loud right now. That's the gain all the way up. This is my gain all the way up. Probably start to hear me really well. It's not about even like if I might just once I get like here, you can start hearing everything. I'm just messing with my game right now. This is where you can hear like a lot of things in my vicinity. The karaoke channel. Hello. Here, let me know when you guys can't hear me anymore. Hello, 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 hello. Hello, 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 hello. Now you can hear me again. But I use uh, I for my for my my uh, my mixer. I, I use the Wave XLR, which is honestly a really good mixer for like basic mics. If you have like an XLR mic, I recommend using the Wave XLR. It's very nice, very handy too. I could do a karaoke channel. I just feel like uh, let me start singing some good songs. Hello, it's me. I've been wondering if after all these levels you'd like to meet and go to the ocean together. I'm in a random stream in the middle of the jungle trying to get back to you, trying to get home to you. 
Where am I supposed to go from here? I'm trying to get back home to the one that I love. My friend is in the ocean and I'm trying to get home. Hello, hello, hello. You guys think like an echolocation channel would do well? Hello, 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 hello. That's the newest YouTube uh, fad, echolocation channels. Wait, I, I started from this way, didn't I? I, I'm not, I think I'm backtracking now. Hello, hello, goodbye, goodbye. I'm going down, I'm going the wrong way, I think, aren't I? Or am I not going the wrong way? I think it's gonna stop, eventually it's gonna stop me from going this way, I think. Unless it doesn't, I don't know. But it had me facing the that, that bridge when I started this level, right? Cause I think I, yeah, there's no way I can go any farther this way, right? Hello! Little Draco! Little Draco! Da -da -da. Um, have I played a hat in time? No, I never played a hat in time. I've heard about it though. I hear birds out there chirping. You know, lately, you ever have like a, one of those moods where you want to watch a TV show or a movie that's like a, a thriller? I feel like I've been craving like a good like thr thriller movie with like a big plot twist in it. It's been a long time since I've seen anything like that. That's like what I want to watch lately. I want to find like a really good like political, th not political thriller, but like a like a suspenseful thriller with a really big plot twist in it. And like it keeps you guessing through the whole movie. I love those kind of movies, man. I want to find something like that and watch it soon. That's on my agenda. This has to be where I'm supposed to go. I just don't know where to go from this location. There's probably something I can, I can bite. Ooh. I should be looking for something to bite right now, I think. I'm a piranha. Chomp, 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 chomp. What the hell, man? I'm out of the water now. Do you see how like this part of the bridge is like lit up here though? Can I bite the bridge? Where am I supposed to go? Like actually? Oh, look at over here. There's like a, oh, it's right here. This has gotta be it. There's a light post here for a reason, right? It's probably leading me directly where I'm supposed to go here. There's gonna be, yep, right here. They made, they made like a little, in okay, that's exactly where I'm supposed to go. At least they kind of do signal to you where you're supposed to go. Like there, there was a light there for a reason. That was really smart, like level design by the devs right there. That was really good. Kudos to you devs. You did a good job at that. Ah, I gotta like crack my knuckle. It hurts. Ah. You ever get the, like, the desire to like crack your knuckle out of nowhere? That was me just in this. I don't know what, what that was all about. Like hurt all of a sudden. Do do do, do do do. <laughs> no, not a political thriller. No, 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 not a, not a political thriller, for sure. Um, this game, I think this game came out. Young mind, this game came out in like two thousand and like uh, twenty one, I think. So it's it's almost like three years old, I believe. So it's pretty old. I want to say there's also a DLC for this game and there's they added like some levels, but I'm not sure if that's true or not. There's another there's another game that I, I saw on Steam recently. It was like, uh, oh my God. I think it's called like Superland. Have you guys ever played the game called Superland at all? Do you guys know of Superland at all? <laughs> do you really, Drake? I do too. But sometimes I do crack my knuckles. You ever like, 
when you were in school, Draco, when you were a kid or anybody, did you guys ever have it where like you had those like really cheap plastic chairs and you'd like start class in the morning and you'd like use the chair to like crack your back? That was me all the time when I was like uh in like middle school and elementary school. I'd always crack my back with those chairs. I don't like when other people crack their their knuckles, but I every now and then I do. I don't do it a lot though. I just get like once in a while I have the urge to crack my knuckles, but not all the time. It's just sometimes I do. Holy crap. It's like one of those things where like I'll crack my knuckles, but if you crack yours around me, I'm gonna be really sad. That one's not coming off. Why? Wait, did I just like... I just glitched inside of this thing. I guess that's one That's one way to pass the level. I didn't... I was... That was so weird. <laughs> I just like... I was on one side of it, and all of a sudden I was on the inside of it. I don't know how that even happened. I haven't had my back cracked by like uh, one of my friends in a long time though. Could somebody please crack my back? I need my back cracked pronto. Can somebody please come crack my back for me? Ali, you're so great to have part of my channel and my community. You are so great. I, I cannot even tell you enough how great you are. You're awesome. Thanks for all the good vibes. Thanks for all the good conversations. Thanks for always chilling with us here. I couldn't ask for someone better to have hang out my streams. I really mean that too. You're really awesome. I'll be live again tomorrow, probably, Ali. So I'll see you next time, okay? I'm assuming I can grab onto this this eagle again, right? Yes. I love this feature. Was I was I supposed to do that, or was I not supposed to do that? Emma, you're the best. Have a good time grocery shopping, okay? You're the bomb.com, Emma. I'll be live again tomorrow night, too. So I'll, I'll see you soon. I mean, you're the bomb diggity. And then some. You're the bombest diggity. Never forget, though. I'm a piranha. <laughs> yeah, Emma, you're awesome. I got to do some grocery shopping this morning, too. I need some groceries in my life right now. I just need a few things, so I'll probably go to the store after I stream today. No, I, I could have grabbed onto the eagle. Do you guys see it up there? I, I'm going to go back and try to do that again. Oh, I I think I could have grabbed onto that one eagle, though. That, that was probably like a secret area I could have found. I'll grab onto this one. I think for sure that was probably like a secret eagle or a secret seagull down there. I could have grabbed. Ooh, there's, there's another one right there, too. Damn, I missed him by a second. How do I grab under this one? I, maybe I can't grab those. I think I could have if I would have tried harder. Maybe we can grab this one. It really is Draco. My I like to go during times though where like there's like minimal people there. Cause the the vibes at Meyer at like eleven PM or like five six in the morning are the best vibes. No one's there, you're there alone. I really like the vibes. I don't like to go go grocery shopping when there's a lot of people around me though. Can I not grab that one? I think the best time I ever had grocery shopping is when I went to, uh, we can grab this one. What? What is he doing? Do you guys see him just hit the rock? What was that about? Maybe, maybe uh, I wasn't supposed to have, oh, I wasn't supposed to do that. 
that he just hit the rock. That was so weird. Maybe I'm not supposed to grab onto him. But I remember I went grocery shopping with my mom at midnight before Pokemon Heart Gold and Soul Silver came out. And I was I, I had my Heelys on. I was healing around Meyer when I was I was drinking a Slurpee at the time. Healing around Meyer, just talking about Pokemon with my brother and my brother's friend. We that was the best time I ever had grocery shopping. And I came home and I was watching TV with my my uh my brother and his friend. Me, it was me, my brother, and my friend. We were watching Pokemon on TV, playing Pokemon on our DSs. It was the best time I ever had, man, as like a kid. It was like one of my best moments. My, mo my mom came home and crashed really hard, and then me and my brother and my friend, we were all playing Pokemon Heart Gold together. Well, I, I got a Soul Silver, but you, you, you know what I mean. Am I supposed to go in that river? Where am I supposed to go here? I don't get it. Oh, I survived. I survived the fall. I think I'm lost, though. I'm so lost right now. I I totally agree. Um, Froggy, this game is for sure difficult. So if like you're if it's not easy, <laughs> it's very good. Like I'm not saying the game is not worth. It's it's very worth playing, but it's not easy by any means. I would say that you you definitely need to have like a you got to be like uh, a good at gaming to like have a chance to do well in this game. I feel like you just got to like have like gaming experience and stuff, but it's not the hardest game I've ever played, but there's some levels where I, I got stuck for like, you know, 15 minutes or 20 minutes and I it's not the hardest thing in the world, though. No, some of the reviews where they, they say it's like so insanely hard and like, you know, don't play this game. I think they're, they're kind of full of crap. I haven't had any levels where it's like super duper duper hard yet. But some of the levels have been a little bit hard, yeah. If you're even like remotely good at gaming though, you can play this game for sure. It, you're not going to struggle that much. If you're a very casual gamer, like let's say like you just play games like you play like, you know, just just like games that don't require a lot of like difficulty, which is totally fine. I'd say this game is probably going to be pretty hard for you then. But it's not that it's not that bad if you like you know play a lot of games. So these seagulls almost seem like they're like they're like kind of like they're like they're kind of like cheat codes a little bit in the sense where like they make the you can kind of like skip part of the level, but you also gotta time it right. Ooh, I think we can probably get by this area. How am I supposed to do that? The hell? <laughs> Maybe I can get by this level. Is there a way over this? Can I, am I supposed to grab onto that like... I gotta grab that somehow, right? Or is there a, dif a different way through? I wouldn't say this game is like by any means hell though. It's definitely fun. Once you get the controls down too, it's not that bad. Oh, I can grab that, I think. But some some areas you got you have to be so precise where it feels like it's kind of hard. Oh my god. Like that part right there. Oh my god. I can imagine some people that try that would probably take them a long time, you know? Which is totally respectable because that that's a really hard that, that was pretty hard. They made some things very hard, I will admit. That was pretty that that was relatively difficult in my opinion. But what, it's really fun. Like the game, the game itself is very enjoyable. It's just, it's a little bit hard in some in some places too. So far, the Piranha is my favorite of all, of all the characters. With like the things you can do with him, he's very cool. No, oh, stop grabbing onto stuff, you Nimrod. What are you doing, buddy? Come on, move. There we go. There we go. I'm taking that thing with me. We're stuck in this area. Oh, I, I got one of the, like, you know, the pop can rings. I got the pop can ring stuck on me, so I'm going to die. So like pollution in this game, this game also shows you that pollution 
Did you really, Dilly? You watched Borat for the first time? You haven't seen Borat before, Dilly? Dude, I thought you for sure have seen Borat before. I've only saw it. I saw it one time a, a while ago, though. Borat's really good. I like Borat a lot, Dilly. It's very entertaining. Mm-hmm. Oh, yeah, Rebecca. And if they, there's a lot of people that, like, I don't know, people treat waitresses really poorly. <laughs> I, uh... And I don't, I don't, I don't really understand this sometimes. Even my grandma's this way. Like, my grandma on my mom's side, I, I've seen her treat waitresses kind of poorly sometimes, which makes me really sad. I, I mean, like, not like... Uh, and not like in a bad way. It's just sometimes like I've I've noticed her the way that she treats people that work customer service is the, is different from how I treat people that do customer service. Like sometimes I've seen people, even like you know, just older people in general, just treat people poorly. They they expect a lot. Even if the girl's running over, running all over the place and working her absolute butt off, I, I just don't understand how you can't see that and like don't try to at least just be nice to them. You know, it's very simple to do that. Just to be respectful to people that that work customer service, you know. So like even some sometimes even if I am at a restaurant and I notice that my food is taking forever to come, but if I notice that the the waitress is still working her butt off and she's still overwhelmed, I never get frustrated by it, you know. I know she's doing all she can do. It's it's the it's the restaurant's fault. It's not her fault. So I never try to let that stuff, like, let me, you know, treat anyone poorly, ever. I definitely have seen people treat people in customer service positions very poorly, which is just so hor so horrible. How do I get under here? Where am I supposed to go? Yeah, I just can't, like, I don't know. I've for sure seen, like, people uh it's very easy to treat people with respect you know i will say i've had a couple like waitresses who have, like really been rude to me when i was eating at the restaurant but like even then you just like they're probably having a rough day if i'm rude, if i'm rude to them back what's that gonna solve like maybe if they're rude to me i'll, I'll leave them less of a tip but i'm not ever gonna be rude to them back i'll just be like you know what like And even then, like, I, I try to always be respectful no matter what happens, you know? And a lot of times, if someone's rude to you and you, you're respectful back to them, then they'll be respectful back to you. Like, sometimes I, I have a bad day and I treat people poorly. Like, not I don't try to do it, but everyone does it. And when someone's nice to me still, I'm like, you know what? I was kind of rude to you and you, you're nice to me still, so I'll change my tune and be nice to you too, you know? Kind of thing. I think that's really helpful too in life. How do I get up there? What am I supposed to do? Holy crap. Yo, Ree, what's poppin'? <laughs> hey, Ree, I, I really appreciate you. I love you back. I love you back. Oh, yeah. Dude, young-minded. The feeling of being hungry, sitting down at your favorite restaurant, your food takes a little bit to come, but you get that, like, maybe 20 minutes to just, like, think about how good it's going to be. Then you see them bring it out to you. They put it in front of you. It's a great feeling. Oh, hell yeah. It's a really good feeling. I don't know what I'm supposed to do here. We got some, You guys want some hepatitis C? We got hepatitis C. We got malaria. We got uh, some other... Uh, some other needles that are of some diseases that are transmitted in ways that I want to talk about here. I don't know where I'm supposed to go. I'm just swimming down here. I think I can probably swim up. There's a, there's got to be a way to get up there. I, I don't know what I'm supposed to do, though. I'm going to avoid that. I don't know what I'm supposed to do here. I'm a space-bound rocket ship. Oh my god, dude, Dilly, Dilly, Dilly. Every time I go to a Mexican restaurant, 
I eat so many chips. <laughs> Dude, whenever I go to any Mexican restaurant, I get full off the chips and salsa. And if I have guac too, forget about it. I'm going to be so full by the time my food comes. And then they deliver my food to me. And then basically after that point, I like take half of the food home that I ordered just because I'm not going to finish it all. That's kind of smart because when you get home, you put the Mexican food in your fridge. And then like in the middle of the night, you're like, I need some food. And you're like, oh, I didn't eat all my, I didn't, and like, you remember, you don't, you like, you still have your food left over from before. And when you remember you have that food left over, you just, I think I'm supposed to, I don't know what I'm supposed to do here. This is really, there might be a way to raise the water level, but I don't know if there is. I'm stuck in this cup right now. I gotta get out. I, can I, can I, I'm gonna die. <laughs> All right, we died. There's got to be a way to raise the water level a little bit. Or the, I just got to time that better. See, I'm almost like, uh, I don't know what to do. Let me just swim, swim around a little bit. There's probably a way to raise the water level that I'm not seeing here yet. I, I just got stabbed by... <sighs> oh my god, I just got chlamydia. I just got stabbed by the chlamydia needle. Alright. Let's keep swimming. <laughs> Dude, there's needles! Rebecca, you don't know what kind of needles are floating in here? That... I just got chlamydia. I just got I just got herpes. I just got HIV. There's got to be a way to raise the water level. Hey Shay, I heard. Oh, look it up there. Can I actually chew these pipes? Oh my god, I can chew these pipes, can I? There's got to be. Oh, there's got to be like a weak spot on these pipes, and I chew them. There's a weak spot, right? And I can chew through them. Get off of me. Oh my god. I keep getting this stuff on me. And I got stabbed by the needle again. No, I didn't. I'm good. There's probably a way. You see like where the paint's peeling here? One of these pipes has got to have a weak spot that I can chew through, right? Or is there a tool? Oh my god, you guys. I, I'm going to big brain this. There's a tool floating in the water somewhere that I can grab onto, right? Oh, I can plug the holes up. I can plug these. Okay, th th these are the drains. I plug them up. Watch this. I plug them up. I plug them up. That's what I do. That's got to be a solution. I can plug them up, right? Yeah. Well, now I'm stuck. But I'm pretty sure that's what I do. Oh, I'm, I'm actually stuck. I got to restart the level. But I'm pretty sure these pieces that have got a... Have a maybe once I drag them down, they'll plug the holes up. I don't know for sure though. That's just a hunch. Look at that. Now the water level for will for sure raise, right? It just it, the water level was not that high a minute ago, right? I'm pretty sure it just got raised. And there's another one of those pieces back here, I believe. There is. That, th that took a little bit of thinking. Then we got to drag this one down, and we have to plug this side up without getting chlamydia. There we go. Did it raise even higher? <laughs> this is a this is a really really hard level. Can we plug up all the holes without getting chlamydia? That's the title of the level. Can Beacon and Nick plug the holes in this level without getting chlamydia? That sounds I, that sounds really bad actually. Now that I'm thinking about what I'm saying, that actually sounds a lot worse than what I thought it sounded like. <laughs> okay. Cover your ears. Cover your ears. <laughs> let's let's do some swimming. I'm so close to getting up there, but I'm not quite reaching it. <laughs> yeah. Well, they're red. I know that much. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Here. There's got to be more uh more drains. Can I plug the drains all the way? Ooh, look at that. Is there is there a third drain somewhere in this level that I can <laughs> I know, dude Jordan. That was so bad. I wasn't even thinking about it. 
Like, I, I legit didn't realize how bad that sounded until it came out of my mouth. And I'm like, oh, shoot, dude, that sounds really bad. Does that actually help? Oh, yeah, it, it is raising up, isn't it? The water level, yeah, it's for sure raising. Ben, is it really back? Dude, I'm not going to want to play on that anymore, but is it really back? I mean, I kind of do again, but... Did they, ben, did they did they increase the amount of keys that we can have in that world now? In, like, the new world? Have they touched the amount of keys? Did, did they add any new villagers this time? I gotta go look up all the stuff they added in the new update. This level made me think a lot, actually. This is a very thought-provoking level here. Ben, thank you for the super chat, man. I really appreciate it. The first Lego world is back, baby. I'm guessing I just gotta, I gotta over time, like, turn that all the way, right? Holy cow, I got so much height. I got so much height there. This prana means business. No, you should have saw it. I was playing the first level, and I had, I had to get the goldfish from some random guy's living room to the ocean. And I kept saying I gotta finish my story. I gotta get from his living room to the ocean. <laughs> <laughs> Adrenaline in my gills. Every thought out of control. Swim to the ocean with my friends. The crowd is here, about to blow. Swim into the ocean. Go, go, go. There we go. We did it. Give it all away, I'd give it all away. <laughs> I, I kept saying, I gotta finish my story. I gotta finish my story. <laughs> Adrenaline in my gills. Swimming in the water doesn't pay the bills. Gotta turn these gears, get to freedom. The chat, the chat is here, about to go. No, I do. I do daily, actually. You don't want to play in the same world as me and Shay? I do. It's just the new world is so good. Adrenaline in my teeth. Getting chlamydia isn't the play. This is a hard. This is hard. YouTube took it all away. They took it all away. <laughs> I took my bot sobs. <laughs> Shut up, Tilly. <laughs> oh my God, that's hilarious. To take my freedom. I built my kingdom. Come on, there we go. How was that rate? What did that just raise? Oh, it's this thing right here. So now I think we're able to actually bite these, right? What does that even do though? There's chlamydia in the water. Hey, Noah, thank you so much for being a member for 25 months. I really appreciate that, Noah. I want to see Nick play I Am Bread now. I actually had that game, Noah. I haven't played it before, though. I bought it a while ago. It was in sale a long time ago. I think that's kind of the same, where, like, where this game kind of originated from, like, the idea of this game kind of came from I Am Bread, right? No, I appreciate it very much. Thank you for being a member for 25 months. We're, like, raising the, we're, we're raising the water level, raising the roof. 
No, you're the best. I really mean it. Some of you guys, all of you guys in chat, you guys are seriously, you guys make up the best community around. I'm really blessed to have you guys here every night. I love seeing so many of you guys here in my stream every night. Oh no, he got that gonorrhea, herpes, syphilis clap. LOL, LOL. You got that right, Shay. Shay, say it louder for the people in the back. Shay, say it louder for the fish that are not in this ocean. We're in the Atlantic Ocean. Say it louder for the fish in the Pacific Ocean. They can't hear you. They gotta know about it. <laughs> <laughs> I got there's so many diseases in this water Shay. don't swim in this water go swim somewhere else you don't want to swim here at all what is that blue thing thank you again one more time though I really appreciate it there's gotta be one more of those that I missed isn't there because I'm supposed to be able to go out that door I think or maybe I'm not did I, did I miss one of these? All right, we gotta go back in the in the disgusting, dirty water. Oh, it's this one right here. I did I did miss one. Yeah, I did. So all these gotta be turned on. Back in the gross, disgusting, dirty, filthy, uh, disease infested. You don't know what's in this water. You're gonna come in this water a person. You're gonna leave this water with everything. Okay, go go swim in a in a very in a very clean place. You don't want to swim in this dirty water. It's going to contaminate you. <laughs> Thank you, Lizzie. I appreciate the boobies very much. What I was saying, though, is I really appreciate everyone that's here. You guys are you guys make up some of the best people I could ever hope to have in my chat every night. So thank you for all all the time. I think we have to jump out of the water here and swim into that water here. We just gotta flop and hope for the best. We did it. No, this is where I started from. This is the first place. This is where I started. Oh, you see this right here? We have to we have to move this down now. This I, I'm pretty sure this is where I'm supposed to I'm supposed to go. You see how that's blocked off now? I think that, I, th I think I raised it too high. Oh shoot! I think I raised it too high. I was supposed to be able to swim through here, I think. Can I can I lower it now? Oh god damn! I think it is too high. Am I am I able to lower it again? Ben, no, you didn't. You you gifted me a skin in Fortnite. Ben, shut the hell up. Ben, and I mean that in a very loving way, dude. You didn't have to do that. Ben, why'd you why? 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 You didn't have to do that. I appreciate it very much, but you didn't have to do that. See? You're not supposed to do it all the way. You're supposed to do it just enough. So if you if you turn all of them on, then that's not that that's a mistake. You're supposed to only turn oh, you're supposed to turn on oh what what I'm supposed to do is I'm supposed to turn it on and as it as it drops, I gotta I gotta get in that freaking hole. Get in there! God damn it, you stupid piranha. God damn it. Oh my god. Oh my lordy. Oh my lord. What the hell are you doing, Piranha? Get the thing turned on. Turn on the freaking switch. Come on. Oh my god, you chlamydia piranha. You chlamydia piranha. Thanks, Rebecca. That means a lot to me. Come on, you chlamydia infested piranha. Turn on the freaking switch and then turn it off again. Oh my god. Turn the thing on. Oh my god. People are Black Friday shopping. Oh my god, turn. See, we gotta fill it up all the way. And then we have to. <laughs> well, we gotta. Then we have to uh, take this and we have to grab the handle. And we just gotta crank it like real hard. Bop it. Crank it. Shout it. So then when it drops. Yeah, I think something. I think. Uh, <laughs> I was feeling kind of sick this weekend, right, Shelly? <laughs> so I think my brain is still, like, getting over being sick. So I'm still kind of, like, I'm in a weird mood right now. I'm, like, in, like, I'm, I feel good enough to stream, but, like, I'm, I'm, I still feel a little bit sick from this weekend. So I think I, I think you're getting a rare form of Beacon of Nick today. How the hell is a, oh, my God. How am I supposed to get in that? That's not, that's, that's where I'm supposed to go, right? Come on. Crank the freaking chlamydia crank. Crank the chlamydia. 
We need more chlamydia in the water. Come on. Bite, bite the handle. Crank that chlamydia crank. Let's go. Crank it. <laughs> I'm here for it? All right. I'm glad, Shelly. It makes me happy. <laughs> oh my god, Dilly. Shut That's disgusting. I used your creator code. What did you do now? Oh, maybe I'm supposed to, maybe I'm supposed to, uh... Oh my god. And I gifted chlamydia to many of your beacon community members. Well, that'll get me canceled. Thanks a lot, Dilly. I'm about to get canceled forever now. Yeah, we need a lot more chlamydia in this water. There's not enough. Am I supposed to turn that on and then swim up there like a bat out of hell? Bro, Lizzie just said, please don't tell me you have chlamydia on tap. You don't know what I got, Lizzie. You don't know me. You don't know what I got on tap. You don't know what I got at the ready. You don't know me, Lizzie. You don't know what I got prepared at any given moment. I got that chlamydia on tap. I can't, there's no way I can swim up there fast enough, right? <gasps> Maybe I can. Dude, you cannot tell me that the, the developers of this game said, yeah, Nick can swim up there fast enough to get in that freaking slot. That's, that feels impossible. Is that one closer over here, though? Maybe that one's closer. Is that one closer, you think? It, I think it probably is. I just think that's impossible. How am I going to do this? I got to crank that cr chlamydia crank really hard and then crank it back. Crank that. Bop it. It's like a bop it, but it's a bunch of diseases you don't want to get. Bop it. Spritz it. You don't want... You don't want this bop it. Crank it. Wait, I'm, I'm supposed to leave this one on, aren't I? Yeah. I think I should turn this one back on. Bop it. Crank it. Oh, yeah. Yeah, I think I'm supposed to... I don't know what I'm supposed to do, because there's no way I'm going to make it up there in time. <laughs> this is a this is a very very strange beacon of Nick's stream. <laughs> oh man, what's up, Ty? People coming in the stream are like, God, dude, this is this is for sure. Um, this is for sure not the Nick that I remember. Crank it, bop it, shift it, plow it. I can't turn this one back. Can I swim up there right now? Well, it's going to drop now, right? So what if I drop with it? Is it not going to drop? Hmm. I don't know why that didn't make it drop. I turned that off. Yeah. I've... <laughs> I've... It's not really behind the season, Nick. It's just like, it's just goofy, Nick, you know? I'm usually pretty normal until I'm not normal, and then I get goofy. How is that not, uh... I'm so confused. <laughs> yeah, I'm a different kind of animal today. Th these fish have me acting up a little bit. That's Shelly. I, I just got a thing for fish, man. We all, we all like different stuff in life. I'm, like, really into fish. Especially piranhas. I look at these piranhas, and I, I just can't help myself. I also can't figure out what to do. <laughs> I don't know what I'm doing wrong. I think the game is, like, totally glitching. For sure. I got I got I got poked by something in this water. I got like super poked by something in this water. Maybe I'm not supposed to go in. There's no way I'm not supposed to go in that thing, right? Can I can I pop these? Oh, I'm supposed to pop these, aren't I? These are inflatable things, right? No? I'm a piranha. How can I not pop these? Dude, I have my teeth are sharper than iron. I'm just, like, really into fish. I think fish are attractive. 
I don't know what I'm supposed to do here, though, like, actually. Whew. No, you can't weigh him down, Tony. Like, you have to, it's just a water level thing. <laughs> I'm just kidding. <laughs> you think fish are what? I just think fish are really cute. They're really attractive. No way. Did I do it? That's exactly what I was supposed to do. Wait, I'm going to die. I thought I had it figured out. How the hell was that not what I was supposed to do? And I, now I'm back on like a really earlier part of this. This is a hard level. This is a really hard level. I don't understand it either. Like I, this is so confusing actually to me. How am I supposed to beat this? What the hell? What the hell? This fish is, oh my God, let's turn this. Turn the crank. Yeah, this is this is for sure a really really difficult puzzle game, but like a really fun one. Let's turn the crank until it turns green. Just keep turning the crank. Come on, Beacon of Nick, turn that crank. Hashtag turn that crank. You guys heard what I said. Don't pretend like you didn't hear what I said. I said fish are attractive. Oh my god, I was so close. I was so close. How am I how am I not grabbing it? How am I not cranking it the right way? There's no way. Got it. I gotta crank all these cranks and turn the right way. While also not getting chlamydia from the water. There's tons of chlamydia, there's some syphilis, and there's some gonorrhea in the water today. So, oh, I think I can actually patch those holes up. That's what I'm supposed to do. You see those holes? What I'm supposed to do is I'm supposed to, I'm, I, I turn all of them on and then I probably patch the holes and then that probably makes it drop enough. That's what I'm supposed to do probably. Are there more pieces I can find that can that can like plug those up though maybe? If not, then I, maybe I'm wrong about that. I don't really know. But I'm, I'm sure I'm supposed to turn all these on at least, right? That makes a lot of sense. At the very least, they, they all should for sure come on. I don't understand anything anymore, I guess. And I like, and some of them don't even want to turn right. I really like the Piranha, but I feel like this is definitely one of my least favorite levels from the whole game so far. Overall, this is like just really confusing and frustrating. I didn't do it right the first time. I know that much. See, like, I, and like, it wants to like, like, turn back. No, please work with me, buddy. And now it's like not even working at all. I don't understand. Oh, I can just, I can swim underwater and then turn it. I got you. See, how it, it wants to like turn back to the to, to the the front spot by itself. I can't understand how or why that is. I don't get it. Oh my god, this stupid piranha. This piranha is... This piranha is hot. Please help me out. Alright, we got it. I think I'm, pro I'm probably supposed to turn the handles. <laughs> Sorry. Oh no. <laughs> you guys are No, congrats on being modded. You guys we I just modded Noah recently. Um can we get some hype for Noah being modded finally?
Guys, drop some hearts in chat for Noah finally getting mod. <laughs> it's been a long time coming. He's been he's been part of my channel for a long time. And uh He loves Pokemon Unite, so I was like, you know what? I'll mod him. Congratulations, Noah. You really deserve it. <laughs> Remember the first day Noah found my channel and he trolled me so hard. I said, you know what? I gotta mod this guy. And I did. Oh, you know what? You guys know what the solution is? Okay, I think I take one of these off here. And we... Maybe we maybe we uh, take it off this part and we drag it... I think it's stuck there forever now. Maybe I can't... Maybe I'm actually not able to do that. Oh, shoot. I don't think I can do that at all, actually. Can I, can I like, swim it? Can I, like... Maybe I, maybe I can if I, like, just do it... I don't know, guys. Am I able to actually take this off and, like, move it? I think I messed up, like, big time in this. I think once I... If I can get it off there, which I don't think I can do that. This is just, like, my theory, too. I don't even know if it's going to work at all. I have no idea if this will work. I have no idea if this is going to work. I don't even know what I'm doing anymore, guys. I'll be honest. This level's hard. I'm, I'm trying to push it off the vent so I can grab it again, but I don't think that's even the part. Like, That's probably not exactly what I'm supposed to do in the first place anyways. I don't know. I got so close right there. I should be able to at least get it off the, the vent, right? I don't know. I don't know if, I, if this is even possible. I really have no idea. I can do it. Oh, I did do it. I, I did. Oh, no, I didn't. It actually, oh, it just like went right back to it. You can get it off if you really try, but I think no matter what, it'll still find its way back to the. There's no way this is a, this is a solution. I think I got to find a different solution for this. But I see the problem is here. I see. I see this vent right here. Oh, there's a, there's actually a lot more vents. What can I use to block them? You see how there's a vent right here and there's a vent right here? In theory, I should be able to block those, right? Like, or maybe I can't. I don't know. That, that's probably the wrong idea. I don't know what to do. All I know is this thing is filled. I'm going to try to do it like what I did last time again one more time. And then if, I, if it fails, I don't know what to do. Hey, Tombi, what's happening, dude? How you doing? Yo, Takla, good morning. What's up, Takla? Let's try to do this again. I just think this is going to not end with this again this time. I'll turn the crank. See, my what I was doing before, yeah, jump in it as it's filling. That's that maybe that's the idea. Maybe I try to jump in as it's filling up instead of when it's when it's draining, right? So I'm gonna, I'm gonna let the water level go down, and then as it's going back up, I'm going to try to get in there. That seems like a really good solution, in my opinion. See, I, if I do this, Draco, if I if I turn this right here, there's there's gonna be enough of an opening. But I gotta turn it back in time and then swim up there back in time. So I, I gotta like haul freaking. I gotta haul butt right now. Let's go. Swim, 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 swim. Like your life depends on it. Go, go, go. It's it's filling. Go. Oh my god. See, I don't have enough time. Oh maybe I do. It's it's just so close. Like, I don't know if it's even possible. And for some reason, this I thought this one's closer. But if I fill if if I do this one right here. Oh, that one's still red. Why is that one still red? That one, this one should also be green. Why is this? I, I didn't do this one yet. What the heck? Let's turn this one over to green.
Maybe there's still, is there a place? What's, what's on the very, very, very top of this? Oh, there's actually, oh, that, I've already been over there, right? And over here. Unless like the real place I have to go is that way. Is there more over here that I haven't been to yet? Maybe, maybe there's one more of those things and it's over there. There might be actually one more at the find. I don't know. Let, let's see what's over here right now. Aha. There is not, I don't think. I'm just going to die, I think. Unless there is. No, I've already been this area. I've already been over here. There's a whole lot of nothing over here. I turned them all on. But I don't think the whole idea is turning them all on. I just need, I need them on enough where I can still escape, you know? That's the problem. Maybe I try it again. Maybe you're right. Maybe maybe you just gotta have it be enough. You gotta find which ones you turn off just to make the, the water level perfect. But how would you know? How would you know which one to turn off? I'm guessing one like you gotta have leave one of them off so there's a perfect amount of water, right? So you don't you definitely don't want all of them on. How do you know which one to turn off? That's my question. Is it just is it just like trial and error? That's gotta be what it is, right? At some point it'll drop enough where it'll still just be open. Is that the solution? Did I just figure it out? See, but now it's open. I can I could have swam in there, but the water level drops way too fast before I can even do anything in there. Oh okay, 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 okay. I think I understand right now what I'm supposed to do. This one has to stay on, I believe. It's just confusing for me. See, I, in my, oh, I just got stuck by Chlamydia. I got Chlamydia, I'm dying. Yep, I just got Chlamydia. I'm for sure gonna die here, unless I can, unless, oh, I just, I just, uh, regress to my previous save no i gotta restart again i gotta restart again this is a very difficult level like a really really difficult level i almost feel like uh i just gotta turn like leave one of them off I got the, I just got freaking chlamydia. <laughs> no rip. Yeah, chlamydia needle will get you. That one's gotta go on. That one has to be on. Okay, Star Rock said try the upper two valve. There's a valve I want to try that goes right here. Like this one, I want to turn this one off. That one seems to be pretty level with the one I need to go turn on. Those needles are really sus though. Like they just come out of nowhere and they just poke you. That's okay. All systems are go. But what's the level right now? Where are we at? We're almost there. Like we're very close to being there, right? I just need it to be filled up a little bit more. So what if I just do this one next? There's, there's going to be a certain, like there's a couple I got to leave on and there's some I got to leave off. Let's just try this one next. We'll see what happens. I think that's almost perfect. No, not quite. It's going up by a little bit, but I, it's it's got to be one more higher. Like a little bit higher and I'm good. 
Oh, I'm stuck in the rings. I got to break out of this somehow. I'm not sure how to do this. I think I just die, guys. I'm not sure if I'm going to be able to make... Oh, I think I die. No, please. Oh, my God. Dilly, you need to get a... Dilly, you need therapy, dude. Dilly, you need therapy for sure. You need therapy for sure. So can someone... Do you guys have any good therapists you want to tell Dilly about right now? I know. Those needles are, are really pernicious. Dilly, I love you, brother, but you need therapy. <laughs> I know, Kayla. I'm with you. <laughs> I'm the one saying chlamydia, though, so you know what? I have no room to talk. I'm like... I like... Uh, I brought the unhingedness, and Dilly's just kind of building on my unhingedness, so... Said even I'm concerned. You have every right to be, Kayla. I'm just the bill. I'm just a greasy spoon without you. I'm just the grill. I'm just a greasy spoon without you. This grill is not a home. I would trade it all the way. Maybe it's just this one that turns on next. Let me try this. How does it look from this? Please stop. See, now it goes up way too high. So I'm guessing there's one I got to turn off now. It's, it's got to be at the perfect level. So I got to figure out which ones I got to... Maybe I, that one's already off, right? Do I turn off... An, now that we turn the other one on, do I turn this one off? And maybe it'll be perfect. Let's try it. See, the level went down by very little. What if I turn this one off too? Will that be enough, do you think? What if this one also gets turned off? And they're both off. It's so close, but it's not close enough. We just gotta find the perfect medium where it's... Crank it. Bop it. Twist it. We'll see what happens. I don't, I'm not predicting good results here, but you never know. Ah, oh, it's so close. That one gets turned off. And then can we turn this one back on? Oh, it's still going down, isn't it? Oh, it's still going down a little bit. Oh, it's going way down. No, that's not the solution at all. What, I have a, I have a, I have a theory though. What if this one's on? I have a, I have an idea. This might be crazy, but it, it might work. And there's probably a way to like actually figure out which ones should be turned on and turned off. And I'm like not really understanding it, but this is a tough level, man. I'm the booger zaddy. <laughs> Then this one gets turned on, right? Let's crank this one on, see what happens. This is totally trial and error here, but we'll see what happens here. Now it goes up. This might actually be perfect. Draco, I'm going to probably go to bed after I beat this level two. Oh, I think I beat it. No, I didn't beat it. Now it's all the way up. I'm probably going to go to bed pretty pretty shortly after I beat this level. I, I really, really, really appreciate you, Draco. Thanks for being so awesome. You're a really, really great friend. I want to go to bed after I beat this, too. Oh, we'll, we'll, maybe, we'll probably do one more after this. Tomorrow's going to be fun. We're going to check out all the Fortnite updates. 
Maybe you crank them and then... <laughs> Tilly, shut up. Shut up! Is that it? No, it's not it. Did I just get stabbed by something? No, I didn't. Okay. What am I supposed to do? Let's do one more. Next definition of one more is 28 more levels. Oh, Dilly, you're okay. I thought you were actually never mind. Never mind. I thought you were Dilly. I didn't read I didn't read your joke right, sorry. I did not read that right even a little bit. <laughs> dude, it sounds so dirty. Maybe dude, Dilly, the what you just said sounds so dirty. Bro, like actually sounds disgusting what you just said, Dilly. It sounds gross. Oh, I'm gonna die again, I think. How do you like stop when you get when you get caught in these like freaking how do you get out of these? Is there is there is there a way to do like get out of this when you're stuck in these? Okay, wait. How am I, wait? I'm I'm respawning. Oh man. There's got to be a way to know which ones to leave on and leave off. I think I I'm supposed to leave one on and turn the rest off is my what I'm supposed to do at some point, right? So that, that last comment, I know it was innocent, but it sounded so dirty. <laughs> it sounded so disgusting. <laughs> Doesn't matter, Dilly. Shut up anyways. Thank you, Late Art. Late Art, you just get it, you know? You just understand. You just under like you just get things. In like a way that no one else gets them. You just you just get it. Exactly. What was that one? What was that one promo? Um. Sometimes when Dilly doesn't get stuff, I gotta speak to him in promos. Like when Dilly's like, yeah, I don't understand the meaning of that. And then I, I explain it in promo terms. He's like, oh, I understand now. I gotta level with Dilly in promo terms. He's like, Nick, I don't understand what you're saying. Can you, can you say that? Like, uh. Like an Ezekiel Jackson promo? I said, yeah, no problem, Billy. I'll, I'll, I'll help you understand. When Dilly's in school, he's like, I'm not, I don't quite understand the the way you're describing this physical therapy uh, physical therapy subject. Could you could you speak to me in a Santino Morella promo? No problem, Dilly. I'll help you understand. <laughs> Come on, crank it, pull it, screw it. Crank it, there we go. Twist it, pop it. <laughs> Aw, Draco, I appreciate you. Add the stream to my favorites. I'm glad you're having a good time. That makes me happy. I just think I'm overthinking this, and once I figure out what I'm supposed to do, it's going to feel like... I'll feel like kind of dumb, you know? This has seriously been one of my favorite games I've streamed before, though. Very good. I like the, I like the vibes. I really like... Um, I'm assuming that... You see how close this is to being where I need it to be? Which one of these is, like, level with this? Like, all of them are. Which is what I'm not understanding. I'm going to turn all of them on. I'm assuming I turn all of them on and then I have to turn one off, right? I'm glad, Rebecca. I'm really happy you're having a good time, too. So one of these should not be turned on, right? This one is way... This one makes it way too full. Like This one right here makes it way too full, I believe. Yeah, Star said not that. I think I know what you're talking about. This is way, way, way too full. See? I overfilled it by a lot. Now we gotta go turn some of them off, I believe, is the solution here. 
But I thought maybe we just plug them up again, but that's, that can't be the solution. Let me go turn off a couple of these. That's what I'm thinking. Turn the lowest one off. This is the first one that I did, right? Yeah. That's what I've done before, though. I've, I've done all of them, and I turned this one off. That was what I was thinking. Now, you, now we go back and turn this one off. It drains, but it doesn't drain enough. It, it barely drains at all. Well, it actually does drain quite a bit. See, I can get in the, I can get in there, but it, it's not gonna be good. I guess. So that that one, that one has to stay on. I've already tried that, Tony. It, it, I, I can't get there quick enough. I, I was rushing there before. I, I don't think rushing there is a solution. I, I don't think that's what it wants me to do. I think I'm supposed to turn off maybe one of these back here. What if I what if I do this one next? So what what if I turn off these back two, in theory? This is gonna drain. Is that too much? No, it's still very high. Holy crap! It's still. How is it still filled to the roof? So what if I turn this one off and this one off? Let's try to turn off this one too, in theory. See what happens. I think, I think this is the one. I think that's for sure the one. And then maybe we turn the other one back on. Is it, gonna, is it gonna stop in a perfect place? Okay, we drop that one and we turn this one back on maybe. Did I, did I just get stabbed by something? No, I'm good. Oh my God, I thought I, I, I thought I just got hit by give the gonorrhea needle. Yeah, then we turn this one back on, I think. That's what, that's what I was thinking too. Let's just try to turn the ones off that No, it's still it now it's back now it's back all the all the way full. What if I just do the ones on the left side? What if I turn this one off again too? Let's turn this one off again on this side. I think I think we got it. Because we got it, we got it, we got it, we got it. It's all, it, it's perfect. We got it, we got it, we figured it out. Dude, that was the hardest level. Holy frick, that was hard. Oh my God. Oh my God. That was way harder than I ever thought a level would be. That took, was I stuck there for almost an hour? I like for real thing we were stuck there for almost an hour. Oh my god. I feel so validated. I feel so happy we figured that out. And now we're stuck. This game is phenomenal. This game is actually phenomenal. Is there a checkpoint here, by the way? Because now we have to... Oh, you guys... Because we have to cross the road... Guys, there's there's little puddles and you guys see the puddles out there watch this watch this there's puddles in the street we have to we have to get to the puddles without without getting run over by cars we have to basically survive in potholes without cars running us over right now it's not over yeah this is i don't think it's over noah <laughs> I didn't see a checkpoint either, which is, which scares me, but there, I'm sure there probably was. Ooh. Oh my God, we're gonna get run over. This is cruel and unusual punishment. The checkpoint's right there, do you guys see it? It's right there. That, 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 that orange thing is a checkpoint. I feel so bad for this poor, this poor piranha. This poor guy did not ask for this. I'm gonna go after, when do I go? <laughs> after this car? 
Go, 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 go. Oh my God, we're gonna die. Yeah, in wrestling terms, I just beat The Rock, but Roman's up next. I've never seen a, a closer call in my life than that call right there. That was actually so crazy. That was so crazy close. I'm so scared to even cross. I'm gonna cross. <gasps> no, 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 no. I, I would have just died there. Uh, no, I shouldn't go now. I, I had a chance, but I, I wasted it. I, I, I keep, I keep, I keep. Oh my god, that that last. <gasps> oh my god, I'm out. I'm out. I'm out. Oh my god, get in, get in, get in. Oh my god. And then we can we can just go in this pipe here. Thank the Lord. Is is the checkpoint. Checkpoint. This game really knows how to like make your heart drop. God, I thought we were gonna die there for sure. That there was so many close calls in a row. It's such a cool level though. It's a very cool level design. When you're underwater, I like how it's quiet, and when you when you can when you're above water, it's very loud again. You know, that was awesome. That was awesome. Crossy roads, but we still have to get to the other. At least if we die here again, we're, we'll be able to survive. Oh, we're gonna get run over for sure. Oh, I didn't die though. I just gotta I just gotta get to. The, oh, I'm for sure gonna die now. <laughs> okay at least i'm still here you know what i mean so if a car hits us it doesn't necessarily kill us it just sends us flying we just get sent packing to like another dimension hey kieran what's happening friend oh i i'm glad i didn't jump there okay that was that was huge Uh, what is that light right there? Yeah, the fact that a piranha survived getting rammed by a car is a miracle. I agree, Noah. It's a, it is a miracle. We're surviving a lot here, actually. This is one of my favorite games I've ever played in a, like, you know, in terms of like, just like for fun and like for, I'm really happy I played this today and found it. Come on, flop. Jesus Christ, this is so scary. They, they really did this a good job with this game, but it's so scary. There's, there's, the, there's the next checkpoint over there. I gotta get to it. Like when, like you, when, you've, when, you're, when you're out of the water, you feel, you, like you just feel so vulnerable. Let's just go. I don't need, I, there, there's probably a car coming. There's probably, oh yeah, there's a car coming for sure. All right, we're, we're surviving. That was my favorite part of the whole game so far, those potholes right there. That was awesome. That was for sure my favorite part of the whole game so far. I like being underwater. I feel very calm. I feel very happy. Nothing can hurt me. Nothing can stop me. Yeah, that was a very scary highway. <laughs> hey Shelly, thanks for being along the, along the ride with me today. You're awesome, and for putting up with all my gonorrhea talk and all my chlamydia talk. <laughs> I'm so sorry for being who I am today. <laughs> like when I see a needle in the water like that, I can't. My brain cannot cannot be like. I can't help myself from saying like, yeah, it's definitely chlamydia right there. <laughs> so stupid. We're swimming beneath the highway. Ooh, what was that right there? There's like a series of pipes. We gotta find our way. Oh, not enough. Wait, is this where I just came from? No, it is not. This is a brand new highway. I thought I had, I thought I was, oh my God, get back in the water, please. I thought it was over. Do I have to hop? out of the water and then flop to the other. I can't flop all the way over there, right? With, oh, first, not, not not anymore. There's gotta be a different way, but there's gotta be a different way with uh, using the pipes, you know? Oh, 
Wait, that was... Okay, I'm supposed to go this way. I was so confused for a minute. I would definitely, definitely play this game again on stream. I would definitely play this game again. The real chlamydia is the koalas we made along the way. That's a beautiful thing. You, that's really beautiful, Kate. I feel that in my bones. When you just said that in my stream, Kate, I felt that in my heart. I just felt that, Kate. That really has a lot of meaning to me. You're speaking my language, Kate. I felt that in my bones. Was this where I was? Is this where I, did I get a checkpoint? No, the checkpoint's right there. We need to find a way to get over there. <laughs> Got it. Okay, that was the checkpoint right there. I think the next one is going to be. I I don't know where the next one's going to be. <laughs> that means a lot to me. This has been the most inappropriate but satisfying stream I've ever I've been a part of so far. The words, uh, <laughs> those are interesting word choices to put together. That's hilarious. Thanks, Shelly. You're you're one of my favorite people. I appreciate that. I really enjoy having you around. I really, really do. I think I'm supposed to just hop from this puddle to the next one. I gotta hope there's no cars coming. I kind of almost feel like we're dodging a lot of, like a lot of cars, we're dodging them. I feel like we're doing a good job. But that car for sure could have just clobbered us, but it's not clobbering us. Did we just cause a massive accident? You did it? What did I do? I killed people? Dude, I did not expect that. I don't know what that means. I did it. That's, that's horrible. I killed people. Probably. Am I supposed to feel good about that? I did it. That scared me. I did not expect that. I know. Holy God. That, I did not expect that at all. That was terrifying. Holy, f holy moly. That was scary. But that was part of the game. Here, and this game is really cool. So, like, the game starts, and these four fish are in a fish tank, and they get split up around, like, this whole map right here. So the whole story is, like, you have to play as the individual fish and then play these different levels, and you have to all get them all back to the ocean together. So it's kind of like Finding Nemo in a way, but th there's, like, different, like, fish bowls you have to roll around in. There was a nightclub at one point we were in. So there's like a goldfish, there's like a uh, a puff puffer fish, there's a piranha, and there's like a weird looking long fish that you play as. But the game is really, really fun. I, I really enjoy it. This has been one of my favorite games I've played in a while. I'll probably I'll probably play more of this this week. I'll probably finish it up. It's really good. <laughs> Draco, I'm so sorry. Guys, I do think... We're, we're, I think we're just going to call it here for a stream, though, guys. I'm pretty content with how everything went tonight. And I'm, like, still kind of, like, getting over being sick right now. So I don't want to push myself to, like, stream too long. I've been live for, like, a while anyways. So we'll probably call it here for the stream. And then we'll... Play, I'll, I'll be live tomorrow night for a lot longer. 
I'm gonna be playing. Uh, actually, before I do end my stream, I gotta see what Ben gifted me in in Fortnite. I'm gonna go check out the Fortnite shop before I end stream. Wait, did I save my progress? Wait, we're only 21% of the way done. I want to see what Ben gifted me in Fortnite. He said he gifted me something, so I gotta honor. I gotta. I'm gonna honor that and check it out. We're gonna open up Fortnite and see what he gifted me. I'm just gonna not like stream. I mean, I've, I've been like live for a while. I've been enjoying the hell out of this, so I'll definitely stream more of this later for sure. Later, you're the best. Thank. You. If you guys enjoyed your time here, if you guys enjoyed your time with me here, it means a lot to me. If if I made your day better by being here, it means means a lot to me. So, <laughs> play the Kong, play the Kong GIF. <laughs> uh, I probably will. Rebecca, I'll probably do a game or two in Discord if any, if anybody wants. If you guys remember, I'll probably play one or two games this morning probably. Then I'm gonna get some big rest. Um, Jordan, thank you. Shelby, I'm so glad you're here all the time. I know I tell you that all the time. I'm really happy you're here all the time. Um, thank you so much, Shelly, Rebecca, Ben Solo. I don't know what the I don't know I, I don't know what this is gonna be. <laughs> I'm like I'm like kind of nervous. I don't want to open it <laughs> just because I, I I see Ben whenever Ben says that I'm waiting for next reaction. Oh my God. Okay. First of all, okay. First of all, first of all, Ben Solo. Oh my Lord. Oh, dude. I was hoping it wasn't this because I can't contain myself. Oh my God, Ben. Oh dude. You're the, you're my favorite person ever. Ben, you don't, you don't even know how much I like Toph. She's one of my favorite characters. Ben, you're my, you're the goat. You are the best, and I freaking appreciate you, dude. Uh. I didn't even know she was in the shop already. Dude, I can't even tell you how much this means to me, Ben. I really can't even tell you. She has a rumble belt. She's got a championship belt. Seriously, Ben, you're the best, dude. And she has some more hammers. Yeah, she, this, that, that's my new permanent skin. I'm going to use that like every game now. Thank you so, so much. I feel really, really grateful, Ben. I really feel so grateful. Thanks to uh, a metric crap ton. What? They had. Ah, oh, dude. I'm so happy they actually have this bundle. This is such a cool bundle. It's crazy how much it costs for all of it, though. And did you. Was that 2,000 V-Bucks you spent? I can't believe you just spent 2,000 V-Bucks to get me. Dude, I can't thank you enough. Man. Dude, I can't even tell you how much I like Toph. I gotta play a game as Toph. We're gonna play a game as Toph in the stream right now. I'm for sure gonna end my stream playing a game as Toph. There's no doubt. Do you wanna, do you wanna play a duo game, Ben? I'd like to duo with you today if you wanna play one game before I end stream. I'd really like to do that today. Because there's no way I'm gonna get Toph and not, not try her out. She's really my favorite character from Avatar by far. And one of my favorite characters of all time, actually. <sighs> Dude, I'm so happy right now. I'm so unbelievably happy right now. You're such a nice guy, Ben. 
I don't think I'm gonna play another character in Fortnite forever. I'm just gonna play. I'm just gonna be a Toph main. <laughs> I'm gonna be a boring. I'm gonna be a boring Toph main for the rest of my life playing Fortnite. I, I'm happy. Toph is so cool. I gotta find a glider for her. I don't even know what to use. I'm gonna use like the basic green glider because I don't have a. I don't have one for her. Thank you so much, Ben. I really, really, really appreciate it. Oh, I'm so happy. I'm so happy. She's so cool. Did, did they end up at, did they add like firebending and uh all the stuff to to battle royale right now too guys could, could, could would you guys do me a favor would you guys please drop a lot of hearts in chat for ben i want to i want to do a duo game with you ben for for getting me this it would really mean a lot if i could with you <laughs> of course draco of course I'll, I'll check out zuko for you of course i will this is uh what Zuko looks like in the shop. This is the Fortnite version. Or the Lego Fortnite version. And then this is uh you get like a his like sword. And that's it, that's his pickaxe. And this is Katara. Draco, I'm telling you, you should definitely check out Avatar. It's a really good show. It's one of my favorite shows like ever. <laughs> dude, they, they did they did Toph so well. Like, I don't even know how to describe it, dude. She oh, I'm so happy. Ben, I love you for this. I really love you for this. Thank you so damn much, Ben. Thank you so 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 damn much. This is the way. <laughs> dude, thank you. I I can, like saying thank you to you right now does not even sum up how much I appreciate it. Like it, it's stupid how much my saying thank you doesn't even equate to how much I appreciate this dude. It's like my childhood. <laughs> uh, I, I grew up and I always thought that Toph was the coolest character. I don't know if you guys know this, but she's she's uh she's blind, so she can't see at all. But well, she can see, but she uses she's she's an earthbender, so she uses the vibrations of the earth to actually see where things are around her. But she's totally blind like she can't see she just senses she like senses where she is using the ground and that's how she can sense where she is like she kind of uses like uh, vibrations from the earth and she's such a she's just a she just kicks so much freaking butt dude so i always thought even though like she was blind she never let that hold her back and i thought she was a really cool character for that in that sense oh yeah Toph is the best i already like this i already, Oh, I'm so happy I can play as Toph. Ben, you're the you're the greatest. Seriously, you're the greatest. Thank you very much. But yeah, she's blind actually, uh, Draco. And that's kind of why, like, in the in the show, like, it kind of it kind of shows you how she sees. And the whole world's like black, you know, like when it shows like you her perspective, everything's black. And when people make like uh like rumblings, it'll like kind of vibrate, and that's how they can kind of see how she sees a little bit. And that's kind of why I just like thought she was like a really cool character, and like she'll like uh, stomp on the ground and she'll she'll send like part of the earth flying up, and then she'll send it flying at somebody. I'm I'm telling you, there's no cooler character in Avatar than Toph. She's the coolest character, and I know I'm biased, but I really I don't I don't care that I'm biased. She's legit the coolest Avatar character. She's blind and she's a, she's a better Earthbender than almost anybody. Like there's very 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 few people that are are a better Earthbender than she is. You gotta watch the show. Toph is just the is the best. Me too, Ben. I don't care if I win or lose this game. I just like that I'm playing as Toph. Ah. <sighs> Draco, what the hell? And that was kind of after what we were talking about tonight. Remember? I'm sure it's just a glitch. That is kind of weird because we were just talking about like that kind of stuff today. 
Draco, I'm, I'm like dead serious. I want to do like some Discord avatar nights just so I can like people people that haven't watched the show can like check it out because it's such a good show. Dude, I'm playing as Toph right now. <laughs> I'm playing as Toph right now. It's so awesome. I got to get a win for Toph. If I'm playing her for my first game, I have to get a win as Toph. Yeah, knock on wood for sure. I don't know. <gasps> what? Okay, I took my first fall damage as Toph. My first Toph fall damage. <laughs> Had to happen eventually. <laughs> hey, what's up, Kimbo? We should, we should like, set, like, uh, we should set some time aside every week where, like, if, if you guys want to watch Avatar with all of us, we can all, like, do a big watch party for Avatar. Like, maybe a certain night, if you guys want to watch together, we can all watch and maybe... We can do like maybe two or three episodes uh, per week or something. And that way, by like maybe like the you know end of summer, we can finish the whole series. I'd be very down to do that. And we could do like uh, we could we could probably you know talk about it, and we could have like a, gr a group chat just for the show. I really like that. It feels it feels like they changed. Something feels different about my, my movements in this right now. I don't know how to describe it, but something feels a lot different. Ooh. I'm feeling spicy today, guys. I'm feeling real spicy today. There's the footsteps. Is your friend down here? <laughs> I feel so bad. I, I just wanted I wanted to knock somebody with their hammers. That's what I wanted to do. I was like, if I'm gonna That was I, I hate doing that to people, but I That was a bot for sure. That was hundred percent a bot. I guess I'm guessing both those people were probably bots. Man, I really appreciate the gift, man. Toph is my favorite. I really do appreciate the gift so much. Thank you very much, dude. I don't know if I, Ben, did I just, did I send you flying? I didn't mean to send you flying if I did. That was a total jerk move if I did that to you. I didn't mean it, Ben. Dude, she has hammers. Like, you, you can't beat, you cannot beat that. You're gonna, I think this week you're gonna see everyone playing as, like, Aang, but I'm, I'm not, I'm just gonna play as Toph the whole time. I'm playing as Toph the whole time. She's my, ah. Uh, There's an epic chest up here, which is kind of crazy. We're coming through. We're on the news. Dilly, I just... Dude, uh, Ben just gifted me uh, Toph, so I'm, I gotta try Toph out today. Shelby, would you, would you be down? Okay, if you're down, I'm down. We, we can get you to rewatch it. We can, we can get Draco to watch it for the first time. I, uh, I rewatched the the last book with like the finale like maybe a year ago, but I haven't seen like the middle of the show like the middle section of the show in a long time. So if you're down, I'm down. Oh, <gasps> water! We found it's, that's water bending. It doesn't really fit Toph at all, but now Toph's a water bender. This is not fitting for Toph at all, but I'll take it. Well, we'll do a big Discord watch party for it. I promise. You have my word. Um, maybe what I could do is I could put something in Discord and I could probably organize it and we could find when we should... Maybe we can start it like next week or something. We'll find a day that we can all start it on and watch it together. Yeah, Froggy. Um, so in chess, you can find water bending, earth bending, fire bending, and air bending. I don't know if they actually added those those new ones, but by the end of this week, they're gonna you can actually find all the bending elements in chess. I think it might just be water bending right now though. And it's really good. Like you can do a lot of damage and get a lot of knockouts with this. Thanks, Benjamin. <laughs> yeah, you are, Draco. You're a cool kid. Of course you're invited. 
I would say you're a cool kid. So you're 100% invited to the cool kids table. Okay, Ben, you're in, you're in the car. I would love to watch with you. We could have like, we can definitely have like a, I'm not a, I'm not an expert on cool kids, but if I had to say, I think you're a pretty cool kid. Yeah, Dilly, Dilly, I, Dilly I, I swear to God, they did not add Sokka. I swear to God, unless he's in the battle pass, I don't think they're going to add Sokka to the game. They might put him in the battle pass, someone told me, but I don't think they're going to. From what I heard, they're not going to. So I don't think they're adding Sokka at all. Which, that's probably going to anger a lot of people. And they're probably going to justify it and be like, well, he's not a bender, but... I think people would still want to see Sokka in the game overall. He's like one of the most popular characters, so I don't know why they wouldn't do it. But in the shop right now, they have Katara, Zuko, and they have Toph. They don't have Sokka. I think Dilly's going to uninstall Fortnite right now. <laughs> he said, yeah, I think I'm done playing Fortnite. It's honestly kind of a miss, in my opinion, you know? Not just kind of a miss, it is a miss. Because even though I don't like Sokka that much, I think Sokka is just like, okay. Not a really big Sokka fan, but I know a lot of people like Sokka a lot, so I can't, I can't say that uh, it's not a miss for Fortnite. If you want that, Ben, you can have it. I already have water bending, so. I don't know. I think Sokka's a great character. He deserved to be in the game. Because you know how many people would want to play as Katara and Sokka? Like, if you're going to duo, like, why would you not want to be them? You know? I would, I would, I would pick Toph, because she's my favorite. Like, dude, I'm playing as Toph right now. Ah, uh, I love her so much. She's the, she's actually the best. Oh, there's a guy like right here. If we, Ben, if we get a win together for my first game as Toph, I'm going to cry. Like, I'm going to cry happy tears right now. Ooh, there's people, someone incoming. They're like right over there, Ben, I think. I don't want to get sniped. Chrissy, you're... I didn't see what they... What is Zuko's back bling? Did I even see what it was? I was showing Draco Zuko. Did I show his back drink? Uh, back, black. I said back drink. Did I show his back bling? <laughs> I don't remember if I did or not. I gotta double check. Oh my god. I miss that guy every time. I'm getting lit up by that guy. I'm, I'm gonna I'm gonna get that knockout. Oh no! Ben, I'm 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 KO'd, man. I'm knocked. They're gonna they're gonna come over here for sure. They're running. What steps? Right here. Oh my god, good job, Ben. Hella hella good job. That guy just ran into trouble. Oh, but we just got blown up. <laughs> we just got blown up. Oh, yeah, it, it, it's his sword, isn't it? That's what it is. We can do one more, Ben. We can do one more. I was just too excited. to. I was just, like, bending and just throwing water at them. I should have pulled out my DMR. Uh, we can do one more.
I'm so happy. The the game we played tonight on stream was so fun. I really enjoyed it, and I didn't expect to get it pop as a gift. Thanks again, Ben. One more time. That's very, it's so nice of you, dude. I'm really grateful. I'm really, really grateful for you, Ben, for being so nice. I owe you very much for being so nice to me and supportive. <laughs> I want to see if I can find the GIF really quick, Draco, of Toph uh, earthbending. I mean, this doesn't really show like how how cool she actually is, but this is like, oh wait, maybe maybe this is gonna be good. Oh, she's so cool. <laughs> Toph, uh, Jif. There's so many cool moments when, like, showing her earthbending. I just... She's such a freaking... There's there's a lot of cool ones. I'll, we'll have to do a watch party. Billy, I'm sorry, man. I didn't want to tell you until you saw for yourself, because I feel like you wouldn't... You would have been sad about that. Chrissy, do you also like uh, Uncle Iroh a lot? I was talking about it earlier tonight, Chrissy. I think Zuko has the best character growth from any... Maybe Sokka's close. But from, like, where he started in the show to where he ended up, I think Zuko has to have, like, probably had the best character arc in all of Avatar. In my opinion, Toph is the coolest character. My favorite by far. Zuko had the best character growth. Aang was the most likable character, obviously. Katara was the most compassionate and the most caring, and the one you'd probably want to, like, be part of your tribe to, to look after you. She definitely had the best, like, you know, compassionate, caring vibes. Toph was just the coolest. I thought I was... And the, you kind of... The, you want Toph to win because, like, she's blind, and you want you want to see her do well, you know? And, like, you, you want to root for her. She's very easy to root for. I feel like she uh, she's overcame a lot in your life. And then Sokka was the funniest, obviously. He was by far the funniest character. The, 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 it's just they're just such a group, great group of characters in that show that you just makes you want to watch and watch more and then watch some more and then watch some more and then watch some more. And Uncle Iroh for sure had the best wisdom. You know, like if you if you were kind of like a misguided youth, you would want you would want an Uncle Iroh to look after you because he kind of he guided Zuko in a way that nobody else really could. Uh, Kimbo, tell him I said hello, okay? Tell him Nick said hello. That's very sweet. Is he an Avatar fan by chance? There's a lot of shooting happening. Where, where's it all coming from? I'm guessing they're probably... Are they in the vault? No, they're not. They're going to be coming inside, though, probably, right? Are they outside? They're probably on the roof. Oh, I missed by a... Oh, I hit him, but hit him once. I'm out, I'm out, I'm out, I'm out, I'm out, I'm out, I'm running, I'm running. Then I'm dying. I'm gonna come help you, man. We're gonna wreck your day. Where's the other one at? Is, are they behind this rock right here? There was still one more, right? Or did you get all of them? Did you get both of them, Ben? I think Sokka... You think he was the smartest one, Dilly? I think he was a great tactician. But, like, overall intelligence, I don't know if he was the smartest. 
I think he was the one, he was the most hot-headed that had the best, like, plan. I mean, he was smart in a lot of ways, like, more, more intelligent in some ways, but maybe not overall. Maybe, though. Like, tactician and, like, planning battle strategies. He did ha he did actually come in clutch in a lot, a lot of times. You're probably right in a lot of ways. I think, I think he was intelligent because he couldn't rely on bending to always carry him through fights. I think he, pro that probably was very, very true, actually, now that I'm thinking about it. Like, everybody else could bend, and I think he had to really just, like, use his brain instead of having... He was, like, he was, like, brain bending, and everybody else was, like, uh, using the other elements, you know? I can see where you're coming from with that. I think there's, there's definitely, there's, there's definitely, like, a, uh, there's definitely something to be said about that, I, I think. In the I gotta pers point, at least partially agree with that. You give yourself. That is the meaning of inner strength. I love. Hey, Chrissy, thanks for the super chat. You're so, you're the greatest, Chrissy. In the darkest times, hope is something you give yourself. That is the meaning of inner strength. Iro. Wow, I like that, Chrissy. Have you, I, I went back and looked up some of uh, Iro's quotes from when he was like, uh, you know, from like the show and everything. And I was a kid, so I, I couldn't really process how, how complex they were, but a lot of his wisdom was very good. Like he had a really, a lot of good lines. <laughs> yeah, I think I think Sako was like very underrated, you know. In a, in a show that's about bending and it's about elements, I think having a character like Sokka, who can still be a very prominent character in a universe full of you know Earthbenders and Avatars and Firebenders and Waterbenders, he never felt like he was out of place, which says a lot about his character, you know. I feel like. And like when people look back on like some of the best Avatar moments, Sokka has a lot of the best moments. Christy, I really appreciate you one more time. Thanks for the super chat. I always liked when Iroh would, uh, he would uh, uh, try to give wisdom, but he always used like his tea kettle or like warm tea. As like uh, you know the metaphor or whatever, he always brought his tea into his teachings. I guess in his mind, like tea was a good way to teach people about stuff. I will always. Dilly, are you an un Uncle Iro guy? I'm a, I'm a Paul Levesque guy and an Uncle Iro guy. <laughs> I'm a Paul Heyman guy and an Uncle Iro guy. What about you, Chrissy? I will always be an Uncle Iroh guy. Oh, yeah, his teachings. Exactly. That's actually very... Was that intentional? His teachings? Was that intentional? His teachings? It, was, that the, was that the pun all along? Is that why he was always bringing that up? Bro, I think, like, for all the shows that, like, uh, Nickelodeon either, like, canceled or didn't give enough time to, it's a blessing that they allowed Avatar to be the show that it was, you know? Like, can you, can you imagine if after season one they're like, yeah, we're not, we're not feeling the show anymore, let's just cancel it. Avatar will forever be a legendary show. Fire. Water. Earth. 
Sometimes the best way to solve your own problems is to help someone else. Uncle Iroh. That's actually really powerful. That's really powerful. Wow. That's such a simple, like, idea or a simple... It's not... It's simple words, but it actually is pretty profound. Oh, hell yeah, Sonic. I watched both nights. And I watched some of Monday Night Rock tonight. I thought, overall... I really thought that this WrestleMania was, like... The most entertaining from start to finish. I thought that I think the future of wrestling is like so bright right now. Um, even I'm looking back on Sami Zayn versus Gunther. I'm not so against Sami winning like I was. <laughs> I'm a big Sami Zayn fan. It was kind of nice that Sami won at WrestleMania. And he used the brain buster to win, which was kind of cool. So I'm pretty happy about that. Low key. Dude, I don't even know. It's weird, because, like, when I was a kid, I mean, Toph was always one of my favorites, but now she's for sure my favorite. I never thought I liked grass Pokemon, but now I love grass Pokemon. I never thought I liked Hufflepuff, and now I realize I'm a Hufflepuff when it comes to, like, Harry Potter. So, like, the last, like, five years, I really figured out who I am <laughs> when it comes to, like, fictional universes, I guess. I think Toph solos anybody in the Avatar universe. I'm just kidding. <laughs> I don't think so. <laughs> Maybe, though. She's actually pretty insane. Shelly, I appreciate the hell out of you. I hope, Hopefully, I'll see you back tomorrow. Hopefully, tomorrow I'll see you back. I'm going to stream more of that fish game this week, too. So, you are the best, Shelly. I appreciate the heck out of you. I will, uh, I'll be live again tomorrow. So, so much love to you. I really enjoyed today so much. Yeah, I'm, I'm a Hufflepuff, Rebecca. I thought I was Gryffindor for a long time, but I think I'm actually a Hufflepuff. When I when I played Hogwarts Legacy, uh, everyone here convinced me that I was a Hufflepuff, and I was like, no, I'm not. I'm Gryffindor. And the more that I played the game, the more I realized I probably am Hufflepuff. So I've kind of accept, accepted my fate now. I'm like a really happy Hufflepuff. Like, I feel like I'm really happy being Hufflepuff. I thought I was Gryffindor, though, my whole life. But I think I'm actually probably... I'm probably both in a lot of ways, but I think I'm mostly uh, Hufflepuff. I don't think Gryffindor, like, doesn't fit me or anything like that. I just think, uh... The more I think about it... I gotta stop trying to go for this. I'll take my pistol and be happy. Dude, who would have thought Toph would be holding a Glock in 2024? I'm Toph with a Glock. I'm I'm Toffing off right now. Let's go. Yo, Chrissy, we're Huffle Hufflepuff siblings. You're my Hufflepuff sister, Chrissy. You're my Huffle sis. Why, Rebecca? Where, Rebecca, wh why are you unsubscribing? Because <laughs> I'm Hufflepuff? <laughs> what do you think I am? Unsubscribe? Are you are you Slytherin? Rebecca, you're, you're Slytherin, aren't you? You're going to tell me you're Slytherin. That's my prediction. Unsubscribe? <laughs> I'm a Hufflepuff, and I'm always going to be a Hufflepuff. I'm toughing off right now. <laughs> I'm not so sure about that one. We well, better be. Sh you better be become sure, Lizzie. I'm toughing off right now. I'm toughing off. Oh, that's, that's fine, Rebecca. 
I, I could see myself being Gryffindor too. I respect that. There's a car right above us on the bridge. Yeah, I, re I respect you being Hufflepuff or uh, Gryffindor. I totally respect that, actually. Oh, I gotta pee, guys. It, like the the urge to pee just hit me like a like a brick, like two bricks, like a brick and a half. And there's some good loot down here. I'm gonna I'm gonna grab some stuff really fast. Wait, then where'd you go? Are you on, are you on the Sky Island? No, you're, you're by me. Sorry, I'm blind as hell. God damn it. I can't believe Ben gifted me Toph one more time. Like, I, I seriously can't thank you enough, Ben. Maybe I can snipe some people for you and thank you enough. Oh my god, there's people right here. I knocked him. Hit him. Oh my god, Ben, you're killing it. Oh, I... Oh, wait, did I, did I get both of them? Wait, did I did I did I get both of them or I think I did. Did I just snipe both those guys or did the other guy make it out alive? I like don't even know if I got both of them or not. I think I did. Or maybe the other guy just bled out. I don't know if he maybe just bled out in the other one. I think the other guy may, maybe is alive still. I don't know. That was kind of crazy though. I think he's still alive, Ben sees him, I think. He's probably still over there, right? Behind one of the rocks, maybe. You still over there, Ben? Long ago. Here he is. Yeah, he's still here. Oh, uh, he, he he actually made it out. Oh, I, I didn't Ben, I didn't mean to go in the sky. I'm sorry, man. I, I went in the rift. I did not mean to do that. I'm so sorry, dude. I can maybe snipe from up here though. Oh, I missed him. Oh my god, I'm so sorry, Ben. I'm missing all my snipes. Hit him once. Oh my god, I wanted to hit him so bad. Sorry, Ben. Oh my god, I'm missing all my snipes. I'm missing all my shots. I'm out of bullets. And I'm so sorry, dude. Holy moly. This is so bad for me. There's only 10 people left, too. I'm going to grab your card, Ben. They're going to guard your card, but I'm, gonna, I'm just going to come in and swipe it. I don't care. Oh, I shouldn't have done that. Uh, that, was my, that was a mistake. That was a mistake. That was a mistake. I'm dead. I'm dead. I'm dead. I'm for sure dead. Uh, I'm so sorry. That guy just lit me up like a tree. I don't know what they, they, just, they just had like a uh, rare nemesis. I, I got destroyed. Good job, Ben. We tried. We gave it a hell of a run. <laughs> I'll take six two. Dude, Ben, I promise. I dude, I just appreciate the skin so much. This is my favorite character. I can't even tell you how much that actually means to me, man. I promise we'll play more games together and we're going to get some wins with some avatar characters. It, it just means a lot to me that you'd, you'd even consider getting that for me. So I appreciate you very much. Thank you. I'm excited to play more of this. So much love, dude. I, I want to go see how she looks in my Lego world. Let's let's go check the Lego Fortnite world quick. And then I'll probably wrap my stream up, okay? Oh... I was not expecting to open that. <laughs> it's so nice, dude. Ninja, I love you so much. Oh my goodness. You guys are so nice. Oh, Ben, is that Katara? Oh, you got Katara too, dude. <gasps> dude, dude, Ninja, I want to shake you. I want to shake you right now and just say thank you. I want to shake. Look at how cool she looks in the Lego. Dude, 
I'm a I'm a tough man. I'm always gonna be a tough man. But you're you're saying they fixed the the old world too, huh, Ben? Maybe maybe they made it uh, better for maybe they maybe they fixed a little bit of stuff in like the, like even this world too. So maybe we'll have an easier time like loading in and loading out. Ninja, thank you very much. Um, did I add, I gotta add this? Hold up, can I add this to? Uh, let me go to my locker and to my emotes. I want to check out the uh, where's the new one I just got. Here it is. They have a Lego version for that too. That's so awesome. Okay. I want to load this world up and just see what they, I don't think they really added too much today to Lego Fortnite. So beep, beep, beep. Kieran, I will see you back here later, okay? I'll see you back here later. I appreciate you so much. This has been one of my favorite streams I've ever had in my whole life. Easily. One of my favorite streams I've ever had. All because of you guys. And because that one fish game was pretty fun. That, that fish game was pretty awesome. But besides that, it was all you guys. It was all you guys besides that. So I, I thank you very much. <laughs> and you use code Beacon of Nick. God damn it, Ninja. Thank you so much, dude. <laughs> what a nice guy you are. Wow. There's my tank. Dude, she's so awesome. Oh my god. <laughs> oh, dude, look at how awesome she is. Where's the emote? Uh, do you guys, did they add any more uh, villagers to Lego Fortnite today? Oh my god. I just want to like stomp the ground right now with her. Send like a rock flying up and just like shoot it at somebody. Puff is the best. Fire. Water. And then uh, if you guys didn't see that, that's the lighthouse I made the other stream. So I made a Lego Fortnite lighthouse. So I guess if you guys didn't see it, yeah, that's what I made in this world. I'm really so happy that this turned out so well. I'm going to have to play some Fortnite tomorrow, probably, guys. Anyways, I'm going to wrap it up here. I got to pee so bad right now, so I'm going to call it here for a stream. Uh, I want to thank everybody that's been here today. Isn't she cool? Oh, wait, you had Korra, Ben? I thought, you, I thought you were using Katara. That was just Korra I saw? I thought you had Katara for a second. I didn't, I didn't notice that. Um, I'm probably going to stream some more Fortnite tomorrow. We'll do some Lego Fortnite, and then I'll probably play some Battle Royale. Uh, I have to thank everybody that's that's made the stream today so awesome and so wonderful, and everyone that spent your time with me here. I hope you guys enjoyed my stream. I hope you all enjoyed your time. Uh, no, it, no matter if you guys were lurking for most of it, if you guys were busy if, and you were lurking, it means so much to me. If you dropped a like on my stream, it means so much to me. If you rated me, thank you. If, you, if you're a mod for my channel, thank you for all the help you give me. Uh, if you gifted me anything in Fortnite, I really appreciate it. If you subscribed today, thank you. If you became a member today, thank you. If you gifted memberships today, thank you. If you, no matter how you supported my stream, I, I really appreciate all the support you guys show me. I, uh, I'm going to use the bathroom. I got to make a quick run to the store and then I'll be home in a little while. So, uh, I love you all very much. I appreciate all of you very much. We are, we, we didn't raid anybody last night, but I'm sure as hell raiding today. So let's go raid somebody today. Shall we? Shelby, Mumsy, Rebecca, Autumn, Ladart, Ninja, uh, Earthling. I'm not going to repeat names. I'm so bad at repeating names. Ben, thank you so much. Carissi, thank you so much. Takla, thank you so much. Uh, Lizzie, thank you so much. Shelly, thank you so much. Dilly, thank you so much. Tony, Froggy, Sonic Hedgehog, Guang. Wait, I didn't even see Guang join. Storm Run, Makimbo, uh, Lil Draco. Thank you, guys. We're going to raid. Dude, look how cool Toph is. <laughs> I cannot. I'm gonna. I'm gonna rewatch Avatar just for Toph. All right, guys. I really gotta pee right now, so I'm. I'm gonna raid really fast. It's like hitting me all of a sudden again. Um.
Guys, we're going to go raid Pokeboy today, okay? He's streaming. He's a really nice guy. And it would mean a lot to me if you'd go show him some love with me, okay? I'll drop the link for his channel, and I will catch you all. Uh, I'll be live tonight for sure again, okay? So I'll see you guys back here tonight. I love you all very much. Ta-ta for now. Beacon fan forever. Good night, everybody.
right, guys. I forgot I was still streaming. Forgot I was still live. But uh, we're going to wrap it up here for the night. But before I do, I want to express my overall appreciation for every one of you guys one more time. It's been a hell of a stream. It's been a banger of a stream. And I owe that to all of you guys. I owe it to everybody here. I owe it to everyone that was supportive of my stream tonight. None of you guys had to show up here, but a lot of you guys chose to. Well, all of you guys chose to. It means a lot to me. I have to thank Ben and Ninja again. Ben, thanks for the Toph skin and all the Toph stuff. I got to thank Ninja for the emote again one more time. You guys are so nice for that. And I really appreciate it. So I'll talk to you guys all tonight. I'll be in the Discord and stuff before I go to sleep. But uh, ta-ta for now. Good night, everybody. Get a bunch of rest if you guys are still up for him tonight. Or uh, have a good day today. And then I'll catch you guys back tonight, all right? I love you all very much. Ta-ta for now. Beacon fan forever. Bye, everybody. God damn it, Muck. What the hell, dude? I did not even see that. And I got to thank Muck for being such a wonderful person. Get a coffee on me. <laughs> I will, dude. I'm going to... Uh, I'll get a co I'm going to go get some groceries this morning. I'll get a coffee for tonight when I wake up later. Muck, I love you, dude. That means so much. I will for sure do that today, okay? I'm so grateful for you, man. Like, actually... I can't express my appreciation for you. Thank you. That's very sweet. I'll get a coffee with that for sure. I'm gonna buy like a... I'll buy something coffee related with that. I really appreciate that, Mug. Seriously, thank you very much, dude. GG. I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna get a coffee on you. I'm gonna get a coffee because of you. I'm not gonna put it on you. That'd be weird. I'm not gonna set my coffee on you, Muck. That's weird, man. You want me to get a coffee and set it on you? I'm not gonna put it on you. Hell no. Hell no. Thanks so much, Muck. You're such a nice guy. Lots of love. You want me to get a coffee and then place it on you? Like, no, I'm gonna drink it. I'm not gonna place it on you or pour it on you or put it on you. On you? No, I'll get it because of you, but I'm not gonna put it on you, you weirdo. Such a weirdo. Thanks to the whole metric butt ton muck. <laughs> You're beholden to the <laughs> Yeah, man, I'm bought and paid for. All my lobbyists and donors, man. I'm 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 pretty much uh corrupted. Big pharma. I'm like big pharma. I'm beholden to my lobbyists and I'm beholden to my shareholders. <laughs> Thanks so much, Muck. I appreciate you, brother. I hope your day today is so good, Muck. Lots of love. I'll be live again tonight, guys. Ta-ta for now. Beacon fam forever. Good night.